and welcome to another edition. Today is the Monday edition, and we are back, ladies and gentlemen. I cannot wake up today. I don't know what the deal is. Uh, for some reason, I cannot wake up. What's going on there, Kyle Cup? How you doing there, buddy? You got Paul Gillespie in the building as well. What's up, Paul? Beant, or, oh, I thought Beant was here for, for a second. What's up, Sarah? This is Ryan in chat. Hopefully, everyone's having a great day. What's up there, Sarah? Good to see you. Good to see you. I woke up so late today, chat. Oh, my God. I don't know. It's like one of those. It's like one of those days where you like wake up in the middle of your, like a. It feels like I woke up in the middle of a sleep cycle. Like I was like in the middle of like mid like where your body is regenerizing, chat. And uh, I don't even know if regenerizing is a word. And like I woke up at that point exactly. I uh, guess the baby in the room got you up. Uh, kept you up last night. That's right there, uh, Eric. Yes, it did, buddy. Must be a case of the Mondays. Oh, Peter, don't be saying that there, buddy. I don't. I don't get cases of Mondays, chat. I start on Sundays. Um. So yeah. That's that's where I that's where I get cases up. Uh, what's up there? No names. It sounds like a hangover. I did not even drink yesterday or do anything bad, Chad. <laughs> regenerizing, right? I am regenerizing. Uh, what's up there, Troy? How you doing, everybody? Though, thank you so much for being here. I do appreciate it. Uh, Neil, son of a stink shear, says just finished watching the Yellow Baby stream, dude. I got so many. All right, can we just take a moment to acknowledge the Yellow Baby stream from yesterday? Holy cow! That was probably the best stream I will ever do. <laughs> it was so good. It was so good. The baby possessed you overnight. Might have known it. Yeah. So if you did not watch the baby stream yesterday, um, do yourself a favor. You got to watch the replay, guys. Uh, thank you, Derek. I'm glad you enjoyed it, man. It was so fun. It was so fun. One for the history books. It really was, Ramsey. I, 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 I can't believe how just crazy. That was like the perfect game for this stream, Chad. It really was. Uh, what's up there, Ariel? Doug Myers in the building as well. Says, noon already. Hi, Ryan. I'm Oz in chat. It's actually like 1230. Um, yeah, that was crazy. It was. It was. So, yeah, yesterday uh, pretty much did that. That was a four-hour stream, so that was a long one. Um, it definitely was a must-watch. It was, yeah, at least like the first two hours of it. But even like the even like the second part, where it wasn't even scary anymore, like it kind of turned from a from a horror game into a like a puzzle game, and then it it was still good. Like it was still good, even though it switched gears. Um, I ended up watching the replay. Oh, Chris, I'm glad you did, buddy. Yeah, it was so nuts. So yeah, but today we're gonna pick up on another good game that you guys really enjoyed on Thursday. If you guys remember, this is the last like um, non-scary game that we streamed. This is called Lake. Uh, the one puzzled, that one puzzled. It was, it was very puzzling there, Robert Bryant. Yes, it was there, buddy. But let me, uh, so we're gonna start on Lake. Now, if you guys remember, I'm gonna give you a little bit of rundown on Lake as well. Lake, um, Lake is Lake, okay. You understand? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Lake is Lake, and Lake is a Lake is a hard game to describe because you're a postal carrier, okay? You are a postal carrier at a lakeside town in Oregon. And if you guys remember on Thursday, we 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 tried to do a lot of things. Uh, we tried to get with the lumberjack. The lumberjack was having none of it. Um, we also tried to get with the movie store girl. She was using me for my mail carrier route. Um, and also we tried to get with the guy with the metal detector. He rejected us immediately. We also refused to do work for our job. Um, so we're probably gonna get fired. And also we committed mail fraud by handling a letter without using a stamp. So there's like five things that we did that were probably wrong in this. So yeah, this is probably not gonna go very well, chat. <laughs> uh, what's up there, Doug? We got uh, Dan and Dan as well saying hi to Jared. What's up, Jared? Time to get rejected again. Yeah, <laughs> we've basically been failing in getting rejected uh, the entire stream. Um, Shane says, true life or right? That's a chat. Hey, do I look like a man that gets rejected in real life? Don't answer that. I can't wake up today, chat. Let's take these super chatters, though. We got some super chatters, guys. We got super chatters. We got to thank them. We got super chatters, and we got to thank them. Yes, you do. Yes. Yes, I do. 12 felonies coming for right. That's true, Dan. Yeah, that might be. That might be, buddy. All right. No comments is Nick Cross. Thank you, Nick. <laughs> sometimes. Sometimes, indeed. On more than one occasion. That's true. Jim Fuller, thank you for the generous $2 Super Chats. It's happy Monday, everyone. What's up, Jim Fuller? Welcome, buddy. We got Jared Cope coming in before the stream as well with the $2 Super Stickers. And 
coming soon. We are here now for you, Mr. Jared. Yes, we are, buddy. Yes, we are. Welcome, sir. Welcome. We got Mike Conan coming in with a gifted also. Mike Conan with a one gifted membership. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, buddy. How do I mute this thing? Rise going to Riot Traz. That's true. I got a new mixer chat. I'm still trying to work, learn the ropes on it, guys. So, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much there, Mike Conan. I appreciate it. We got jo Josh Oldham as well with a one gifted membership also. Thank you for the one gifted Josh Oldham. I did not see who got those gifteds. That was like right at the beginning of the stream chat. So thank you so much for dropping those gifteds. Mike and Josh, you guys are awesome. We got Chris Myers coming in with a bomb as well. It says, hey, Potato Lord and chat. What is up, Mr. Chris Myers? Your chat keeps going in and out. Really, uh, Chad, really? Like, like, what do you mean going in and out? What does that mean, uh, Chad? What does that mean, buddy? Anyone else's stream real skippy? Is it just me? No, it is not just you. Ah, that's great. Oh, thank you, Coop. Thank you, buddy. I redid the audio. I redid the audio completely. I 100% I redid it, sir. So it should sound way better than it did yesterday. Yesterday was a mess. It was a mess, guys. But that was the first time I, I, I streamed with it, so I needed to test everything out. Uh, thank you, Ramsey, says uh, Ryan Haggett. I'll go to my end. Really, Chris? That might be a regional thing, then. It could be. That happens with YouTube. In some parts of the country, um, it will sound different. Or it will, it will skip, and some people won't. So, like, it depends on their servers. So there's, like, different YouTube servers um, in different parts of the world, guys. That happens, chat. No problems here. Yeah, I didn't cut out at all. I'm, I'm not skipping any frames. I didn't cut out on OBS. So I don't know what's going on, chat. We got a strong connection right here. We're all good. People just watch all potatoes. <laughs> Maybe, Rick. I don't know, buddy. It could be, man. Thank you, Chris Myers. I appreciate the $20 super chat, buddy. Thank you. I think it's YouTube, though. YouTube does that kind of stuff. Uh, even, like, the weather can affect it, believe it or not. That's true, Brad. You're right, buddy. It is. It's skipping on my end, says Ariel. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry if it's uh, if it's skipping on your end. Those dang CDNs. I know. Those dang CDNs. Shut. Thank you very much there. Dave B as well says, well, he got sacked, or will he... See a professional. Happy Monday, Ryan, and chat. Hashtag vibes. Thank you there, Dave B, for the vibes, buddy. I appreciate the vibes. I love vibes, guys. I love good vibes, and I cannot lie. All you other vibes can't did not. When a woman walks in... Wait, no, we're not talking about that. How do I mute this thing? <laughs> did that mute? I hope that muted. I just woke up. I'm so out of it. I feel like, I feel like I just smoked a bag of... It was skippy for a bit, now it's fine. Oh, really? Okay. All right, good. <laughs> no, it didn't. Okay. I hit the wrong button. I think I hit the solo button. What is the green? What's the mute button? The red button or the green button? <laughs> I, can't, I can't remember, chat. What does this button do? Oh, that's, that's bleep. Okay. Uh, team potato plant. Thank you. Thank you bag of what uh, ba 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 bag of harmless tobacco uh, We got uh, Ramsey Elsh coming in with a five get the bomb. We got Ramsey. Let's get some Ramsey's in the chat. Ramsey Thank you for the five gifted memberships there, buddy. I appreciate it. We got Harry Vanola as well with the five gifted Harry V dropping a five get the bomb. Thank you Harry Vanola. Appreciate the five gifted memberships. You're awesome there Harry V. Thank you so much, buddy. Harry B, thank you for the 50 Swedish Kroner also. It says, happy Monday, Raya, Coop, and Chet, of course. What is up, dude? Hello, sir. Hello. It is so good to see you guys. Guys, you want to play the game? Who wants to play the game? Check ch my voice, take over the mute button. <laughs> That's true. That's true. There is, there is many voices. Uh, and, okay, so let me tell you a little story here, chat. This is like a two-second story. I was playing Call of Duty with Coop and his friends that I'm stealing off of him, and we were we were um we were we were going around with riot shields. Okay, it was four of us going around Warzone and just surrounding people with riot shields. We didn't even shoot them, and then we would just like, you know, beat them to death <laughs> with riot shields. Okay, we were those we were those guys last night, and I, every time we killed somebody. We, I use this voice. I use this voice and I said this, chat. <laughs> I said this. Finish him. And then I would say, once we would kill him, I would say, Fatality. Like on Mortal Kombat. And it was, it was the stupidest thing ever. But it was so fun. It was fun. <laughs> that was my job. 
I was the guy who sat in the back and, and talked all the crap while everyone else did all the work chat. That was my job. <laughs> so that was you, Cedric. That was me. That was me. I was that guy. Mortal Kombat. Yeah. <laughs> I bet that didn't make anyone mad. Probably not there, Nick. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, but it was fun. It was a good idea, chat. <laughs> That's a good story. It was fun. It was a good time, guys. I enjoyed it. <laughs> uh, thank you for the potatoes there, Mr. Chad V. I appreciate it. Just like normal. Exactly, exactly. Um, crap talking, right? I, I don't usually talk crap, Eric, because I'm very, very bad at it. I, obviously, you guys know better than anybody that I am not good at talking. I mean, let's be real here, chat. Let's be real. All right, we're in here, chat. We're in. Cool story, bro. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. It made people very, very angry with me. Okay, so if you guys remember, that's where we left off. Let me give you a little bit of rundown for anyone just shuffle in, in right now. Basically, on the last stream on Thursday of this, um, we started out taking a... We're on a vacation from the big city in a small Oregon town, okay? Um, let's get a couple hashtags, small Oregon. And uh, we also are here to take over our dad's mail route for two weeks, okay? We're about, we're a little about, or I would say we're near halfway through that. Um, we might be at the halfway point. Uh, this game's about seven hours or so. I think we're about three and a half hours in. I don't know, but I take a long time to do things, so maybe I'm not. <laughs> but yeah, so basically we're in a small Oregon town, taking over a mail route for our dad. This is a little bit of a break. We're meeting all kind of people that we used to know, because we, we were from this town, but we moved to the big city, okay? So we're running into all kinds of people. We ran into grannies. We ran into lumberjacks. We ran into old friends. We ran into new friends at the, at the video store. Uh, we ran into guys with metal detectors, farmers, DJs, uh, cops that didn't want to talk to us. So yeah, there's all kinds of people we ran into. Got rejected by everybody. We got rejected by literally everybody. I live in Oregon. That's awesome, Kyle. So yeah. We tried dating a few people. Didn't really work out. <laughs> So yeah, that's what, we're, that's what we're at right now, chat. Uh, we just got rejected by a guy, the Lumberjack. We just got rejected by the Lumberjack. Morning, P.O. How about a pet peeve to start the weekend? Or will it be a positive? Tina Banks has the answer. P.O. positive or pet peeve? P.O. positive? Yeah, <laughs> Troy, oh my God. A beautiful lake and a nice boulevard. Why don't we have one of those... We ran over a granny in a taxi killer. simulator. That's true. I like the idea, Tina. Hmm. Let's take a closer look at today's weather now. <laughs> All right. So we are we are listening to the radio. Um, what's up, Ryan and Chad? What's going on there, Daniel Fry? How you doing there, buddy? All right. We got to... Oh, no. We don't have a package for this place. I keep forgetting that uh, you don't always deliver packages, guys. Ah, uh, Newt, Newt. I know. Can we get a... Can we get a... Um, a rip Newt in the chat, guys? Who misses Newt Ooh, from yesterday? Interesting. You kicked my dog, says Ben. I did not kick my dog, guys. I did not... I would not, I would not ever kick a dog, chat. Um, no wonder my mail is always late, says Josh. That's true, buddy. Yes, that, I am the mail guy. I'm the mail guy. Or lady. Uh, thank you very much there, Mr. Uh, Nick the Bar. Nick the Bar coming in with the generous, generous $20 super chat. Says, good morning, Ryan. What's up, buddy? Thank you for the $20 super chat, my friend. Appreciate you. Thank you so much there, buddy. The, uh, good morning, Ryan. Good morning to you, Mr. Nick the Bar. Always, always appreciate the support, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Uh, we're going to park in the driveway, guys. What's up there, Amber? He says, Meowdy Ryan in chat. Male person. I'm a male person there, Mr. Donald. Yes. I'm going to say it right, guys. I'm going to say it right. I don't want to say things wrong. Happy Monday to you, Spicy Steve. What's up, dude? How are you today, sir? We got uh, Brenna Zanga as well with a $5 super chat. Thank you for the $5 super chat. Guys, which, where are we right now? Do we get the... Vi Whoa, Vintage Street looks like a guitar or something. Or that could be either guitar or a casket. I don't know. I don't know which one it is. Uh, male woman. Yes, I'm a male woman. Um, Spice Steve says hi to Dang it, Dan. Good morning to Amber, says Mr. Logan. Rip Newt. I know, Dan. I'm so sad about Newt there, buddy. I am so sad about Newt, guys. All right, which one is it? Um, Second Street. Oh, yeah, Second Street. Okay, let's get this one. All right, this one is Second Street. Right, remember Police Simulator? I saw someone play it for the first time. It was hilarious. Watch the rage over getting things wrong. Yeah, Police Simulator... That's a weird game, man. I don't really like that game, to be honest with you. <laughs> I'll, be, I'll be honest with you. Brutally honest with you. All right, we're going to ring the doorbell here, chat. Anybody anybody could be at this door. Uh, the address is in the corner. That's true chance. You're right there, buddy. All right, let's ring the doorbell, guys. Thank you very much there, mm. Nick the Bar. I guess nobody's home. Appreciate the love there, buddy. We got Brett Zanga coming in with a $5 super chat as well. It says, it's my birthday, and my only request is for you not to sing, Raya. Brett... Brent, I knew I liked you, buddy. Let's get some 
HBDs in the chat, guys. We need some HBDs in the chat for Mr. Brenazanga. Thank you so much for being here, buddy. And congrats on being born, my friend. You are awesome, buddy. Are those porch pirates on this? I, I don't think there are any porch pirates. We're like in a small town. I'm positive. It's one of those things where like everybody knows everybody, you know? It's kind of like the chat, you know? Like you guys would never like steal my packages, right guys? Right guys? Thank you for the salmon arms chat, I appreciate it. I can't wake up today, guys. I can't wake up. Somebody's gotta wake me up. Do we have any volunteers for anyone to come over out of the bushes and just shake me? <laughs> yes, totally, yes. Nathan would. Nathan definitely would. Nathan, he probably already stole them. He probably already stole my package. <laughs> yeah, never. Hey, Ryan, gaming chair, how is uh, holding the weight of the stream? It is. The gaming chair is holding the weight of the stream there, buddy, today, especially. Oh, crap. I forgot a letter. Son of a stink. Hold on. Uh, I forgot one of the letters in town here, guys. Shave you. No, no, no. Shake me. Shake me. I didn't say shave. Uh, you need a good tasing. I do need a good tasing, guys. I think I need stronger coffee or something. I cannot wake up. Um, how about someone slap you? That will wake you up. I would like that too, Michael Prince. Yes. <laughs> Who wants to slap me, tie me up, or uh, never mind? We won't get into all of that. Troy says shape. No, no, no. Denver said shave me. I meant shape, shape, or not, not shape me. What, what was the word I said? I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember, chat. Are you delivering um, discreet packages? Yes, I am. As a male person, guys, all right, it is my duty to deliver all packages without judgment, without judgment, and that is not the right street either. Uh, this one is just getting some mail here. Um, whoa, this is getting, yeah, it's getting a little weird there, uh, Stephanie. I like it, though. <laughs> all right, let's Here's deliver mail. mail. Michael Peterson says, happy Monday, Ryan and chat. What's going on there, Mr. Michael Peterson? How are you, my friend? Hey, where's my gaming laptop, a laptop at? You're late. Oh, you shouldn't have told me that was in there there, Brett. I might try it out, buddy. You said duty. I did. I did. It is my duty, chat. My duty. Thank you very much, Brenda Zanga. Happy birthday to you, my friend. I will say happy birthday in a weird voice to you. Um, since you requested me not to sing, I will say happy birthday to you. Oh, remind me not to do that again. Whoops. Hitting all the wrong buttons, chat. Hey to the cuffs. <laughs> yeah. I will deliver whatever you need, guys. Without judgment. Without judgment. Eric says mute. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. Um, Denver is laughing at me for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, he, he, he. Hey, butthead said duty. I did. I did. Chip my voice. Happy birthday. No, 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 no. All right. I deprogrammed the chipmunk voice. Maybe, maybe I'll bring it back. I don't know. That, that voice is a little bit, it was a little bit too much yesterday. You guys got a little carried away with it. <laughs> a little carried away. Sad day, yeah. It is a sad day. Uh, he said, don't, don't, and you sing it anyway. Oh, no, no, no. I use the voice, Dan. I use the voice. It doesn't count if you use the voice there, buddy. Okay. Let's just continue along our mail route here. Yeah. Now, here's the problem. Do you guys see a problem here? There is a problem here. Uh, it looks like the dude that rejected me does have a letter today. So, that's not good, guys. Lies, says Nelson. What do you mean there, What do you mean, lies? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. I know what you mean there, Nelson. <laughs> <laughs> yes, lies of deep. All right, let's park here. We're going to um, deliver this package and the mail at the same time here, guys. Problems in the red box. That's true there, Ledgefish. I think I, I think what mail carriers do is instead of driving from house to house, they kind of like walk around the whole neighborhood and deliver all of the mail at once. I'm pretty sure that's what they do, guys. That's lighter than I thought. Okay, so we got our big package here, chat. Look at this. What do you think is in this big package? This is like a big, awkward package. Uh, you'll see... This isn't a bad encounter. Oh, really? It's not a bad encounter? Oh, that's good. That's good, chat. There you go. Taking all the fun stuff away again. Uh, hashtag chipmunk. I did decommission the chipmunk. Yes, I did. But I, I, I'm thinking about bringing it back. Gothmilf energy, may, maybe. We need to meet somebody who doesn't reject us, Daniel Fry. That's what we need to do there, buddy. And I'm sitting here walking in the lawn like an ogre. Let's right, ring the doorbell here, chat. <laughs> Kim's industrial toy. No, no answer. It was like Kim's industrial toy chat. What does that even mean? All right, they didn't answer. They must be busy doing stuff with other things. So, they didn't answer chat. They did not answer. Uh, this is the, this is the running in this game too. This is this is like the full speed here, chat. So Kyle will be very upset when he tunes in today. Thank you very much, there, Mr. Brenna Zanga. Uh, Nick the Bar as well. I appreciate the love, guys. I really do. That's a king. <laughs> king what? 
Brad, what is it? Oh my goodness, sir. Uh, Maureen wants to come out and play. <laughs> Go chat. Look at this rusty mailbox. They need to fix their mailbox chat. Um, no, Matt Miller, do not say that, buddy. Do not inspire the chat, sir. No, 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 no. Uh, shake those hips. We're not shaking hips, chat. We're not shaking hips. <laughs> Denver. Denver's laughing at me for some reason. All right, let's go. Let's go to the dude's house. I'm gonna go to this dude's house there, chat. Eggs are 97 cents at Walmart, says Buckaroo. Is that good or bad? I, I don't know. I haven't... I don't, I don't remember the last time I, like, paid attention to the price of eggs, guys. Is, that, is 97 cents for eggs a good price? I need to know. I need to know. Um, oh my goodness, Nick the Bar. Nick the Bar is coming in hot chat with a five gifted membership bomb, sir. <laughs> no shit. Uh, yeah, it is. Oh, it is? That is a good price. Well, then, what are you complaining about? 97 cents is a good price. Why are we talking about eggs, chat? Thank you very much there, Nick the Bar, for the five. Get the memberships going out to Josh Kalesa, uh, Positive OE, Bruce Bridgers is here with the gifted, and Ray Riggleman and Jeffrey Whalen. Congratulations on the gifteds, guys. Appreciate all you dropping in here, and thank you so much to Mr. Nick the Bar for the five gifted memberships there, buddy. Appreciate it. Good. That is one way to start a Monday there, my friend. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, guys. I have eggs, says Andrew Ignasky. Oh, really, Andrew? Oh, dude. Dude, did you hear the gunshots last night, Andrew? Oh, my God. It was like 5 o'clock in the morning. I was just going to bed. <laughs> uh, where are you going, says Dan. I have no idea. I think I went the wrong way. I definitely went the wrong way. And I don't know what's up here. Dan, how did you know I was going the wrong way, buddy? What's up, Amos? How you doing there, buddy? Oh, you did hear him last night? Yeah. Somebody was popping off last night, chat. They are like five cents a couple months ago, Jason. <laughs> really? Bushwhack and Raya. We can see the map. Oh, yeah, you can see the map. Yeah. I am going the wrong way here, Chad. Where, where does this even go? Uh, watch out for Bigfoot. Yeah, dude, this is Oregon, Mike. That's where a lot of Bigfoot sightings are. <laughs> the Watchtower. Ugh, my old stomping ground. They go to Watchtower! Chad. All right. I know I'm on duty and went the wrong way and wasting company time and getting paid by the hour. And also people are not getting their mail or their packages on time and everyone's going to be upset with me. Also, we probably have a date later, but we're going to get rejected. I don't know if we do, but I think we should go see the watchtower. Should we check out the watchtower, guys? Pew, pew, buddy. <laughs> you went the wrong way. Oh, really, Chad? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. Uh, we already established that, but I, I kind of got to go to the top of the watchtower. I want to see what's going on up here, Chad. Oh, we got an achievement for that. Look at this. Wow. That looks very, very beautiful up here, chat. I like it, guys. Even though the view's a little bit wonky, it still looks really, really nice, guys. Check that out. Sounds like a normal day for the Postal Service. Exactly, yeah, it is. All right, that was fun. Now jump off. You can't... The space bar doesn't do anything in this game, Dan, unfortunately, buddy. Why is the view so messed up? It's like every time I clip into the one of the... One of the beams that like zooms in the view. Romantic cry, and they say I'm not romantic. Chat. Space bar says Amber. No, <laughs> space bar doesn't do anything. Uh, take pictures up there. Oh my God, Danny! We have a camera now. <laughs> Why am I making this motion? Uh, I forgot we have a camera. Yeah, we have a camera now. That's true. I co I completely forgot about the camera, chat. My goodness, what a bozo. <laughs> Yeah, we're supposed to take pictures for somebody, weren't we? Oh man, I only have I only have a few pictures left, so yeah, I don't want to take too many. I only got twelve guys. <laughs> Jared says that's uh, definitely getting clipped. Don't be clipping anything, chat. <laughs> romance riot. Thank you for the romance riot. Appreciate it. I am romantic. Went to Rainier Days in Oregon, where they light off fireworks and can record it, and it's up on my YouTube channel now. That's cool, buddy. That is so cool, buddy. I like, uh, I like, I like fireworks, guys. We remember the fireworks display we put on, except we nuked the entire world. <laughs> Discord says Daniel Fry. What happened to Discord there, buddy? I don't see anything going on in Discord there, buddy. Nothing. Zero. Zilch. Nada. Uh, thank you very much there, Mr. Nick the Bar, for that five get did there, buddy. I appreciate it, sir. Thank you, sir. All right, let's get back down. We're going to get back down here, guys. 
what were what were we supposed to take pictures of? Does anybody remember what we were actually supposed to take pictures of? Because if you guys remember, um, the one girl from the photo hut or something, I forget who gave us the who gave us the camera. Does anyone remember who gave us the camera? Adam McDermott is dropping bozo stickers. Lady in the store wanted pictures. Yeah, but pictures of what? I can't remember what it was, Danny. Or was it just like anything? Just... Jared Cope, that is not that is not what they wanted pictures of. Jared Cope. If that's the case, I'm in deep trouble. Nancy Ragged. The girl one from the grocery store. That's right. Yeah, it's a grocery store, I think. Yeah, grocery store, guys. I think the town. Oh, pictures of the town? I was just taking pictures, like, of people, though. I can't remember what it was. Uh, OnlyFans picks. It wasn't OnlyFans chat. It wasn't OnlyFans, guys. Where am I going? I'm still going the wrong way. I'm supposed to go there. Take pictures of Jeeps, right? Oh, I gotta take pictures of Jeeps? Okay, we'll take pictures of Jeeps, guys. Uh, he has character picked a... Uh, does that... It doesn't really matter, man. It's a game there, Tobias. It doesn't really matter, buddy. I think, I think our character is, is always to Sunday. <laughs> always. Uh, your pink V says James Notes. All right, let's head on in here, chat. <laughs> Picks of cats, diner, being turned into burgers. Um, no, to chat. My God, you guys are being bad. You guys are being bad again. <laughs> Danny Smith, new mic arm. Yes, I did get a new mic arm, Chris. Yes, how did you notice? Did you guys notice my mic arm? How did you notice? Oh my god, am I like sitting weird? I am. Yeah, it, it lights up. I, I am I am a child. Alright, let's just say I'm a child. I am a child, guys. I am a child. I bought a light up mic arm. I'm a 30 not 30 early 30s. Early 30s person. There's the guy that rejected us, chat. He's right there. That guy rejected us on the last stream. <laughs> 39. I am an early 30s man, and I bought a light-up mic arm, chat. <laughs> man, child. I notice, uh, notice your mic to quit, says uh, James Noakes. That was, that was almost a sentence there, buddy. Uh, not childish, it's BA. I like it. I like it, Chris. I like it, buddy. <laughs> Take a picture. Hi, Robert. Yeah. Here's the mail. Thanks, Meredith. And, um, sorry for leaving all of a sudden yesterday. All right. He said, sorry for leaving all of a sudden yesterday. He apologized. He apologized. Your shoes light up. <laughs> Do your shoes light up? You know what? I should get some light up shoes, Daniel Fry. That would be pretty awesome, buddy, okay? It'd be, it'd be a reason to go outside and go walk around, you know? I know I'm not walking around to enjoy nature. I just want to show off my light up shoes. One. All right. Should I say, what was that about? Or no problem leaking roofs don't fix themselves. I don't even know, like, what that means. Um, I should ask what was that all about though? I think we should do one. You guys agree or disagree? I think we should do one guys That's true Chris Castle. You're right, buddy. You're right, buddy. I'm getting all the toys I couldn't afford as a child and still can't afford as a man child uh, Spray him with dog mace. I think we should spray him with dog mace Danny Smith. I agree, buddy. I agree Yeah, leaking roofs Denver. That was almost <laughs> that was almost it one. All right, everyone's saying one. Yeah, what was that about? Yeah, what was that all about? Well, it was just I needed some space. Oh, he needed space. I think space. I've gotten a bit too used to being on my own. They all need space, chat. Um, so should I say, was I such bad company or I know what you mean? Oh, she's getting spicy. I feel like we should commiserate a little bit with him. Because maybe if we, if we, you know, believe his excuses and, you know, just kind of go with it, maybe he'll give me a second chance, guys. You know what I'm saying? Maybe he'll give me a second chance. I think we should do number two and commiserate with him and say, I know what you mean. Yeah, I know what you mean. I think we should go with I know what you mean. A lot of people saying one, but now you guys are popping out with the twos. That's good. Um, thank you very much there, Ballistic Honey Badger, for the nine months. We have a brand new Raya Baby chat. Let's get some Raya Babies in the chat. Kick them in the balls and walk away. I'm not going to do that. He broke it off a little too good. He did. Thank you so much there, Ballistic, for the nine months. As your mic arm brings... Through your truck driving days, truck drivers, more chrome and lights, the better. That's true, Ballistic. That is exactly why I became a truck driver, is so I could put lights on things. You're absolutely right. 
You're you're 100 correct. Thank you so much, there, ballistic. Appreciate the ride, baby, buddy. All right, I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with I know what you mean. I'm gonna say that. I know what you mean. Cool. Thanks. I just don't want you to feel weird about it. I was the weirdo. You were the weirdo. There's nothing wrong with a little weirdness. Oh, or I could give him I could give him an okay. Oh, chat. I I could give him a K. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to give him a K. I don't want to give him a K. <laughs> Everyone's like, dude, dude, give him the K, give him the K. I don't want to give him the K. I want to be nice to him. I want to be nice to him. I, I feel like I ruined things, you know? I ruined things, K. Okay. <laughs> Red box weirdo. Yeah, that's true. Uh, yeah, I don't, exactly, Jonesy. I don't want to be a son of a stink. All right, let's go in. Let's go with nothing wrong with a little weirdness, chat. There's nothing wrong with a little weirdness. I just wanted you to know that. Anyways. Let's see what's in the mail. Uh oh, he's opening the mail chat. The dentist appointment. Wait, why am I sharing that with you? Oh, he just shared with me that he has a dentist appointment. Oh, things are getting spicy now. 15 says Amber. No, 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 no. <laughs> one, 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 one. I don't think uh, that th that goes up to that many m numbers, guys. I don't think it does. It's child support. It could be ch child support. <laughs> it's child support. All right, so maybe you need a, a shrink appointment to answer. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. So I can either say, so no news regarding those apartments, or maybe you need a shrink appointment to answer that. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> wow, this is Allie. Wow. Oh dear. Okay, I think we're gonna go with one on this one. What two seems a little extreme. So no news regarding those apartments? <laughs> Nothing. Hallelujah. That is this so gives mean. me a bit more peace of mind to work on my wild card plan. Wild card plan? Wild card plan? Wild card wild plan. Wild card plan. Yes. Also highly confidential. All right, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna pry here, chat. We're gonna pry. Let's pry into his personal life here, guys. Too is brutal. It is. Oh come on! I won't tell a soul. Yeah, but no. Maybe later. It's still work in progress. Okay. Good luck with that. Thanks. All right, so he's not telling me too many details, chat. He doesn't want to tell me too many details, guys. Details. Not giving me all the details. Uh, he isn't even. Maybe not, Dana. We don't know, buddy. We don't know. That could be. So what was it? What was it? What were you thinking he was talking about with a wild card plan? What does that even mean? Um, why well, was it? We were talking about dentistry, and then all of a sudden it was a wild card plan. I don't even know what that means, guys. What does that mean? <laughs> Chris H coming in with a twenty dollars super chat. Thank you there, buddy. I appreciate it, man. Coming in with a massive, massive support. Also, take his truck. <laughs> we should, Corey. I should have taken his truck. Why did I steal his truck? Thank you so much there, Chris H, for the massive support there, buddy. Says, hello, Mr. Ryan, everyone. It's Kev. I uh, hope today is a great day for everyone. Thank you, buddy. Whoops. Chad, what kind of truck is that? I just wrecked. I just wrecked there, Chad. Thank you so much, Chris H, for the massive support, man. What's, or I'm sorry, Kev. Thank you, Kev, for the massive support there, buddy. Appreciate it, my friend. We are having a good day today, my friend. I hope you're having a good day as well. Thank you so much for the, for the well wishes, buddy. Oh yeah, we gotta go the other way. A dented truck. It's a dented truck. <laughs> we gotta go the other way, Chad. I'm going the wrong way, guys. Thanks. So oh, I should have taken a picture of him. Why didn't I take a picture of him? That would have been proper creepy. It's a square block Chevy. Oh, it's a square block Chevy ham handling. You're right, buddy. What's up there, Paul Guffrey? How you doing there, buddy? Robert Z is dropping the Patrick as well. Uh, what, what did Patrick do? I didn't even see what Patrick did, Chad. Somebody tell me what Patrick did. Thank you so much, Chris H. Or Kev, I'm sorry. <laughs> Kevin, thank you, buddy. Thanks for watching, my friend. Appreciate you. Is this better than Motor Town? This is a completely different game than Motor Town. I wouldn't even compare it. Because this game's like a, more of a story game where you're delivering mail. Uh, Motor Town is more of a story game where you deliver mail. So as you can see, those are two completely different games, guys. Uh, well, she takes rejected well. Yes, she does, Daniel Fry. You're right. Oh, yeah, we got the presents, guys. Oh, gifted! Patrick, you just woke me up, buddy. Patrick got me woken up. <laughs> I almost said something weird there. Patrick, thank you for the waking up. 10 gifted memberships there, buddy. I appreciate it, sir. 
Thank you so much. It was Ram It. It had a ram's head on the hood. Really, Frank Mason? I did not see that, buddy. I did not see the ram's head. Thank you very, very much, Mr. Patrick Rowe. Ten gifted memberships going out to Mr. Shawnee, Corey. Uh, we have uh, Robert Baldwin, Thomas Perto, Trevor K., Charlie Force, Daniel, Ta or Taylor Presti, Michael Stapp, and Iron Horse grabbing up those gifteds. Thank you so much for those gifteds there, Mr. Patrick Rowe. Congrats on the gifteds, everybody. That is amazing. That is 27 memberships today. Holy guacamole chat. I cannot drive the right way today. That is damage to government property for sure. Jeez, oh man, I'm like ramping stuff here. Ooh, this is weird. Chat, is this weird? Is this weird, guys? Let me know if this is weird here. There's a post office box out in the middle of the woods. Should we like go up to the door? Like, where, where's this? Where's this go? Where is this chat? What's Ooh, news? <laughs> interesting. Okay, so where is the house at? Oh, there's the house there. Ooh. Rise of full attention now, chat. I am at full attention, guys. <laughs> Tobias! Tobias! It's Tazen's mail. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, cabin in the woods, chat. Yeah. We should visit this house. Should I take a picture of the house? Chat, what would you do if you lived in the woods and some weirdo was, was coming in and just taking a picture of your house, guys? <laughs> Get out of my swamp. Get out of my swamp. Bigfoot's mailbox. Oh, it might be Bigfoot's mail. Yeah. Could be. Could be. We just don't know, chat. We just don't know. Did that mute, chat? Did that mute, guys? Hopefully you didn't hear that cough. Uh, is that the Unabomber's house? It could be, yes. We just don't know, chat. We just don't know. Thank you very much, Harry V, as well. We got Harry Vanola coming in with a massive 100 Swedish kroner. Thank you, Harry Vanola, for the 100 Swedish kroner, my friend. Yes. Oh, you could hear that? We heard that. No, you didn't. <laughs> no, you didn't. You better not have. Uh, what's up there, Ryan Paul? Let me try that again. Did you hear that, chat? Uh, demonetize now. No, 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 no. I was coughing, guys. I don't... I, I'm trying to get used to my mute button. I got a new mute button. And I'm used to, like, going right towards it. Like, my, my finger... I had, like, me memory finger. Do you guys know what memory finger is? It means when you, your finger remembers things. Um, that's what I had, chat. All right. Oh! Oh, we gotta pick up Lori's movie box! Guys, guys, remind me to, uh, pick up Lori's movie box. I forgot about that. Don't let me go back to the town once we get to the other side. We gotta pick up Lori's movie box, chat. Uh, keep it on mute, says, <laughs> says Daniel Fry. Yeah, you can't say that on TV. All right, should I keep it on mute? What do you mean, perfect? Hey. Hey. Peace and quiet, what does that mean? Truck sounds great, it does, yeah. It sounds realistic, I like the truck sound. <laughs> Peace and quiet. I should probably be quiet during this game. Uh, this game is a very peaceful, enjoyable game, as you guys can see. We can listen to the sounds of the damn chat. Whoa, that is cool. Look at the water. You called us bozos. I didn't call you a bozo there, Tobias. Bliss, it's not bliss, chat. What about this? What if I talk like this? So stick. Freak jump. What the heck? What just happened there? What happened there, chat? Uh, picture time. Oh, yeah, picture. Yeah, we can get a picture. Drive off the edge. Stand like I would drive off the edge. <laughs> chat, do I look like a man that has gone insane from being a postal carrier and drove off the edge of a cliff? Absolutely not. Uh, perfect low voice. Thank you there, Derek. I'm glad you enjoyed it, buddy. I'm glad you enjoyed it. It won't let me get up on the sidewalk for some reason. I'm gonna let me do that. Uh, yes. <laughs> no. Maybe. All right, let me take a picture. There we go. We got six pictures taken. Uh, the wife's voice in the... That's the wife's voice in the morning. Oh, Daniel Fry. Daniel Fry, you keep saying things like that. She's not gonna be your wife for much longer there, buddy. <laughs> Daniel Fry... Yikes. Uh, like the sound of a V8 Metro van in the wild. Yes. Alright, we have a marker over here too, guys. I don't know what this marker is. Where's this marker? 
I'd say it's likely, yes. I remember Dad telling me, Meredith, the picnic area is for the older kids. I think I was 17 when I had my first actual picnic here. Chat, there's people here. It's a nudist camp. It could be a nudist camp. We just don't know, Chad. We'll find out. Hey, how are you? I may have mail for you. Guys, tap the Is like button. Get those likes on the board. Mickey or June? Or both? Uh, to both. Here you go. Why am I standing there? Oh, sweet brother Damien, savior in the hour of darkness. Never mind him. He's a bit stressed out. What? We were a bit low on paper. Nice to meet you. Low on What's papers? I'm Meredith. Nice to meet you too. Woo! L low on paper? What? Whoa, wait a second. Hold the, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Did he just take the mail and use it to wipe his ass? <laughs> he just wiped his ass with the mail. That's what I was thinking originally, Danny. Uh, Danny, originally I was thinking rolling papers or something like that, but <laughs> I don't think that was it. What kind of papers? That's my question there, Eric. That's my question. That's exactly what I want to ask him. <laughs> probably just junk mail. Probably, yeah. Probably. <laughs> All right. Good man. All right. So what should I ask, chat? What should I ask? Drop it in the chat. Uh, guys, make sure you get those likes on the board, though. We do have 100 slackers in here. Make sure you tap the like, guys. Thank you so much, everybody. TP for us. Uh, yeah. Um, Chris Copeland, thank you for the five dollars super chat, my friends. Is bring back the chipmunk voice. All right, I might bring it back. We'll see. We'll see, chat. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes, guys. All right. Thank you so much, Chris Copeland. <laughs> Appreciate it, buddy. We got Mike Conan coming in with a five dollars super chat. Also says, "I didn't know the post office hired ex Swift drivers." Thank you, Mike Conan, for that, sir. Never heard a Swift joke, my friend. Yes, I didn't. Thank you very much, Mike Conan. And Sean Davis with that ten months. Thank you for the ten months. Says hello, Ryan Chad. Hopefully everyone's having a good Monday. Happy to be able to make it onto a live stream today. You are very much welcome here, sir. Thank you very much, Sean Davis, for the huge ten months. Harry V as well with the number one fan super sticker. Thank you, Harry Vanola, for the number one fan. Dropping the gloves, Mr. Harry V. Thank you, buddy. Okay, let's do a chat. Toilet, Toilet paper? paper? Toilet paper. Probably a bit of cash and some rolling paper. Looks like my original thought was correct here, chat. That's true, Rick. I did say that. Ah, that kind of paper. <laughs> Oh, looks like they get into the tomato plants in this game, chat. We thought it was a nice, safe game, didn't we? <laughs> Should I ask what rolling papers are? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't. No, nah, I know what they are, so I'm going to say number one here, guys. Ah, that kind of paper. <laughs> um, no harm in that or leave. <laughs> Maybe I could get in on this. Think we gotta go with number one on this one, chat. Definitely. No harm in that. Amen, sister. Thanks for the delivery. You're welcome. Uh, all right. I'm gonna keep talking. <laughs> leave. Just leave, Fair Marrow. Hot box, the RV. No, 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 no. Okay, so are you guys on vacation? Nice RV, by the way. Is it yours? Okay, what do I ask him, chat? How do I keep this conversation going? How do I get into their party, chat? Uh, thank you very much, Andrew Shell, for the 11 months of support. Also says, good morning, Ryan and Chet. Good morning to you, Mr. Andrew. I appreciate it, buddy. Number two. Okay, I want to say number two. All right, we're going to give him number two. Nice RV, by the way. Is it yours? Okay, let's do it. Andrew, thank you for the 11 months, buddy. Appreciate the love there, sir. Thank you so much. Vacation says tapas. Really tapas? Is that what you think there, buddy? Oh, you guys are saying number one now. Okay, number one. Okay. Now, I'll ask number one. Now, you guys are saying uh, number one. So, are you guys on vacation? Sort of. Although, I guess you need a job for a vacation. Joan! Can you get in here, please? Now! Oh, that's my cue. It was nice meeting you, sweet Meredith. Can you, like, not tell the authorities your whole life story? The authorities? <laughs> he thinks I'm an authority? I like this place. We're coming back here, chat. They got any leavings out here? Where's the leavings? You got any leavings? What's in that cooler? What you got in that case? Mm. 
You're a fed. I am a fed. <laughs> Michael Rodriguez. <laughs> Taking a picture of the lake. You, all right, back me up on this chat. I was obviously taking a picture of the lake when somebody's underpants flew into my frame. Obviously, right, chat? Right, guys? Right, Jordan Brown? <laughs> Sorry, Eric. Sorry. I was taking a picture of the lake. You guys know that. Pervy, right? I'm not per. That's not pervy, guys. All right, come on now. I was taking a picture of the lake. They happen to hang their undies up right in the way of the frame. I, I yeah, uh, uh, no, <laughs> stalker, I'm not a stalker, I'm not a stalker. Can't defend that one, right? I'm defending that one, chat. Yes, I am, guys, I'm defending it. That was weird, it was Chris Muncher, you're absolutely right, buddy. It was very weird. Uh, waste, up, waste up pictures only, exactly, chat. All right, let's, um, let's continue our journey here. And what we're gonna do is we're going to, we have a couple things left on our, our map here. I believe we delivered all the mail. Yes, we did. We delivered all the mail chat. Um, let me remove this waypoint. How do I do that? X, okay. Um, we have to get over and return those videotapes. We gotta get, check out those videotapes, guys, okay? Ah, uh, smells like, oh, geez, Pete's sweet though. No, it doesn't. 9.61 on the creeper scale, sorry. Lies all lies is here, or Sarah. I'm sorry, Sarah. Don't lie to the chat, this is I would never lie to the chat, guys. Uh, thank you, Andrew. I appreciate it, buddy. Good morning to you, man. Thank you for the 11 months. And Chris Copeland, Mike Conan, thank you, guys. All right. I think it's time we have this conversation. Actually, no. Let's not have this conversation, chat. We'll have this conversation after we deliver this last piece. Did you rewind? We're, we're going to ask the lady. So, so what happened was, if you guys remember, let me give you a little bit of backstory here. If you guys remember, uh, the girl that that we were dating from the video store that we went on a date with, or we had her over our house and rejected me, she wants me to run around town, okay? And she wants me to deliver videotapes, like as a sample pack, on my mail route. And I did say that I would do it. Uh, she's a VCR hustler, yes. So, <clears throat> we're currently going around uh, to random people in the town, basically, and delivering them videotapes. And then we're picking them up later, afterwards. So that's what we're doing right now. We're picking up videotapes uh, from the girl at the gas station that we uh, delivered them to, chat. So that's what we got going on right now. You weren't dating, you got used. I got used, hey, yeah, Marcus. Did you, you watch used, the buddy. love bug? Hey, Miss W. Yeah, I did. Here it is. It wasn't the best. So she didn't like the love bug chat. I told her I couldn't deliver videotapes. Now, <clears throat> every time I get in, she gets mad at me. Really? Oh, really? That's interesting. That's so funny, chat. So you, oh, there was a truck back there. Did you see that red truck? That's pretty cool. Uh, that's too bad. I would hope you liked it, or you can say you loved it, guys. We're going to go with number one on this one, William. You don't have to hide it from me, Lori. You can say you loved it. I mean, it wasn't a total spaz, but it definitely wasn't my kind of movie. For sure. There's always plenty more movies in Angie's video rental shop. Have well, a nice I day, a Lori. Stuff. I am Chris. Exactly. You too, Miss W. All right, that conversation <clears throat> did not go super well. Okay, she's using her little wrench, so we're going to leave. All right, so we got the videotapes, guys. Let's bring them back to the store. So we're going to bring those back to the store chat. Let's do that, guys. We're doing all the dirty work. Spaz Rise at it again, says Kellen. We're not at it. We're not at it, chat. Uh, but I am doing um, a little bit of a illegal stuff. Yes, I am, guys. We're using our mail route illegally, chat. Against the law. Ah, uh, Spaz, you're out. Oh, Jesus! You saw it, chat. He came into my lane and hit me. You saw it, right, guys? You saw it. It's more like adult-themed films. No, no, it isn't. It's not adult-themed films. <laughs> Focus try. Sorry, Jack. <clears throat> there was a truck there. There was, Harry B. That was your fault, buddy. <laughs> was that Nathan? It could have been. That did look like a, uh, that did look like a, a uh, CR England truck, didn't it, Chat? <laughs> Workman's comp. Your fault, says Michael. That wasn't my fault, guys. Guys! All right, let's deliver these videotapes back. Uh, sun was in your eyes. It was. Oh! I didn't know we had a horn. Oh, this game just got, like, ten times better, chat. All right, we're at the Bean Shack. Let's hop on into the Bean Shack here. This is the Bean Shack, guys. 
Uh, no, it wasn't Wreck. Uh, definitely wasn't Nathan. No. <laughs> All right, let's return these videotapes here, chat. We gotta return these videotapes. What a what a little what a little son of a stick. I can't believe she's using me to do her dirty work, chat. There she is. That's Hi, Angie. Oh, hey. So hey, I dropped off and picked up those movies. Right, right. Why is she being all short with me? Why is she being short with me? Starring Maureen and the Lumberjacks is right. <laughs> oh my god, buddy. <laughs> Listen, if you're busy, I can come back later. Uh, she seemed positive. I think it might actually work, which is a lie. Um, is everything okay? You don't seem your usually peppy self. All right, let's ask her if everything's okay. Let's do it. Is Thinks everything weird, okay? You don't seem she your usual see the peppy self. <laughs> you don't know me, Meredith, okay? This can be a stressful job. What a little... I don't want to say what I really think, okay? Uh, number three. Yeah, that was that was a bad answer. Uh, whoa, I just did you a favor. Okay, I'll leave you be. All right, do we do we engage in this tussle here? I think we should engage in this tussle here. Whoa, I just did you a favor. Whoa, I just did you a favor. Throw shots. We're throwing shots. I'm throwing shots back. I'm throwing shots back, chat. Yeah, engage. All right, we're gonna engage, chat. Yes. Oh, easy there. I just did you a favor. Remember? Yeah, uh, actually, now's not a great time. There's two more movies on the counter. If you could deliver those, that'd be peachy. Hmm. Jaws and <laughs> The Dirty Dozen. One Swedish kroner. <laughs> One Swedish kroner. Um, Jaws and The Dirty Dozen. Haha, <laughs> be best not to mix these two up. I'm on it. Don't you worry your pretty little head about it. Or change my mind not doing it. Oh my goodness, chat. Oh, oh. All right. So we have a chance to stand up for ourselves here. Okay. I kind of want to still do it because I'm a pushover. I am a doormat, chat. Okay. In real life, I am a doormat. All right. But in game life, I may want to stand up for myself. You know what I'm saying, guys? You know what I'm saying? Why am I doing this hand gesture? This hand gesture is not at all conveying the things that I'm saying at all, chat. Ah, uh, screw her. You think we should go with number three? All right, all of the chat is saying number three. I think no spine, no spine Raya. Chat, let's get a couple hashtag no spine Raya. I think we should go with number three. The chat is definitely on the same page uh, in saying we should go for number three. Okay, poll time. No, 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 no. This is an important thing here. I think that she's probably never going to talk to me again if we go with number three. So yeah. All right, let's go with number three. <clears throat> On second thought, I still want to see where this goes. <laughs> so I think I'm going to make, I think I'm going to take the easy way out of any hard situation and just make a uh, nervous joke about it. The, the most spineless answer. <laughs> I'm going to go with the most spineless answer. No, 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 no. One works. Uh, nope. Everyone's saying no. You probably tell the authorities and you will get in trouble. That's true, Chad. You're right. You might be right, buddy. Probably smart. Gutless riot. Doormat riot. Denied. Uh, number three. Okay. All right. I'll go with number three. Chad wants me to go with number three. Doug says number two. Um, I think we're going to go with number... Yeah, let's go with number three. All right. You know what? I've changed my mind. I'm not doing it anymore. Fine. It was a stupid idea anyway. Now, if you'll excuse me. Bye. That did not go well. N none of that went well at all. Oh dear. <clears throat> oof. <laughs> Chat, what is the oof meter at? If there was an oof meter on a scale from one to oof, how much oof was that conversation? Oh, cold as ice. That was so cold. Oh, key gone. Oh yeah, key your car. Key your car. Frank Mason. Oh my god. Oh my god, Frank Mason. We should key your car. Uh, oof. That was the biggest oof in gaming history. Don't let the door hit you. Oh man, she'll never talk to me again. Chat off the charts. That was an off the charts oof. 
Frank may date you. Frank might date you, but isn't Frank my dad or something? I forget who Frank is. <laughs> uh, here comes prison. <laughs> here comes prison. Uh, what did Holly say? I didn't even see Holly's call that. What did Holly say? Oof AF. Yeah, oof, uh, oof off. <laughs> hey, Em, it's me, Kay. <laughs> wow, I just, like, instantly dialed your parents' number. Superpowers! <laughs> Probably just muscle memory or something like that, right? Or... Maybe it's like that thing where you smell something and it instantly triggers this mega old memory you didn't even know you had. Who's you know this? I mean? Oh man. Who's Kay I Evans? I don't remember her. Mary bought me lilacs and the smell instantly mentally teleported me to when I was like six years old and fell out of a tree. And I ended up with all this lilac smelling tree gunk all over my face. You remember that, right? What if it's like that with old phone numbers? You go, must dial M, and then your brain just triggers your fingers to dial? Man. Anyway, oh, that's right, my I uh, did call yeah. about that, obviously. I was thinking of maybe taking a stroll around the lake this Sunday, clear my head, and then Maureen suggested... Best friend growing up, like thank you. Along. Not that I'm asking because of Maureen, of course. Just thought it might be fun to check out the old hangouts and the lake sites and all. If you do want to join, I'll be at the watchtower overlooking the lake at 11 a.m. Sunday. I'll probably hang around a bit, so I'll see you when I see you. Sunday morning watchtower. Yeah, she married the quarterback. Bear, or or quarterberry. They called him quarterberry, chat. Yeah. So she wanted to hang out. Uh, now, <laughs> now here's another thing. Should we decide to meet Kay? I mean, one door closes. You know what they say, chat. Every time you close a door, you open a, a can of Starry. Or I forget what the saying is. But you guys know the saying, right? M.O. is mob owned. Really? Uh, meet up, you son of a saying. All right, let's meet up with Kay. Yeah, yeah, we'll meet up with Kay. Let's do it, guys. Meet her. All right, we'll meet her. The Let's Countess meet and the Carpenter? <laughs> really, Mom? Door closed, oh, well, yeah. Let's give it a read. The Countess and the Carpenter. Chapter 1. A more disastrous entry to her new home what was is scarcely if you see imaginable for Cecilia oh. Shulman Rao. The left wheel oh. of her carriage oh, collapsed you got me. right as she entered through the gates of the magnificent Raubenstaben estate. She tumbled upside down, hurt her head, and worse. It's like the narrator her from uh, Super Lim Or what was that game, Mom? Oh she my god, what was that game chat? Strong voice but Stanley of a Parable. Man. Are you all right, madam? It was the narrator from the Stanley Parable chat. Thank you for the laughing faces, chat. Oh my god. I can't believe I fell for that. You sons of stinks. All right, so now we're on our computer. Add it 87. We're doing all of our uh, work from work chat. Almost forgot how relaxed life is here. There is so much space. Or no, we're writing, a, we're writing something. What are we writing? Look at that computer chat. Right, I got caught. I did. <laughs> I did chat. Give her friend my number, says Daniel. So far, I've delivered quite a few packages and letters. Even a living creature. Yes, we did. I wonder what next week will bring. Uh, give her friend my number, says Daniel. Uh, but not before ending this week, meeting an old friend. Aw, that's, that's a letter of resignation. <laughs> no, it isn't. So we, we just completed our first week of work, guys. That is exciting. It's a letter to Playboy. No, it's not a Playboy letter chat. It is absolutely not. All right, so hey what we're doing, chat? M, up here. Meeting our Aya. friend Kay. Should I just come up? Come on up. You just have to watch your step on the third leg. Should be good. Okay, what did she say? I, I, I didn't see what she said. And now I'm asking, uh, I have to what on the what now? I'm sure I should, I'm not sure I should be climbing onto a broken tower. I completely got what you just said and I'm coming up. <laughs> I don't know what she said. Should I lie and say number three? Uh, jump. I'm not even on the tower, Welsh. <laughs> oh my God, Welsh. Dear penthouse. We're not sending penthouse letters, chat. No, we're not doing that. Okay. Let's continue our journey here. Number three. All right, Leah, number three. <laughs> Full set. I completely got what you just said, and I'm coming up. <laughs> Pee on the third step. Um, all right, should I say hi there? Good to see you. Woo, I made it up in one piece. Or is that third the third step, right? Surprise, no one fixed that. Oh, the third step was broken. I got you. Something about the third step. Okay. Um, I'm going to talk about the third step here. It's that third step, right? I'm surprised no one's fixed it in all these years. <laughs> So glad Daniel. you made it. Isn't it nice up here? Me too, old man. All right, it sure is that view. It gets me every time. Brings back the memories, doesn't it? Or it's a bit different to how I remember it. Um, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say the nice thing because I don't want to re get rejected for a fourth time. 
As you guys know, I've been rejected three times in this game. Let's let's see if the fourth time is the charm. Uh, maybe bring back... You know what? You guys are saying two. All right, we're going to go with the chat's decision of two. Bring back memories, doesn't it? <sighs> yeah. Brings back memories, doesn't it? Any memory in particular you're thinking of? After school, talking about whatever we felt like. Coming up here by myself at night. Nothing really in particular. <laughs> yeah, number. I think we got to go with number one here, chat. Let's do it. Those times we took some pie up from the diner after school and sat here talking about whatever we felt like. Oh, <laughs> yeah. How about that afternoon I snuck in some beers from Uncle Stan? Beers? They were really disgusting. And you puked all over the rail? In fact, wasn't it kind of where you're standing right now? Oh my gosh, it totally was. So apparently we snuck beers up here and puked, chat. Oh my goodness. No wonder she married the uh, Quarterberry. Uh, ooh, you, do you have to bring that up again? I was not, I don't recall. I'm going to say, I'm going to say I, it was not. Uh, what, what do you guys think I should say? What do you guys think I should say here? Uh, number one, you guys are thinking number one, Tobias? Maybe number one? Uh, you guys got to get me a date. I made my own decisions last time and screwed it up, chat. Number two. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with number two. Number two seems playful. Hopefully she plays say, says this in a playful way. Hold up. I seem to remember it was closer to where you were standing. Whoa. Like exactly where your hands are now. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> glad you're back. I kind of missed having you around. That was weird. Um... <clears throat> so much has happened since then, or such a catty conversation. It is a catty conversation, chat. <laughs> All right, I'm going to say I'm going to feel I feel the same way. I feel the same way. <laughs> frisky. It's getting so, frisky. So what's life been like for you since you left? Positives? Negatives? You know, I went <laughs> I to university, well. got a job. On the whole, it's been really good. I basically worked my butt off the entire time. Or, and maybe now it's time for something different. I think it's time for something different. Do you guys think it's time for something different? Get the cowboy ready in case any... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Might need some, uh, might need some sad cow or happy cowboy. I should get a happy cowboy, Dan. Uh, number three. Yeah, I think it's time for something different, chat. We get out of that big city. We come live in Oregon with all these, uh, yokels, And chat. maybe now it's time for something different. Yeah. Is it now? Providence Oaks different enough for you? Well... Maybe it is, and maybe it isn't. Ooh, that sounds juicy. <laughs> is this about something or someone? I feel like this question's answer is very, very important to the rest of the story here. Chat! <laughs> Why do I get so excited? Is my life this bland where these simple questions of these video game characters are all I have, chat? Yes. <laughs> uh, thank you so much there, Mike Monkey, for that 11 months there, buddy. Okay, so the answers are that's for me to know and, and me to find out. I'm glad we can have these adult conversations now. Or lay off, chat. Lay off, guys. Uh, gotta go Cable Guys here, says Terry. <laughs> all right, sounds good. Cable Guy. Uh, let's see here. Patrick says three. Dan says two. Honestly... I think we should go with number one. Um, I don't know. Number one seems like the secretive, mysterious answer. Nobody's saying number one except for Damon, guys. Uh, but number two, that, that, yeah, number two is probably the best thing to say. I would, I would say I'm, gl I'm glad we could have these adult conversations now. That is probably the best thing to say, chat, yeah. I'm going to go with the chat on this one and go with number two. I'm going to go with number two, chat. They say video games cause violence. Here we are trying to figure out the best responses not to hurt NPC's feelings. Exactly, Legion. I'm glad we can have these adult conversations now. Oh, there she goes with the crazy eyes. M still stands for mind your own beeswax, I see. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. I'm backing off. That was the wrong answer. <laughs> you steered me wrong. We should have went with number one. She said she's backing off. I don't want her to back off. I want her back on. 
Uh, thank you so much there, Mr. Mike Amaki, for the 11 months. Mike Amaki coming in with 11 months of support. Thank you for the 11 months there, Mr. Mike Amaki. Says, totally forgot to update my credit card. Cool that I got it gifted. Well, I'm glad you got it gifted, Mr. Mike Amaki. Thank you very, very much, my friend, for the support, buddy. One way or another. Uh, 33333 says John Brown. Okay, so what about you? Did you end up going to college? What about you? How have you been? I mean, really? Um, or would you mind if we just sat for a bit? I, I kind of like... I don't like if we just sat. No, I don't want to just sit for a bit, guys. That, that's, like a, that's like a dismissive thing. We got to continue the conversation, chat. Uh, why are you guys all saying number three? <laughs> I, yeah, I, feel like, I feel like we should go with number two here. Definitely, like, try to dig into her brain a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Reject riot times four. <laughs> it's, about, it's about to be the fourth rejected. Two. Okay. All right. Now everyone's saying two. All right. Let's what go about two. you? How have you been? I mean, really? Really, really? It's been great, and it's been tough. You know, I guess it's like that for everyone. What a general I mean, response. I wanted to go to art school, yes, but turns out I wasn't good enough, or at least that's what they told me when True I applied. True fair, So I decided to stay and do my own thing, make music, perform and stuff, you know. I picked up some shifts at the diner, Barry and I reconnected, we got married. Oh, enough and then with Max the Barry. You haven't met him yet, have you? He turns 13 in a few months. Time flies. Anyway, having Max gave things a different rhythm, but I still continued with my music. Even managed to get a bit of a buzz going in Portland. Lined up a few interesting a buzz? Gigs. Tough to balance, but fun. All right, maybe we should have just sat for a while. You're right. Ah, uh, she's married. What a waste of time. She's married, wah, wah. I mean, wah, wah, though, you know? All right, anyways, uh, and then, <laughs> and then. Sounds exciting. Sounds like you're ready to leave uh, PO at that point. Um, maybe I should say sounds exciting. Or I kind of want to go with and then. <laughs> Home wrecker Raya. Home wrecker Raya, Chad. I would never. I would never. Uh, number one. I think we should go with number one. Harry Vanola wants me to go with number one. Harry Vanola knows what he's talking about. Riff. <laughs> okay. And then. And then. Yeah, just like that, Aww. Uncle Stan got sick. Hit him and Aunt Mo like a ton of bricks. It was crushing. There I was. I should have not to said and then. With my music, but I just couldn't let them down. Now she's getting so all I sad. Stayed. Helped out nursing Uncle Stan. Picked up his shifts at the diner. Sounds like you really stepped up. Where was Barry and all the? Oh, should we throw the husband under the bus? <laughs> <laughs> Chat, we have a chance to throw the husband under the bus. Make ourselves look good. Even though I was gone too. <laughs> Jason White, stop it. Stop it. I can't imagine having to make those choices. All right. So which one do we go with here, Chat? One, two, or three? Sounds like you really stepped up. Where was Barry in all this? I can imagine having to make that choice. <laughs> do it through the husband. <laughs> this could go two ways here. All right, let's let's throw the husband under the bus. <laughs> we got to do it. Where was Barry in all this? Barry was actually really great. Ah, dang it. We divided tasks back at the house, and he took Barry care was a good of Uncle Stan when he could. No questions asked. He was just there. Sounds like you really stepped up. I can imagine making that choice. All right, so the husband was there, Chad. He was a good husband. Son of a stink. <laughs> Get those likes on the board. Chat, tap that like. We're almost at 300 likes today already. That is insane. Barry sucks. It sounds like he's good, though. Back to the save, yeah. All right, let's go to the save. <laughs> go back to the save. I can't imagine having to make that choice. Sounds like you really stepped up. I'm going to go with one. We're going to go sounds with like one. Sounds like you really stepped up. Yeah, well, in good. hindsight, it was a lot. In the moment, though, you don't stop to think. You just do it. And now you still work at the diner, and what now? Do you ever feel stuck? Ooh, this is an interesting question here, chat. Do you ever feel stuck? Cause that's trying to get something out of her, you know? I think number I think number three might be good. And now you still work at the diner, and what now do you feel stuck? I think we should go with number three. I agree, Chad, I agree. Do you ever feel stuck? Well, Mo has offered a couple of times to put my name above the door at the diner. Wow. Up until now, it felt like too much. Too soon. Too definitive. Too soon. But, yeah, too soon, Chad. Maybe too if soon. Maybe she asks again, I'll think about it. 
The way things ended up, it may not have been part of my master plan. But I got to spend some of the most precious moments of my life with the most precious people I know. Got to say goodbye to Uncle Stan and be there for Mo. They basically raised me. I'm grateful I got to do that for them. And I built a family of my own right here in good old P.O. And one day, those kids will hurl all over this rail, just like we did. (laughs) 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 (sighs) So, yeah, it's been tough. But looking back, I wouldn't trade any of it for the world. All right. Do we say, that's so great, Kay? I'm so sorry I wasn't there. I don't know what to say. (laughs) What do we say, Jack? What do we say, guys? That's so great, Kay. I'm sorry I wasn't there. I think we should apologize for not being there, honestly. Because I do feel bad that I wasn't there. Um, I think that is the best way into her. I mean, right into her heart. Um, there we I'm go. So We're going to go with number I two, wasn't chat. There. I don't want you to feel sorry. We all have our own lives to live, right? Aw, that was a nice response. I mean, I guess you could have done more to keep in touch. That was not a nice really response. kind of a turd in that respect, I have to tell she you. She called but me a turd! That's life, right? It's in the past. I'm just <laughs> glad you're here, right now, looking at the lake with me. It's good to know it's never too late to make new memories. Amen to that. She I'm called me a turd! at least one of us grew up to be a well-rounded individual. I'm not going to get Is over that. Is there a manual I can borrow? Well, after you left, I had to raise myself, didn't I? <sighs> so... Ready to descend to the Katie's world below? Off, off. Um, yeah, it seems like it's time. No, I think I'll stick around and enjoy the view some more. I think I'm going to stick around and enjoy the view, chat. She wants to leave. <laughs> I'm going to stick around, though. There we go. I'm going to stick around. Nah, I think I'll stick around. Enjoy the view some more. See, chat, remember, she knows your nickname. The view from the top of the ivory tower. Be careful not to get too used to it, young lady. Hmm. Okay. Thanks for the invite. I'm glad I came by. Just... Try to cut down the word count on the answering machine next time, would you? Oh. <laughs> oh, you better buy yourself some new tapes for your machine, Weiss. Just kidding. <laughs> you know how I get when I get nervous. Thanks for joining, Em. This was good. All right, we had a good interaction. A good... That's the first good interaction. What did William say? William says that's a turn every time you heard that today. <laughs> that's the third time you've heard that today. It is. We had a Hello? good interaction. You are speaking to Monster Deal Central. How may I help you? Oh, this is my boss, chat. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We just called the boss. Why did we call the boss? Why did we call the boss? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right. This is, our, this is our big city job, chat. Not the postal boss. This is the big city job, guys. All right? Guys, drop those. Uh, drop some random stickers in the chat. We need some random stickers in the chat. All right. So what do we say to the boss, guys? Uh, hey, Steve, you're in a good mood? Oh, hi, Steve. Oh, sorry, I'm not interested in telemarketing. What do we say to him, chat? So I think maybe, are we in telemarketing? Maybe that is like my thing. That might be my thing, chat. That might be my thing. Hold on, I gotta reload the chat. Chat froze again on me. Is chat frozen or are you guys gone? I don't know what's going on here, chat. Uh-oh. Okay, my chat is completely frozen. So if you're saying something, I do not see it, chat. Why is my chat frozen? What's going on with YouTube right now? Oh, let me look on my phone. <laughs> All I see is Tobias's comment that says success. What is happening right now? Dang it, chat. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right, it just came flowing in. It just came flowing in, chat. Yeah, it cut out for a while. Yeah, chat froze. Chat did freeze, yeah. Chat was front. Oh, no, now it's pouring in. Now it's just pouring in. <laughs> it's open now. There it goes. Yeah, we need to give it a little kick. It was like, it was frozen. And we were just like, yeah, ow, ow, oh. Chat, don't let me kick. I'm in my early 30s. Do not let me kick. Do not, do not let me kick, guys. <laughs> uh, you broke the stream. I did. <laughs> we broke it. All right, we're good. We're good now. Okay. All right, here we go. Z, 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 says R2. Okay, so now what we're going to do is, hey, Steve, you're in a good mood. Oh, hi, Steve. I'm sorry I'm not interested in telemarketing. All right, what do we do, chat? You just pulled a hammy. I think I just pulled a hammy, guys. Um, One, two, or three. I think we should go with number three. I want to quit my job. I do want to quit my job, guys. Early 30s, my butt says drunk holly. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You guys don't believe me. Number three. Okay, let's go with number three. I don't. I, I think I want to quit just right off the bat here, chat. I'm sorry. I'm not interested in telemarketing. Meredith, silly, it's me, Steve. 
please. Oh. Tell me to calm down. We are so close to a Never mind, deal. that was a joke. Added 87 in shops all across America. M -m 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 monster deal. Okay, so I totally misread that. I thought that I thought I that was my job and I thought I was quitting it, but that was a joke. So I didn't quit my job. <laughs> okay. I didn't quit my job. Chris Copeland, thank you for the 99 cent peach super sticker. Appreciate the peach there, Chris Copeland. That is a beautiful peach you got there, Mr. Chris Copeland. Thank you so much for the peach there, buddy. Uh, number two, okay. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Calm down, Steve. <laughs> simmer down. Should I tell him to simmer down? All right, I'm gonna tell him to, I'm gonna tell him to simmer down, chat. Yeah, number two, <laughs> tell him to calm down. You need to calm down, Steve. Calm down, Steve. Okay, okay, I met up with this big retailer, right? They read the pitch. They loved it. And they want to buy 150,000 copies of Added 87. 150,000. Multiply that by like 35 bucks. All right, what is that? What does that math equal out to? What is 150,000 times 35, chat? What does that equal out to, guys? Chris Copeland, thank you for the Wiener Super Sticker as well. Thank you so much there, Chris Copeland. We got Harry V as well. Dropping the 14 Swedish Kroner Wiener as well. Thank you so much there. Calm down, right? I need to calm down. Grab the audio for me, right? Calm down, Steve. <laughs> calm down, Steve. Um, have no idea, says Denver. Okay, that is millions of dollars in revenue. Wow, 5.25 million? We might, we might be on the brink of a 5.52 million dollar deal here, chat. Uh, th yeah, that's a lot of revenue. Let's go with number. Oh, you guys are saying go with number two here. That's a lot, but it's not a done deal yet, right? Ooh. Huh. Okay. Let me say number two. Yeah. <sighs> that's a lot, but it's not a done deal yet, right? Not yet, but oh, oh, so close. I can almost taste it. He can almost taste Listen, it, chat. I've got the contract right here. I'm sending over a copy. You should have it tomorrow. Could you please check it? I, I really hope I can depend on this time. I want your blessings before I sign on the dotted line, okay? Um, I'll see what I can do, Steve, or gotcha, Steve. Don't worry about it. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to say here? I'll, I'll just say I see what, I'll see what I can do, Steve. I'll see what I can do, Steve. Awesome. I'll be in touch again Tuesday evening. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Oh, thank goodness he, he hung up, chat. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> the Countess and the Carpenter. Chapter 2. Cecilia hated old Mr. Nabenshoe's table manners. The way he slurped rhubarb into his digestive system was quite slurped. bad in her on Cecilia's appetite. I'm gonna slurp she some coffee. She wanted to get out of here and drink and dance with the common folk. Every night, she heard their merry noises travel <laughs> through her bedroom window. The sounds of real life. I had him as my boss. Really? You had a boss like that, Fermero? Really, buddy? All right, it's Monday, September oh, 8th. Steve's parcel. And another note from Tess. Hey, Em, here are Steve's contracts. I bet you're in the mood for some light reading. And now without sarcasm, really, I must admit the energy here is contagious. Is Add It That's actually true, going to take off? See you soon. Tess. Common. Good morning, Miss Weiss. Uh, good morning, sir. <laughs> I didn't see uh -oh, you there. Who's this guy? My name's Walter Morgan. I'm with the Postal Service. Uh -oh. I left you a message on your answering machine earlier this week. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. Saved by the sub. We got Chris Copeland. Thank you for the ten dollar super chat, buddy. Coming in with a number one fan super sticker. Thank you for the number one fan super sticker, there, buddy. Busted. <laughs> dun dun dun. Oh, this is about to go bad, chat. This is about to go very, very badly for me, chat. Very badly. Thank you, Chris Copeland, for the number one fan super sticker, there, buddy. Appreciate it, my friend. We got Tracy coming in with the one gifted from or going out to Sean Roberts. Congrats on the gifted, Sean. Thank you so much, Tracy, for the one gifted. Also, man, you guys are awesome. Thank you for the support. Lie. All right, we're going to lie. Uh, I'm going to say I must have missed it. I don't have a phone. Yeah, exactly. I don't have a phone. <laughs> it's 1987. We don't have phones back then. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's answer this question. The dog ate my phone. Exactly, Don. The dog ate my phone, chat. Thanks, y'all. Sean Roberts, congrats, buddy. Congrats on the gifted. We got Tracy coming in with the one gifted. Thank you there, buddy. All right. Should I say yes, I remember? Maybe I should say yes, I remember. Yeah, we'll go with number one. Let's just go with number one. Ah, uh, yes, I remember. Miss Weiss, if you could follow me into the office, I would like to ask you a few questions. Oh, man. 
Don't lie, says Tobias. Yeah, we Are shouldn't lie. Are you familiar with the Postal Service policies? <laughs> to, to, to be honest, should I say yes I, or no? Are you familiar with post office policies? Yes or no? You know what's funny is I actually worked for the post office for nine years in real life. And I don't know what their policies were. I have no idea. Uh, let's go with number two. <laughs> we're gonna go with number two. Let's go with number two on this one. Yeah, we're gonna go with number two on this one. You broke so many policies, so many. To be honest, no. It says in chapter 11, section three, first paragraph, and I'll paraphrase. It is forbidden to use postal service property for personal gain. Oh. Yes, very bad, not good, not good at all, or oh, okay, sounds reasonable. <laughs> Oh, man, what do I say, chat? Uh, the policies change like the weather. They do, Spicy Steve. Yes, right? You work for the post office. Yes, I did. Well, I was a contractor for the post office, which is basically exactly the same thing. You got to go through all the same stuff, chat. You get a badge and everything. Um, two, one, two, two, two. I think we should go with number two. Yeah, I would say number two. Sounds reasonable. Oh, okay. Sounds reasonable. Miss Weiss, I'm aware that you've only just begun working here. But I trust that you do not take the responsibilities of a postal worker lightly. I'm the definition of integrity or no, of course. I mean, yes, sir. <laughs> you didn't profit. I didn't profit off anything. You're right, Tobias. Somebody else profited, not me. Uh, take number two. Yeah, the guy uh, has a nice mustache. He does have a very, very nice mustache, chat. I'm going to go with number one on this one. No, of course. I mean, uh, yes, sir. The Postal Service puts its Tangerty. employees under the highest level of scrutiny. I advise you to answer the following three questions truthfully. Uh oh. A yes or no will suffice. Do you know Frank Coleman? Do I know Frank Coleman? Oh. Frank? I don't. Is Frank my boss or something? Or, wait, who's Frank again? Or <laughs> I can't handle the truth. I don't even know if I know Frank Coleman. I know Frank. He was here at the post office. But is that my dad? Is Frank my dad? Frank's going to prison. I can see the escape Shawshank style. Oh, yeah. Frank's going to prison for sure. Frank is the other postal worker. Yeah, okay. He's the boss. Yeah. Frank is the boss. Do you know the Muffin Man? All right, we're going to go with number one on this one. We do know Frank, obviously. Either way, no matter who he is, we yes. know him. Have you ever given Frank. him envelopes or received envelopes from him that weren't postmarked? I did do this. I did do this. Oh, man. So we gave him an envelope that was not postmarked. We did do this. Remember, the farmer gave it to us as a favor. The farmer on the last stream gave us, gave it to him as a favor. All right, do we lie or do we tell the truth? I think we should lie. I think we should lie. Lie your butt off. Lie. We got to lie. We got to lie, chat. Uh, he's being done for betting. He's, oh yeah, he's, he's being investigated for betting, maybe. All right, I think we should lie. A lot of you guys are saying, okay, uh, let's do a poll on this one. Sorry for the delay, but we got to do a poll on this one. All right, chat. Vote in the poll. Hurry up and vote in the poll, guys. Thank you, Tracy. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Harry. Chris Copeland as well for the supers, guys. Thank you for the uh, super chats. I appreciate it. Don't get caught in the lie. I don't know. I feel like we should lie. Um, snitches get stitches. Yeah, I don't want to snitch on my friend. Like, who cares about the post office, you know? <laughs> I think it's more important to be loyal to your friend than try to cover your butt at a job. Right, chat? Would you agree or disagree? <laughs> I would agree. I would agree. Truth is spelled wrong. Truth is spelled wrong. You're right, chat. You misspelled truth. I did. I totally did. I, I wrote that in a very, very fast motion, chat. <laughs> truth. <laughs> truth. Uh, what a bunch of squares. I know, right? All right, guys. Vote in the poll. Please vote for lie because I want to lie, guys. Um, that was true on the first two questions, then lied on the last one. That's true, yeah. Uh, a liar will always get caught out. That's true as well. You might be right. You know what? You might be turning my brain here. All right, let's see what the chat says. The chat has voted... The chat has voted, and 57% of you have Tegrity chat. Oh, God. All right, let's tell the truth. The truth shall set you free. The guy already knows. He does already know. Okay, here we go. Yes. Are you aware that Frank Coleman wages bets on baseball games? 
All right, now we're getting into have some heavy stuff here, Chad. <laughs> Dang it. Are we aware that Frank bets on basketball games? Oh. Are we aware of this? We are aware of this, but this is plausible deniability, Chad. This is plausible deniability. Now, this would be a lie. We are aware of it. Yes, we are, but we don't have to say that we're aware of it. Everyone's saying no. Okay, it's okay. We are not, all right, all right. it's okay to lie about this. We are not aware, Chad. We don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. Snitches get stitches. No. <laughs> lie about that, yeah. That will be all. Thank you for your cooperation. That wasn't three questions. You're welcome, or what's gonna happen to Frank? <laughs> I'm gonna ask him, I should ask him what's gonna happen to Frank. What's going to happen to Frank? I'm sorry, we can't discuss personnel matters. Good luck with the mail today, Miss Weiss. Ah, oh, crap. That did not go well. Oh, Top of the man. morning, P.O. Complaints in Monday mornings. The perfect combo. P.O. Positive or that P. Take it away, Bert. Ooh. Morning, JR. He's coming after you. I'm <laughs> He's afraid following me. That P from me again. Keys car. People who come Keys camping car. here outside this season just bugger off already. <laughs> Loud and clear, Bert. Just like today's weather. We're starting the week sunny, but a few clouds will appear closer to Frank will afternoon. last chance you will be your last chance at romance. <laughs> really? Frank's gonna be my last chance at romance, guys. I lied for him. All right. Bad news. We have a delivery. Oh, this is so bad, chat. We have a delivery. Tobias! We have a delivery at the flick shack. All right, let's go into the flick shack and complete this delivery, chat. Oh, we're dead. Oh, Awkward. That's than I thought. Awkward. Time to get her on your good side. You think so, Patrick? I don't know about that, buddy. I don't think we're going to have her on our good side, chat. Drop it off and roll. <laughs> Drop it off and roll, says Chris. Hey, Ooh. here's a package for you. This game is oh, crazy. Oh, thanks so much, babe. Listen, I owe you an apology. Oh, I'm sorry. Did she just call me babe? Nah, leave me out of this, says Tobias. No, we're not leaving you out of this. You're in this, Tobias. You're in waist deep, buddy. You're in waist deep. Tobias! Sorry. I got a little carried away there. Amir says, what was that? What was that voice? I don't know. I don't know what that was. Uh, mood swings. She's having some mood swings. All right, let me let me talk to her. Apology for what? Or yeah, you do. Should I say yeah, you do? Yeah, you do owe me an apology or apology for what, guys? Yeah, she really loves your eye. I think so. I think so. One dig for more info. Um. Oh yeah. Let's yeah. Let's dig for more info. Yeah. Apology for what? I wanted to go with number two there. I was Kurt, just plain Kurt. She was. And there you were, just you trying something. to talk to me. You deserve better. Yes, I do. I mean, I was just trying to talk to you. It's okay. No one can be parked up all the time or perked up all the time. Oh, yes, you can. Apology accepted. Let's move on. All right. This is this is an interesting Hi, question. Oh. Oops, wrong, wrong button. Um, <laughs> oh, my God. Tobias is in deep. Tobias is in the middle of this thing. He Whether he wants to be or not, he is in the middle of this thing, chat. Rob Brooks says, Ryan should be chat side for work. All right, Rob, you have a great day, buddy. Thank you so much for the well wishes, sir. Hope you have a wonderful day at work, buddy. As always, my friend. Number three, yeah. Um, I don't want to move on. I kind of want to let this marinate for a little while. Savor it, you know? I like savoring things, chat. I am a saverer. Ah, uh, number three, number three. <laughs> I don't want to go with number three. Um, I think I want to be a little bit of a jerk about it. I think I deserve to be a little bit of a jerk about it, maybe, you know? Um, I don't know. Two's the nice answer. Three is the dismissive answer, and one is the, yeah, I told you so answer. I, I just don't know which one to go with here, chat. Uh, no, number two. All right, maybe number two. Maybe number two. Uh, agreed, says Nick the Bar. I agree, too, Nick the Bar, yeah. Um, one, one. All right, let's go with number one. Let's go with number one, chat. Yeah, I do. I mean, I was just trying to talk to you. So, any idea what caused it? Business is slow. More than slow. I mean... The Flick Shack is in real trouble. Aww. That movie box kind of was my last-ditch marketing effort. Nothing's worked so far. Aw. 
That's awful. What will you do if the store goes bust? I'm sure it'll be fine. Chin up. Oh, I can imagine that causes quite a bit of stress. Yeah, yeah. I was just trying to talk. Yeah, that's not what I was trying to do. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't think it'll be fine. So that's awful. What do you do if the store goes bust? I don't know. Maybe we shouldn't be negative about it. We shouldn't be negative about it, chat. Either two or three. I'm, I'm thinking two or three. Maybe we'll go three. Let's go three on this one. Three is like the super nice answer here. Ouch. I can imagine that causes quite a bit of stress. I've had <laughs> kind of a stressful job situation myself recently, so I can definitely relate. Really? How'd you deal with it? <laughs> I came here. Change of scenery, huh? Hmm. Anyway, enough whining. Let Tony. me make up for my stupid behavior and reward you for dealing with my moods, my lady. Reward me? Yep. I've got... Ta-da! Coupons! They're one of the few perks this job has. I get to take myself and a plus one to a free movie of my choice at the new cinema in Astoria. Valid tonight only. play this cool chat we gotta play this cool <laughs> squirrel squirrel we gotta play this cool <sighs> okay <clears throat> your old pal Ryan might have a date after all chat I don't know though um maybe we know you know she did reject us here chat she did reject us what <laughs> just happened I don't know <clears throat> I think we should get <laughs> everyone saying one <laughs> everyone in the chat everyone in the chat saying one make five million or go on the date I think we should go on the date let's go on the date chat all right what do you mean, like a date? Wow, pretty cool perk. And yeah, yeah, I, th I think we asked number one here, chat. Let's go. <laughs> Everyone's like, what? what? You mean like a date? Oh, you post people in your labels. That's a good but pun. Hey, if you want to call it that, sure. So what'll it be, Missy? Sure. Are you in or are you out? Oh, sorry, I'm out, chat. No, we, we can't be, we can't be. St Let's get some number twos. We can't be doing this. She's like, you post people in your labels. I like that. That was punny. That was punny. <laughs> Ryan's dropping the handcuffs. Uh, thank you again, Tracy, Chris. Appreciate all the support, guys. Uh, thank you so much. Wow, 28 members today. I've never seen the chat move so fast. All right, one it is, chat. One it is. I'd love to. <laughs> I've never seen the I'm chat in. move that Great. fast. Pick you up at your place at eight. I know where you live. <laughs> she knows anyway, where I live. Anyway, gotta get back to it. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <one. laughs> All right. We got ourselves a date, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get some great things. Oh, your old pal Ryan, chat. Hold it off, guys. Power Man says boo. <laughs> wow. All right. That was creepy. It was. Super creepy. Okay. Now let's play it cool. We got a date at the movie theater tonight, chat. Yes, we do, guys. All right, let's continue our mail route. It's too bad, too bad we got to work. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, is that her sister? Wait, what do you mean is that her sister? Whose sister? Whose sister? In insert fireworks. <laughs> what does that mean? All right. Oh, yeah. Uh, best memory. Best get memory. All right, let, let, let's just let's just get moving, chat. We got to go. Let's deliver these packages. We gotta hurry up and get these packages going. <laughs> let's get the let's get these packages going, chat. We gotta hurry up and deliver. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna deliver these packages, chat. We got delicious packages. What did Jason say? Oh, Jason, you can't say that on TV. All right, let's del deliver these packages, guys. We got delicious packages. Um, John Werner, I'm excited. Okay, for once in my life, someone wants to spend a little bit of time with me. Okay, this is the first time. <laughs> First time. Somebody actually wants to hang out and enjoy the company of the Raya, guys, or the lady that the Raya is right now. Okay, we're going to deliver this package to East First Street, chat. <laughs> Thank you for the uh, pickle of a jam. Or wait, what is that, Jonesy? Is that a pickle of a jam sticker? Yeah, let's get some pickle of a jam stickers, guys. We've gotten ourselves into a little bit of a pickle of a jam. <laughs> Chris Munger, Chris Munger, I'm just messing around there, buddy. I'm, try I'm, I'm being dramatic, okay? Uh, make sure to intercept nope. the package no answer. from Adam North 
Adam North Eve for your date. What is Adam North right, Eve? All right, on to the next one. Intercept the package from Adam North Eve for your date. What does that mean? What does that mean there, Mr. Sir? Uh, it is gone. Oh, I just got God. I just realized what that is. Uh, thank you for the pickle of the jam stickers. We're dropping scissors, right? <laughs> scissors? What does scissors mean? Oh, I know what that means too. Oh, jeez. All right, let's get up here, chat. <laughs> We're gonna deliver these these letters and stuff. There's letters, chat. <laughs> I thought the end meant in north. Oh dear. Oh, thank you so much, there, Tracy. <laughs> you guys are amazing. All right, I'm getting a little too excited. Would you say I'm overreacting right now, chat? Would you say I'm overreacting a bit? I'm uh, getting a little too excited, guys. No one uh, will be carrying the package on that date. Exactly, guys. All right, there we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy, indeed. Stick around, chat. Stick around. We're going to see how all this all goes, how this all plays out here. This should play out interestingly. Um, hot and bothered. Right, I'm a little hot and bothered, yeah. A little hot and bothered. A little hot under the collar. Got something to look forward to, finally. It's not just a boring, mundane postal job anymore. Okay, we now have something to look forward to. Now, let me ask you this, chat. Would you agree or disagree with this statement? When you have something to look forward to, is that a good thing or a bad thing? Butterfly, yeah, 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 we're not butterflying anything. Okay, uh, Ooh, then again, someone asked- Interesting. Corey, stop it. Why does she keep saying like, ooh, interesting for us? You like looking at all these letters? <laughs> Jeez, oh man, this chat is being so bad right now. All right, let me get, let me just get through my shift here, guys. <laughs> it's a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing. All right, we got two letters down at the end of this cul-de-sac here. Or no, we don't. What are these letters getting delivered to? Hold the phone, chat. All right, there's no more up here. Okay, so we got... All right, we have to go all the way around the lake. Okay, all right, let's just go in a counterclockwise fashion. She's nosy. She's very, very nosy. You're right, Jonesy. Uh, better put the plastic down. What does that mean there, Mr. Jared? Plastic. Three drama queens. <laughs> Three drama queens. So who's posting? Oh, my God, I can't read half these comments right now. Um, I look forward to 12 p.m. Eastern on YouTube. I just get disappointed until at least uh, 1225. I'm sorry, guys. Hey, that truck's back. That was Nathan. That was Trucker Nathan chat. Uh, make it a th um, what? All right. Okay. All right. Jason, you're you're worse than me right now, buddy. You need to calm down, sir. <laughs> Someone having talked. <laughs> all right, Steve. I cannot read these comments. All right, guys, drop regular comments. Can we drop some regular comments, please. Let's get some coffee cups in the chat. Can we get some coffee cups, please? We need some coffee cups. It's like 2 o'clock. I forgot to toot toot yesterday. I didn't toot toot yesterday, chat. I did not toot toot yesterday. Regular comment. <laughs> regular. Thank you for the regular comment. What is a regular comment? I don't even know. I don't even know what it is. But the, the ones that were being dropped, that I, I, I definitely couldn't read them. Pick up some... Pick her, pick her up a, a gift at Pink V Gifts. <laughs> oh my God. We're crossing the streams now, chat. Uh, how about the rain we're having? How about that rain we're having, chat? It is just dripping outside. Oh, damn it. It, I mean, what I'm saying is... All right, let me just deliver this mail, guys. We gotta deliver the mail. It is 2-2 two -two time. All right, yeah, let's do our 2-2 two -two salute. That'll that'll get everyone calmed down, all right? Everyone loves the 2-2 two -two chat. We'll just do our 2-2. Two -two. Guys, raise those coffee cups. Raise those loves cups. Those TA cups. Those flying J cups. Raise them once with me. And everyone here on the Rise stream, we're going to do our ceremonial swig of coffee together. Let's do it, chat. There's Kyle. What's up, Kyle? And after our ceremonial swig, we like to do something called the Toot Toot Salute. This commemorate and appreciate all the real-life truck drivers and postal workers who do Ill illegal things. And those of you that don't. This Toot Toot... Wait, what was I saying? Oh, I lost track there. This is commemorating and appreciate all the real life postal workers and truck drivers out there. If you are a postal worker or a truck driver, we respect you, we appreciate you, we thank you for doing what you do. Day in and day out to keep America and the rest of the world moving. So this toot toot is for you, all the real ones out there. And ladies and gentlemen, the toot toot is complete. Thank you for tooting along with me, chat. I appreciate it. Thank you for all the toot toot stickers. Unprofessional toot toot, it was. <laughs> I got sidetracked with all my illegal activities. <laughs> Chat, would you say, would you say, you know what's funny is I literally just got a notification that my Amazon package is arriving today. That is awesome. Did you miss a stop? No, I didn't miss a stop device. For some reason I have this marker 
on my map, and I don't know how to get rid of it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, that was just a marker I had from a previous day. Yeah, sorry about that. Why is there a waypoint in the mechanics? I, I put that there like three days ago. It never cleared. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Illegal postal workers who snitch on their boss and expose their illegal betting habits. <laughs> exactly. Oh, what a mess, chat. What a mess, guys. Rise guys package in the mail. I do. All right, let's head on down. Let's keep doing it. Thank you there, Spicy Steve. I will, buddy. I will, buddy. Chad, I want to ask you something. I need to ask you a question, okay? Because I can't hear what's going on right now. I need you to be my ears for me. You guys want to be my ears for me? Uh, thank you. Thank you, Alex. Yes, we do love the real ones there, buddy. All right, we got a package right here as well. I've never been to this house before. I don't even know what this place is. Oh, the motel. Oh, the guy with the video games. This is the guy that, he's kind of a jerk, chat. So we got to, we got to talk to him, guys. All right, this guy's the jerk. I have ears. Okay. I need you to listen. Do you guys hear my air conditioner today? Yesterday, you could hear my air conditioner the entire stream, and it was terrible. Let me know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mute the game for just a second. Let me know if you hear anything, chat. Did you hear anything at all, guys? No. Oh, thank God. Okay. All right. Good. Good. Yeah, that, that was so annoying yesterday. It was, like, Oops. so loud. Left the package in the thank truck. Thank you, chat. Awesome. I got my settings right. Oops, I left the package in the truck. <laughs> Nothing. Can't hear it. Awesome. Awesome. Pure silence. Yeah, that was pure silence, guys. Thank you, chat. Thank you. That I am so happy to hear that. So happy to hear that. Yes, yesterday's stream, it was like... <laughs> the whole time. Oh, it was terrible. Uh, just your squeaky voice. That's true. Yeah, just the squeaky voice, guys. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to 400 Lake Road. This is the package, guys. You got to deliver it. You didn't hear it yesterday? Really, Robert? Dude, I heard it the whole time, man. I, I listened to it, and I was like, oh, man, that is terrible. That's your voice every day. That's true. This guy's kind of a jerk. <laughs> All right, chat. Do we say hello, sir? It's the mail. Or do we say nothing? What do we say? <laughs> Born to Lake Road. We got it, Chad. Thank you, buddy. Seanathon Hill with a brand new Team Raya membership. We got Seanathon Hill coming to the brand new Team Raya membership. I hear your cat meow. I don't have a cat, too. <laughs> I don't know how you heard that. I wish I had a cat. Might have been the neighbor's cat. Don't interrupt the game. Too is a jerk. Yeah. <laughs> I think we should say. I kind of want to I kind of want to press him a little bit, though. I like messing with this guy. Uh, throw the package at him. We should throw the package at him. Thank you, Seanathon Hill. Let's get some welcomes in the chat for Mr. Seanathon Hill becoming a brand new Team Ryan member. Even though he's got that red R, thank you for the re-support there, Mr. Seanathon. Appreciate you very much, buddy. Ring the bell. All right. Hello, sir? It's the mail. Excuse me? What's this all about? I thought I'd not bother you and just deliver the parcel. It's all about the mail. Should I say it's all about the mail? I kind of want to say it's all about the mail. Drew's cat. Right, I stole it. I know. Yeah, Drew, Drew has a cat. Yeah. Um, barring the neighbor's cat now. Weird. Well, he comes out sometimes and hangs out. It's all about the mail. I'd appreciate it if parcels are not just dumped on the counter. Okay, I'll take that into account for next time. I'd appreciate it if you act like a human being. <laughs> we got to do number two, right? You got to do number two. You guys are saying number two. <laughs> number two. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you'd act like a human being. You'd understand if you had any idea about what I'm trying to do here. <laughs> Setting up a computer system to handle all the bookings is quite sophisticated. Uh, interesting. I work on computers too. Are you sure you're not just playing a game? Are you sure you're not just playing a game? Yeah, I'm sure. Thanks for the mail. Bye. <laughs> well, I think that was the wrong dialogue. I'm pretty sure that was the wrong dialogue, chat. But yeah, well, at least we were, at least we showed him. We definitely showed him, chat. Should have gone with number two. I should have gone with number two, but that's okay. I don't want nothing to do with that guy. That guy's a son of a stink, chat. He sure is. Whoops. Oh, now I'm stuck on the. Okay. Uh, that is a game, you butt hat. It is. It is. Well, now I'm crashing into everything. Son of a stink. <laughs> uh, key is car. I don't want to. <laughs> chat. Why? Hey. Why is your answer to every guy that is a jerk to us in this game, key their car? We can't be running around. Chat, is it post office policy to run around and key people's cars? I don't think so. 
A little late, but I made it. What's up, Mash? How you doing, buddy? Uh, spit on him. <laughs> Should have spit on him, Kyle. I would spit on him. Uh, we got uh, Mr. Charlie Force coming in with the Raya Baby. Oh my goodness, Charlie's a Raya Baby. Let's get those Raya Babies in the chat, guys. We got Mr. Charlie Force coming in with a brand new, or no, not a brand new, nine months of support from Mr. Charlie Force. Charlie, you are now a force to be reckoned with. Eh? Charlie Force got his nine months. You are now a force to be reckoned with. Not one laughy face. Not one person laughed at that. You missed the stop. Oh, I missed the stop? Unfollow. <laughs> Bruh. All right, fine, chat side. Bruh. Who gets booed on their own stream? I am the first streamer in existence to get booed on their own stream chat, I feel like. I'm just getting booed. I'm getting booed on my own stream. I think I did miss a stop. Oh, yes, we did. Oh, guys, this is the this is the uh, this is the people that that uh, partake in certain things here, chat. So we need to uh, we need to hang out with them for sure. <laughs> boo, boo. No dad jokes, right? Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Thank you, Charlie. Though appreciate you, buddy. We got Mr. Kyle Masters with a red level, eleven months. Kyle Masters, eleven months at the red level level of membership. Thank you so much there, buddy. Thank you so much. They go crack. Hey, Mike, Jared, yeah. Uh, thank you so much there, Kyle. This is still better than my mailman. <laughs> thank you. Ooh, that is a low blow, my friend. Thank you so much for that. Appreciate you, buddy. All right, let's hop on over and see what's going on here, chat. They have a letter. We got a letter for these guys. Let's do it. Level, level. Level, level, chat. Level, level. Hi, sweet Meredith. Hi there. Here's the mail. Here's the Thanks. mail. On your own today or still enjoying life on the grid? I feel like we should ask her if she's on her own today. Then then maybe that would open up more dialogue questions, chat. Uh, if they're, it's their energy bill. <laughs> they're out in the, what are you talking about? Uh, what energy bill? Uh, number two. I think we should go with number one on this one. On your own today? Ooh, here's your teepee. <laughs> on your own today? Sorta. Mickey's in the RV. He hardly slept last night. Said he had hallucinations of rotten fish in the RV. What? Did he have too much of the funny stuff? Yikes. I guess bad trips happen. <laughs> Maybe we ask about bad trips. I guess we'll say bad trips, guys. Uh, bad gummies. Yeah, he might have had a bad gummy. I think he had a bad gummy, chat. Yeah. Let's ask him number two. We're going to go with number two on this one for sure. Yikes. I oh, guess bad trips happen. Well, actually, when I went outside this morning, there was this huge rotting lake trout right below our window. Totally grossed me out. How does something like that end up there? Ew, Ew. disgusting. I may have a suspicion. I have no idea how that happened. What, what would that? What would the suspicion be here? What, what is the suspicion, guys? You guys have any ideas on what could have happened? Bears? Yeah, probably bears. It could have been a bear or a bird. Yeah, could have been like a crow, a bear, a bird, something. A flying fish. <laughs> Cross. Could have been a flying fish. Yeah, I, I would go with flying fish. Uh, one, we got to hear it. Yeah, we got to hear it. Like, we got to go with one. Yeah, really? Really? Is this even a question? Guaranteed Houston with that nine months. We have another Raya baby of support as well. Says, did you see the movie Constipation? Probably not. It didn't come out yet. Ugh. You know what? We might have to bring back the chipmunk voice chat. I might have to bring it back, guys. Do we bring it back? I feel like we got to bring it back. I feel like we got to bring it back. Um... Uh... Oh, dear God. God, okay. I gotta read this in the chip bucket voice. Thank you the nine months, Mr. Guaranteed Houston says. Did you see the movie Constipation? Probably not. It didn't come out yet. All right, now that we got that out of our hair, chat. Uh, my goodness. Okay, let me save that. I brought back the voice just to read that comment, chat. <laughs> there we go. All right. Tobias! Uh, thank you very much there, Guaranteed Houston. Appreciate that nine months Raya baby of support, buddy. Thank you so much. All right, I may have a suspicion. I may have... Uh, hold on. Mickey's got to read this. <laughs> Mickey! Wake up, honey! Leave me alone. I'm still shit-faced. It's a letter from Damien. Oh, right. Yeah, okay. Give me that. 
Sorry, Chad. There was a swear. There was a Looks swear. Looks like we won't be here much longer. Where are we going? Did you grow tired of the lake already? Perfect voices. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean for there to be a swear. I didn't know there was a swear in this game. Oh, really? Where are you going? Do you grow tired of the lake already? Uh, <laughs> not bleeped it out. No, I didn't bleep it out. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't know that was in there. Mickey dropped the Mickey. Okay. So, wait. What was what was happening? Okay, he was crap-faced. Where are you going? Do you grow tired of the lake already? Let's go with one. Yeah, I agree. Oh, really? Where are you going? We're going to Canada. We will be picked up this Thursday, early in the morning. Oh, Canada. Oh, Canada. Wait, they're getting picked up. That's weird. That's strange. They're getting picked up, chat. There you go, Drunk Holly. <laughs> Drunk Holly? Is that Drunk Holly, chat? Uh, I will have to go to church now. Thanks, Ryan. I'm sorry, Tony. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, no, they are... Okay, they are not. Okay. So we're going to say, what about the RV? I think we should go with number two here. What about the RV? Joe? Dan message retract. You running your mouth again? I'm sorry, sweet Meredith. Gotta go. Hey, you know what? You should come by Wednesday. Our last night here. We'll build a campfire, have a drink, maybe a puff or two, you know, and talk about the meaning of life, of course. The complete outdoors experience. Okay, so. We just got, got invited to smoke some with the neighbors. So, do we hang out with the neighbors in their RV and smoke some Yeah, I think we go with number two here. <laughs> Josh is like number one. Josh yells like, no. <laughs> All right, man, this, this game's getting interesting. All right, yeah, 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 I, I, I'm cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Look, look at it. All right, we're going with number two. All right, let's go to number two. Oh, cool. Yeah, why <laughs> not? One. Joan! Awesome. Gotta run. See you Wednesday after sundown. All right, Wednesday after sundown here, chat. So we have a date on Monday and Wednesday now, right? As a puffin' veteran, I am not. Chat, I do not do any any type of mind-altering substances, okay? Very often. Uh, we have Mom's Out experience now. Yeah, <laughs> you're not a cop, right? No, I'm a postal worker, chat. <laughs> postal worker. You're fired. <laughs> so what if, they, what if they drug test me? <laughs> what if that guy comes back with the tie? Remember the guy with the tie? And he drug tests me. Uh, this game is one cutscene away from... It, it, you're right. I, I don't know where this is going to go. I, I thought this was an innocent game. I had no idea there was any of this other stuff, chat. I'm not buying that, since you. No, you're buying it, buddy. You're buying it, buddy. You got to buy it. All right, let's get over here. We got one more package to deliver here, ladies and gentlemen. You're, you're out of coulage. <laughs> uh, pee in a cup says Spicy Steve. Now nah, we're not going to do that, buddy. We're not going to do that. Okay, all right. Oh, my goodness, guys. This is insane. The guy will make you pee in a cup. He might. He might. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We'll refuse. I will refuse to do that, chat. They're going to harvest your organs. <laughs> what if they harvest my organs, Power Man? Uh, thank you so much, Guaranteed Houston. I appreciate that eight months, man. Thank you so much for that support there, buddy. Okay. All right. Oh, we got a package down by the river here. What the heck is this? What is going on with this? Get the bears. Pee. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We could, yeah, exactly. We could use somebody else's chat. All right. I'm a mailman, guys. All right. I know what I'm doing. All right. So we have a, we have a parcel for the, for the dock here, guys. Let's do this. It's the bait shop. Oh, yeah, the bait shop. That's right there, Chad. You're right, buddy. All right. Let's deliver this package here, Chad. You're their fall guy. <laughs> it might be. Maybe they call the cops and pin it all on me, chat. That might be. I, I like this game. Do you guys like this game? Let me know if you guys like this game. This game is so much fun. I don't know why. It just gets more and more interesting as it goes. Like, it, I, I, was, I thought it might, like, die off or something, but it's, it's even getting better. We're getting second chances. Uh, we're patching up things with all the people that rejected us. Uh, we're, we're getting into smoking of things. We're also, um, we haven't seen the old lady yet, which is amazing. Have not seen the old lady once, chat. The game's ace. It is. It's really good, guys. It's very interactive. And your choices make a difference, too, which is cool. It's not like it's just dialogue in a story. Like, you're cho you you choose the path, guys, and you can screw it up if you want to. I, I really like that. Choose your own adventure. Actually, I do. It surprised me. Me too, Colby. Me too, buddy. I never, I played the demo Hey, of Mr. Mackey. Got another short. package for you. Ah, oh, Miss Weiss. Good seeing you again. How's Mort doing? Hope Mildred hasn't Sounds fed good, the Jeffy. poor fella anything unfit for cats again. What's up, Scotty? Getting into movies. Oh, yeah, yeah, the movies, too. 
As far as the, I, wait, what did he ask? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Some mistake. What did he say? <laughs> Who was he asking about? <laughs> Dang it. I wish there was like a replay button. I need to, I need to pay attention here. Well, who was he asking about? Kind of gives my life strange vibes. Me too, Faramero, yeah. Uh, he asked if Mort was fine. Who is Mort? Oh, the cat. That's right. That's right, guys. I haven't seen him. I'm sure he's fine. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell the truth. I'm going to tell the truth. I have not seen Mortimer since then, guys. We have not visited Mortimer. We probably should visit Mortimer. Uh, yeah, the cat. Okay. Okay. I haven't seen him, but I'm sure he's fine. Yeah, good, good. Uh, don't tell Mildred, but Mort is my favorite critter of hers. Lord knows she's got a hundred of them. <laughs> Played this game a few months ago, Terry. Really, buddy? That's cool, man. Michael Rodriguez is dropping those kitty cat stickers. Thank you, buddy. Um, Mort, my lips are sealed, and Mort is cute, yes. Maybe a hundred too many, if you ask me. I don't know what he asked again. I'm not paying attention. I don't, I don't really care about this guy at all. I got too many dates on the brain right now. Two? All right, we'll go with two. Maybe about a hundred too many, if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Have you kept busy since my last visit? It's good seeing you again after all these years. I'm going to say it's good seeing you again, because I don't want a whole conversation here. I just wanted to say it's good seeing you again after all these years, Mr. Mackey. Oh, that's right, Glad Daniel. you're in good health. <laughs> well... Drama simulator. It's good to see you back here as well. I always took you for a free spirit. Looks like you're finally settling down a bit. <laughs> Don't know about that one. Well, I have to keep going. See you around, Mr. Mackey. Chris Copeland, thank you for the five dollar super chat as well. It says time to rent the U-Haul. Oh my god. I don't even think we have to rent the U-Haul. They have a van there, buddy. They do have a van, guys. All right, I'm kind, Mr. Mackey, I'm kind. That was Mr. Mackey, I'm kind, Chad. He's kind of lame. I don't really like him, Chad. Boo, I like Mr. Mackey. I like Mr. Mackey, too. He's a good guy. I really like him, Chad. He's like my favorite character. Uh, keep it up. You might have a date on Thursday. <laughs> Jason, I did not explore a conversation with him. Um, I don't want to sit there and yammer on with him, Chad. Uh, tell him about your date with a chick on Friday. I should have told him about that. Uh, but, but I believe the date's tonight. Wait a second. Chad, I think the date's tonight. Is the date tonight? Settling down with five people. Yeah, we're settling down, chat. <laughs> Kia's truck. <laughs> Dang it, Dan says Kia's truck. Dan, you're a son of a stink. It is tonight, and my shift is over. I just delivered all the mail. My shift is over, chat. Was there something that just ran into the woods? I swear I saw something cross the road there, guys. Oh, well. Ah, uh, stand her up. Oh, power mad. What if we stood her up, buddy? That would be something. What if she what if she has another mood swing, though? And she uh, she gets all moody and is, is mean to me again. Uh, Bigfoot. That was Bigfoot? Oh, really? That was Bigfoot chat. She wants to ma wax his mustache. She does not want to ma wax his mustache, guys. Guys. All right, we're at the post office here, chat. Yes, we are, guys. Yes, we are. That's a Sam squanch. It, is a, it might be a Sam squanch. Let me back it up, chat. We got to back it up. Let's back it up, guys. Last chance for her. Tobias! It was Bigfoot. Ooh. Okay, we're at the house, chat. There's the phone call. Hello? Hey, Meredith. How was your day at the office? Uh, I mean, mail truck. It's Dad. Oh, hey, Dad. I di it did start at the office. I was being interrogated. Uh, should I tell him about the interrogation? Or do we not tell dad about the interrogation? I don't know what we should do here. She's gonna cancel on you. She might, Spicy Steve. What do we tell dad? I think we should tell him the truth. Um, it's about to get spicy, yeah. The truth, he's gonna find out anyway. So, I don't know, don't tell him? You guys don't think we should tell him? Tell dad, go tell dad, yeah, tell him. All right, all right, let's tell daddy up. Let's tell daddy, chat. Uh, tell him Frank is toast. <laughs> I will. I will. Frank is going to be toast. Yeah, tell him. All right, we got to tell him. I mean, we can't lie to our dad. Come on now. Actually, it did start at the office. I was being interrogated. Interrogated? What? By whom? Walter Morgan, a higher up from the post service. He started asking questions about the code of conduct. He had boring questions about company property. <laughs> boring questions. <laughs> All right. Do I act like an adult or do I act like a child here? <laughs> do 
Dad's in on it. Dad might be in on it, Don Mosier. Yeah, he knows something. He knows something. Yeah, one. All right, yeah, let's ask. Let's do one here. He started asking questions about code of conduct and about Frank. <sighs> Morgan, that walking corpse. He's always after Frank. He called What'd him a walking say? corpse. Um, that Frank had... Oh, I said nothing. I'll say I said nothing, basically, because that's the truth. Remember, I didn't... I didn't... Uh, I didn't welch on Frank, uh, or not welch, but whatever the, I didn't like tattletale on Frank, guys. I denied everything. Yes, exactly. Nothing, basically. That's my girl. They'll never catch Frank anyways. He's always one step ahead of them. Dad's Listen, cool. Mom's poking me. I guess we're not allowed to talk about work. Uh, here she comes. Bye, Meredith. Dad's Hi, Meredith. cool. Was Dad trying to get work stories out of you? Hi, Mom. Yep, you tried. Rat him out. <laughs> and he succeeded. It was a weird day. Um, but I had a normal work day. Yeah, I'll say it was a weird and day. And he succeeded. It was a weird Dad's day. Dad's in on it for sure. Well, I'm changing the subject right now. Have you met that new guy at the hotel yet, Matt? Yeah, I met him the other day. What a jerk. Or are you going <laughs> to say what a jerk? That's the jerk from the hotel, the redheaded kid. I think we should call him a jerk. Dad's definitely in on it. Oh, for sure. Guys, let's get a couple hashtag cool dad. We need a couple hashtag cool dad in the chat. We have a cool dad, guys. Uh, number two. Yeah, what a jerk. What a jerk. <laughs> Ugh, I agree. He's one of the reasons why I won't miss working at the hotel. Anyway, how's life in good old P.O.? Wonder what mom did at the hotel. Uh, not very eventful. After work, I watch TV and read books. It's nice. I met some interesting people. We're going to go with the truth. It's nice. I met some interesting people. Cool dads. Take the hashtag cool dads, sure. guys. Interesting people. That's right, Danny. Do you mean interesting, interesting, or just interesting? Interesting, what do you mean? I think you could say interesting, interesting laughs. Yeah, let's go with the laugh here, chat. I think you could say interesting, interesting. Oh, <laughs> oh honey, that's so nice to hear. It's been a while since met someone interesting that's right <laughs> and now i'm changing the subject <laughs> that was a weird voice i shouldn't have done that while laughing tobias uh mom is prying too much nosy i know she's being nosy um how are you guys doing over there do you miss po do you miss providence oaks let's get through this conversation oh, florida is fantastic i think i might actually want to live here the warmth of the sun it's very easy to Logan. get used to. Oh, Dad is telling me to get back. Looks like the bar's open. Bar's okay, open. This time. Where's Harry V and his frozen marks? <laughs> Alabama what? Alabama Slammers. I've Cheers. had an Alabama Slammer. That's a real drink. Alabama Slammers are delicious. Oh, chat. The traffic says Harry. <laughs> this is fun. It's been ages since I've been to the movies. Well, they call it the movies, plural. But of course, we can only see one Here movie at a time. Here we so, go. So, which one will it be? Okay, so do I pick or does she pick, chat? Who picks the movie, guys? Who picks the movie? I love the Alabama Slammers. <laughs> Harry knows about those Alabama Slammers. He sure does. <laughs> he sure does. Uh, bow chicka wow wow. I need some, like, yeah, like, like that kind of music. Bow chicka wow wow. Movies with chill. Yeah, movies with chill. All right, you pick. You're the expert. You pick. You're the expert. That's exactly why I want you to choose the choice of innocent eyes. Oh. All right. Let's see. Big Trouble in Little China, Blue Velvet, or The Great Mouse Detective. All right. Do I ask for guidance or am I ready to pick, guys? It's a it's a drive-in movie. Is it really a drive-in? <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Sir John Molino. Um, I'm ready to pick Innocent Eyes. Yeah, Innocent Eyes, Deborah. Yeah, Trouble in China. I think we should do Trouble in China. Um, Blue Velvet. <laughs> Blue Velvet. Uh, number two, number one. I think we should go with uh, number one. Yeah, number two here or number one. Now you guys are saying number one. Uh, that's a that's. Hey, Chris Manuel, you stop it there, buddy. It's delicious. Um, Great Mouse Detective. Okay. I think we're gonna go with number two. At least give me some guidance, though, like... I'm nervous, Chad. It's my first date. What do you know about Big Trouble in Little China? What do you... What's Blue Velvet about? What's the Great Mouse Detective? I'm gonna ask her about this. Heard anything about the Great Mouse Detective? Was that a good movie, <laughs> Stephanie? Disney movie, Mouse Detective. What do you need, a roadmap? 
<laughs> She's being snippy. All right, let's ask her about the first one. What do you know about Big Trouble in Little China? It's supposed to be a pretty good ass kicking. Most John Carpenter movies are pretty exciting, at least. Hey! He's the guy who made Halloween and The Thing. Nothing too deep, but should be entertaining. All right, she wants she wants Big Trouble in Little China. Let's ask about Blue Velvet now. What's Blue Velvet about? Apparently, it's noir with a surrealist twist. I once saw a film by this director called Eraserhead, which was, well, weird. Unsettling, too. From what I've heard, this new one is quite memorable really, Steve? as well. All right, I'm ready to pick. Okay, what do you what do you guys think she wanted to do the best? Uh, it sounded like Blue Velvet would have been her pick, chat. I don't. I've never seen Blue Velvet. Never seen it. Do what she wants, obviously. Obviously, yeah, Brian. Yeah, we're gonna do what she wants, buddy. I think she she really liked one or two. Yeah, she definitely didn't like the Great Mouse Detective. Um, I'm gonna say I think she liked <laughs> three. Says William. No, we're not going with three, William. Three, of course, is Patrick. Yeah, big trouble. I think we should maybe go with Blue Velvet. Uh, are you, all you guys are saying one. Okay, we're gonna go with one. I'm not gonna go with three. There you know. All right, we're gonna go with one, chat. Let's go with one. Let's go with one. Big Trouble in Little China. She liked one, she didn't like two. Oh, I got you there, Nick Cross. Okay. Big Trouble in Little China. Yeah, let's go with that. Ooh, the carpenter. This ought to be a ride. <laughs> And it's endlessly quotable. Yes, sir. The check is in the mail. I guess we saw the movie. <laughs> you were right about it being a ride. Woo. Yep, Woo. that's Carpenter. And the best part is, we don't have to talk about hidden meanings or anything. What did Frosty oh, say? Does that mean we're we have frosty. to talk about ourselves? Dun, dun, <laughs> dun. <laughs> so anyway. I gotta pin that My comment. parents' house is right down this road, as you well know. Right, Missy. Let's go that away. <laughs> Frosty! Frosty, you can't say that on TV! Oh my god. Frosty said, rip a big fart, see if she likes that. She's not gonna like that. Oh my goodness. You can't take anything seriously, can you? I wish I loved anything half as much as you love movies. All right, what do we say to her, chat? Do I be a jerk about See, I would never say this in real life. I, I'm always joking around. Always. My entire life is a joke. <laughs> it is. Um, take her to Starbucks. Uh, this is, this gets spicy. Stephanie, I'm telling you. This is crazy. It's, I can't even handle it, chat. Uh, number two. Yeah, we obviously go with number two, right? <laughs> I wish I loved anything half as much as you love movies. Next time, we'll do something in your area of expertise. What, deliver the mail? <laughs> What, computer software? You mean driving around in a mail truck? You mean driving around in a mail truck? You mean driving around in a mail truck? Ooh. Sure. Park it anywhere around the lake and then just enjoy the sunset. Is this what people talk to each other like when they like each other? I never had this conversation in my life. All right, uh, I like the sound of next time, by the way. Next time is a little presumptuous. So I could either reject her. I have the power here, chat now. Gulp. <laughs> Tobias says gulp. Tobias! Oh, man. Should I just yell Tobias out? I feel like I should just yell Tobias. Frosty says no. I like the, the sound of next time. I like the sound of next time, by the way. <laughs> Oops, what a slip of the tongue. <laughs> so, here we are. Now what? <gasps> All right. Do we say we're tired? Or do we say we can have a cup of tea? <laughs> dude, 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 look at this chat. Look at this chat right now. My hands are getting sweaty, chat. My palms are sweaty. Mom's spaghetti. <laughs> All right. Let's have some tea. Woo. Well, we could have a cup of tea at my place. <laughs> I She's a psycho. would like that. She's a psycho killer. Oh, do we kiss her? Or do we say, we didn't have this, didn't have this in mind? Oh, we got to kiss her. I wonder what old Jack Burton would say at a time like this. Rise taking notes. I'm not taking notes. Aw. And they say I'm not romantic. 
Let's get some romance rice. Can I bug you for a second? Oh my goodness, Chad. Wow, they bleed. Oh, they, they got rid of the best part. Why didn't they show the part? What happened? What happened? What happened in the, What happened during the blackness? What happened during the darkness, Chad? It's so romantic. I'm romantic, guys. Buzz. <laughs> Romance Ryan. Oh my god. Let's get some hearts in the chat, guys. Wow. Oh man. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, he's going to kill you. He's going to kill me, chat. Was I even maybe I was late for work. All right, let's let's cut that romance music chat. Sure, Frank, what's up? Yes, I wanted to talk to you as well. Okay. So Oh yeah, let's go with number two on this one. Yeah, we want to talk to him as well, chat. Oh man. I'm still excited from the night yes. before. <laughs> I wanted to talk to you as well. That Walter Morgan guy, uh, what did he want from you? <laughs> We're this is the made for TV version. Exactly, Euro. Sometimes I forget I'm streaming live on YouTube. <laughs> Like, there's like 300 people watching. I'm streaming on YouTube and I'm sitting here like a little school child. <laughs> Just kissed his first girl. Uh, I'd sniff her. Oh, jeez, Cody. That is disgusting. Okay, so nothing special. We asked if I was settling in all right. I think we should tell him the truth. Do you guys think we should tell Frank the truth, guys? Um, links to Discord on what happens. <laughs> so, Jason, no. We're not doing that, buddy. Okay. He was, he was asking all sorts of questions about you, Frank. I think we need to go with number two, Harry. Yeah, truth. He was asking all sorts agree, of Dan. questions. Also about you, Frank. God damn it. Can you believe that jerk? What a jerk. Sean O, let's catch up with some supers here, guys. Uh, thank you so much, Sean O, for the $5 super chat, buddy. It says, this is great. It's like playing a game show. It, it kind of is, Sean O. It actually kind of is. And all of my, all of my things that I'm doing actually mean something, too. It's crazy. Thank you so much. Bombs are sweaty. My palms are sweaty, chat. Rag out the shocker. Oh, my God. All right. I'm sorry, Frank. I just can't lie. Are you in trouble, Frank? Uh, what do we say? I think we go with number two here. I think we go with number two here. Are you in trouble, Frank? Are you in trouble, Frank? Trouble? Eh, they're the ones who are in trouble. I got to get back to it, Meredith. Have a great day. Oh, before I forget, that Robert Harris guy was here this morning looking for you. He asked if you could drop by. He's working somewhere in the forest today. Robert. <clears throat> I know, Faramero. Okay, Robert dropped by the post office, the lumberjack. Good Chat. morning, P.O. P.O. Positive. Why is the lumberjack asking Will it be for a me? P Bring or her a in. P. Playing both Morgan. sides. I'm playing There's both sides. Every Might be playing both sides. Yeah, gate number two. Time, Robert, so. uh, being old, big old number two. All right, we're going to go with the big old number two, Chat. Yeah, we did that. Did someone just call me well mannered? <laughs> I'll take it. Let's see if the weather will behave today. All right, so first package delivery is at the video store. <laughs> oh, no. If Robert's digging a grave, run away, says Power Man. Robert might be digging a grave. You might be right. Okay, we're at 351 Main Street. We got a lot of packages today. There is a lot of packages today in your chat. Lumberjack wants to. Oh, jeez, John Robinson. Okay, let's get in here, chat. We're going to the Flick Shack. We got our girl little package here, chat. We might get some juicy details about what happened, guys. Oh. Hey, you. Hi. Aw, oh, hug. So I'm guessing you want to rent a movie, huh? <laughs> We've got a great selection. Oh, really? Got anything romantic? Actually, that's not what I'm here for. Oh, three's a crowd. Says <laughs> Harry Vanola. Oh, chat's moving like back to the future. That's right there, DJ. Ah, uh, three's a party. It is. Three is a party, guys. Um, What up, Raya? And my favorite chat, Mamma Mia. What's going on, Hype Man Polly? Ooh, yeah. All right, I'd say we go with number one on this one. Oh, really? Keep the romance going. Got anything going. romantic? <laughs> sure do. Or, wait, you do mean movies, right? Jesus so, Christ! What's on your mind, babe? Well, I like you, but I think we should just be friends. <laughs> Man, I put in so much legwork. Why would I do, why would I say number one? Unless, unless I'm interested in Robert now, I could reject her. Um, I think I'm starting to like you a lot, or I'm not sure what to make of us. Womp womp. I know. But I kind of want to see, I kind of want to be a little bit of a, of a, guys, what's a person that goes from person to person, like, <laughs> don't say it, don't say it, don't say anything bad, chat. Moderators, be on guard for this. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so maybe I don't want to do that, uh, number two. I, but I, but I do like her. I do like her. Uh, a gigolo. <laughs> a gigolo player. Yeah, I feel like a player. I kind of want to be a player. 
Uh, a swinger. Yeah, yeah, swinger. Um, don't be a player. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't be a player, Stephanie. Maybe we should go. See, we we have options now. You know what I'm saying? Uh, popular. Yeah. Uh, traveling pants salmon. <laughs> traveling pants salmon. You're loving life. I'm loving life, Robert Z. Exactly, guys. You'd be a Jared. Yeah, I don't want to be a Jared, guys. Okay, we don't want to be a Jared. We want to be a... I don't know what we want to be, but we want to do something. Friend zone, says Harry. All right, let's see what Harry Vanola thinks. Harry, should we continue to like this girl or should we move on to the to the party wild side guys and, and go with Robert chat um, I think we should my personal opinion is that we should continue to like this girl I, I really she's being really nice to me she's 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 fun to hang out with they go to movies and stuff you know what I'm saying I think we should go with number two the chat is saying number two the local bicycle <laughs> I am not the local bicycle all right, let's let's add, let's say this. Let's say this. Let's let's do number two. We're gonna go with number two. I think I'm starting to like you, a lot, and I'd like to ask you to be a little less awesome. It's distracting me. <laughs> Torn off. <laughs> no can do, Miss Weiss. <laughs> Being awesome is my thing. Would you ask Rocky to stop boxing? <laughs> Touche. <laughs> Pimp Daddy Rice. <laughs> so anyway, what's on your mind? A rare moment of quiet contemplation. You look a little distracted, taking stock of the store or of your life. Uh, I'll go with number one here because I don't even know what that means. Seems I caught you in a rare moment of <laughs> quiet <laughs> contemplation. Yeah, uh, I just... You ever get the feeling you're not where you need to be? She's having second thoughts! We're gonna lose her! We're gonna lose her! Yeah, I know that feeling. I know it all too well. You feel that way about Providence House. Or about me. About the store. Oh, maybe the store. Maybe it's about the store. Uh, she's going to leave you. She's going to leave me, Dan. She's going to leave me. Oh, job-wise, I got you, Tobias. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Job-wise. I think we go with number one on this one, chat. Yeah, we'll go with number one, Robert. Let's go with number one, guys. You moved too fast. <laughs> moved too fast. We did. We moved too fast. I, sh I knew I shouldn't invite her in for that tea. Yeah, I know that feeling. I know it all too well. It's just, just that this whole flick shack adventure, I think it was the right idea at the wrong time. <laughs> I know, Jason. In the wrong place, wild business is that bad. Uh, all right, I don't, yeah. Do we ask her if it's the wrong place or do we ask her if business is that bad? What? See, this is a, this feels like an important question here, chat. Oh, mamma mia. Uh, two. Number two, cold feet. I think she's getting cold feet. Yeah, number two. Okay, number two. Wow. Is business that bad? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. So your movie box project didn't turn things around? <laughs> it almost did. Don't think that it didn't help. That's what I mean with the wrong time. I'm sure video will be huge. But it isn't. Not yet. Not here, anyway. So you're leaving? Yeah. Yes, I am. Wow. I didn't realize until just now that I'd already made my mind up, but I guess I have. I'm leaving. Gosh, it feels so liberating to say. Ah! Ah! Well, there it is. The audacity! You just got dumped. I just got dumped. You're welcome or there it is. She left. <laughs> she left my. She left me. Poor Ryan. We got to check it. All right. Well, there it is. All right. Let's say you got. You still got a chance. Maybe we still got a chance, Patrick Rowe. Um, let's go to number two. Well, there it is. How about you? Have you made your mind up yet? Uh, about your future, I mean? Emotional damage. Me? No, not yet. Uh, have I made my mind up, mind up yet? I think I did. I, I think I want to move this town because there's a lot of things I could be doing in this town, chat. You blew it. I blew it, yeah. Uh, I think we're going to go with number one on this one. Uh, yeah, we made up our mind. Or wait, maybe we go with her. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just let's hold the phone here, chat. You want to go away with her. Patrick, maybe we want to go away with her. Jason Bergman says, Rip Newt. Dude, I'm so sad about Newt. Guys, can we get some Rip Newts in the chat? 
Who's still sad about Newt? I'm, I had dreams last night about Newt. I am so sad about Newt still, Jason. That was so sad, buddy. <laughs> Go with her. Options, right? Options. Okay, options. Options. That's good. Yes, options. Me? No, not yet. Thank you well, for the rip nudes, take chat. your time. I want to give it my full attention when you do decide. And right now, I really have to start organizing the grand closing of the Flick Shack. We hardly knew ye. Maharia, I'll swing by later. Okay, we're going to swing by later, chat, for another hug. Uh, or new things. On to new things. Yeah, I'm sad. I don't know. I feel like maybe we should go with her, chat. My life's an open book. Uh, honestly, I cried when Newt died yesterday. Says I know, Deborah. Me too. I'm I'm crying right now on the inside, guys. Cop a few. The cross. The cross. Hey, do I look like a man that would cop a? Hey, now. All right, let me get up here and deliver these packages. We got to deliver these delicious packages. We got cookies to deliver. More tea later. Yeah, we'll have more tea later. <laughs> more tea later. Swing by. We're gonna swing by, chat. Yes, we will. We'll swing by. Guys, remind me to swing by later. I think it's Tuesday. What was the... Oh, wait. We got to go visit Robert. You guys remember Robert? We got to go see what the lumberjack wants. Your dead soul Your dead soul was crying inside. Exactly. All right. Let's go deliver these delicious packages. We got to go see Robert, too. Where's Robert, chat? Uh, Denver. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. What's a nuke? Oh, Fair Marrow. If you missed yesterday's stream, guys, to anybody that doesn't know what we're talking about, do yourself a favor. Definitely watch yesterday's replay. Yesterday's game... Probably one of the best streams we've ever done. <laughs> Honestly, it was so much fun. That game was so ridiculous. Uh, it had ups and downs. It was funny. It was evil. It was hilarious. There was there was a baby in a dryer. Don't don't ask questions. Just go watch a chat. It was it was a great great time. That was a great game, guys. But unfortunately, there was a sad moment at the end. Uh, yesterday was so fun. Thank you, Harry. I'm glad you enjoyed it, man. I would ha highly recommend you guys watch the replay. <laughs> Thank you very much there. Michael Peterson as well for the 149 uh, popcorn super sticker there, buddy. Appreciate that, man. No, uh, but, <laughs> no <laughs> answer. Yeah. Yesterday was epic. Thank you, John Colley. Glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, it, it was something else, chat. It was. Thank you, Michael Peterson, for the 149 super sticker there, buddy. Appreciate that. Michael Peterson and the popcorn. Sean O as well, as well, man. Thank you for the $5 super chat also. You guys are absolutely awesome. Yes, right. Half the time is talking. He got kicked in the no-no square. I did, Maddie. We got we got beat up big time yesterday. <laughs> did you get the nude sticker? I forgot to do the nude sticker, Danny. I'm so sad, man. I did not do the nude sticker, buddy. I don't know if I'm going to do that because that, that game's like a one-off, man. I, I don't think we're going to... I want to do a nude sticker. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. I'll have to think about Ooh, it a little bit more. Interesting. Maddie says yes. Oh, yeah, I read that. Uh, Team Raya, thank you there, Stan. I appreciate it there, buddy. Uh, thank you, Stan, for the Team Raya, sir. Yesterday was amazing. Thank you, Welsh. I'm glad you enjoyed it there, my friend. All right, let's get moving, chat. We got to do our mail route. Now, here's the thing. I got a question for you about today's stream with Robert. What do we... Do we... See, I don't want to... I don't want to complicate things, but do we, how do we handle the Robert situation? Robert is now stalking me at work. As you guys heard, Frank said Robert wanted, uh, he dropped by the post office and wanted to hang out. Now, if you guys remember, we went on a date with Robert last stream. We went, we went on a date with Robert to the, to the, um, uh, the restaurant, uh, kill him. <laughs> We're not going to kill Robert. I'm not going to kill Robert. Key his car. We could key his car, Dan, but. I don't know. I don't know how to handle Robert. That, that was uh, that was not a good situation. Uh, Creeper, yeah. So he did reject us. He left us at the restaurant, if you guys Oops. remember. Left the package in the truck. Oh, son of a stink. I didn't even know this person was getting a package. All right, let's give this person their mail. Uh, Robert. What did Robert say? <laughs> Robert Coleman says, restraining order. <laughs> restraining order. Hide his axe. Yeah, we might. Um, invite him in on the next kiss. Ooh. I'll be honest with you, chat. You know what I want to do? I want to make things complicated. I want the drama. Okay? Because in real life, in real life, we always got to play by the rules. You can't do this. You can't do that. Yeah. But in fake life, we can stir up some sh You know what I'm saying, chat? Slash his tires. Yeah. All right. So let's go over here. Oh, I forgot to deliver the package. Whoops. <laughs> package. What's up? Package. I forgot the package. I forgot the package. <laughs> oh my god, Cody. Oh my god, Cody. I forgot the package, guys. Son of a snake. I'm a bad mailman. I'm a bad, bad mailman. Uh, fake it till you make it. Exactly. Exactly. All right. That's good enough. 
Oh, I forgot the delivery. I did. I did, chat. All right, we're at 108 West 3rd Street. So we got a West 3rd Street delivery here, chat. You had one job. I did have one job. Okay, where's West 3rd Street? None of these are 3rd Street. 301 Jackson, maybe? I have no idea. It's like messing up an Italian sausage recipe. Hey, man, Paul, you're exactly right, buddy. Oh, okay. I got the right one. I got the right one. Yeah, Jackson Street. Yeah, we're on Jackson Street, guys. It didn't mute. He said, no, I didn't, Paul. Don't be saying it didn't mute, guys. He said it clears day. I didn't say anything clears day. Uh, dirty toasty. What does that mean? Oh, dirty posty. All right. I'll leave it on the doorstep. You know what I really like is that I really like that nobody answers the door, so we don't have to get into meaningless conversations again. This is fantastic. It really, like, the end of this game here is all meat and potatoes, guys. It is all meat and potatoes. What is going on on the side of my truck there? Why is there, a, why is there like, a, a piece of cardboard on the side of my truck, guys? Oh, it disappeared. Uh, return to sender. Uh, taking packages. <laughs> taking packages. Taking packages. And there's the 80s. No one has a ring. That's true. You're right. All right, let's get over here, guys. We got to deliver some more stuff. Let's do our job. Should we wait 2.5 seconds and just leaves? Exactly. Yeah, I don't, I'm not sticking around. Bobby, would you stick around, guys? I don't think so. Are we going to go left here on the 2nd Street? That was Robert's leg. He's hiding in the back. Robert's leg, Sheppy? What the heck are you talking about, buddy? <laughs> what are you saying, buddy? I got I to gotta start pulling over like a, like a real mail carrier here, guys. Uh, so your job, your job stream, did you double ring? Finally, YouTube made me update, and then I couldn't comment. Really, Rodney? Dude, there's been, like, some weird things going on here, buddy. I don't know what, what the deal is. Hair in circle. Okay, there's our package that we need. That's lighter than I thought. Isn't he stalking you? That's true, Sheppy. He is stalking me. Maybe we should, should we confront Robert about the stalking, guys? I feel like we should, guys. Look at this guy's giant tree stump. I, I, I really like the houses in... I'll tell you what, the art style in this game, the graphics, fantastic. I love the look of this game, guys. Um, Sheffy, yeah, Sheffy's nope. here. Use the no answer. Pick up for next tea time. Want to play post office? You stamp. Oh my god, I'm not using that. <laughs> Jason, you're bad, buddy. You're bad, buddy. Well, you can sit on the bench. Look at this. You can just sit on people's benches. We got Harry Vanola coming in with a 50. Swedish Kroner, thank you, Harry V, for the support, buddy. Appreciate you, Harry. He says, now I know why my package came back to me like that. I sent to you, Raya. Uh, have you done the puzzle yet? I have not done the puzzle yet there, Mr. Harry V. Trust me. You will know when I do the puzzle. I'm saving that for a special occasion, my friend. Get off my lawn. <laughs> Get off my lawn. Thank you very much, Harry, for that 50. Swedish Kroner, my friend. Thank you so much there, buddy. Thank you very, very much, sir. Very, very kind, very generous of you. Make the delivery awkward. I feel like we should. Okay, we got a piece of mail here. There we go. Uh, what did Dan say? Oh my god, what did Dan say? Hey, Jason. What's going on there, Jason? How you doing there, buddy? I really... I'll be honest with you. I like that this game has, like, two different things to do in it. Not only is it a drama, but it is also a mail simulator. And they do a very good job of it, too. I really like it, guys. They got package delivery. They got, uh... They got letters. Pretty sweet. Power... Power man. I don't know what any of this means, Power Mad. Thanks for last night, but you fart in your sleep. Power Mad, that is inappropriate. Why did I show that? How Ryan's date ended. What, a Taco Bell? What is this? are bad uh you guys are bad who made that you're getting banned from discord whoever made that you're getting banned 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 rip nude i know i'm so sad about nude guys guys um ooh, jonesy i don't want to know buddy <laughs> i don't want to know grounded rise dream figure that's my dream figure <laughs> new heels <laughs> oh my god chat you guys are so bad thank you very much harry vanola i appreciate it buddy thank you for that support man 
Appreciate those supers, guys. Guys, we had 29 new members. We're almost at 400 likes on the stream today. Make sure you tap that like. We have 15 likes. 15 likes away. No, you're not really banned, Chad. I'm just kidding. Go to your room. <laughs> Go to your room. Guys, we need some coffee cups in the chat, please. All right, we got to go. Okay, there's three things we need to do all around the lake. We have a pack. Oh, there's a package out in the woods here. What is this? Raven Way. Whoa, okay. Okay. So we get a package all the way out in the woods. Same with the coffee cups, guys. I appreciate it. Talk to Robert in the forest. Raven Way or Moe's Diner. I think we should go this way. We'll talk to Robert last. You guys agree or disagree? Talk to Robert last, guys. Go see Robert. I think we should talk to Robert last. Because that feels like it's going to be drama, you know? And I don't want drama while I'm already at work. You know what I'm saying, guys? Um, oh, my goodness. We got Big T coming in. Big T coming in with a one. Gifted. Membership. Let's get some Big T's in the chat. I see them files. Don't look at those files, chat. Do not look at my files. Big T, thank you the one gifted membership, buddy. That went out to Hype Man. Polly. congratulations, Hype Man, on the gifted there, buddy. Congrats, 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 man. That is awesome. And we just got cooked. Ladies and gentlemen, we just got cooked. We have Steve Cook coming in with a five gifted memberships. Thank you, Steve Cook, for the five gifted memberships there, my friend. Appreciate you very, very much, buddy. We got gifted going out to Ice Boy, Jason Fanny. Or no, no, not Jason Fanny. He's dropping stars. Uh, Michael Glickman. Um, we also have uh, Gaming with Euro. Joe G. No car for you as well. Congrats on the gifteds, guys. Appreciate you very, very much, Chad. Very, very much. Thank you, guys. Steve Cook coming in hot. Steve Cook is coming in hot, Chad. And we got 500 Lake Way. Oh, no. We have to talk. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're at Moe's. I don't like Moe's. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Thank you, Steve. Thank you so much, Steve. Mamma mia, chat. Okay, so we got to go into Moe's, and we got to talk to the talk to our girl here. <laughs> really? I feel like the developers were like, we're just gonna do this. <laughs> Your old girlfriend is there. Well, she's married, chat. It's trolling you. It is trolling me. That's dumb, Patrick. You should be able to use that door. All right. Yeah, we got in that way. Going sideways. Hi, Kay. Package for you. All right, we got to talk to Kate, guys. Might as well give it to you now instead of at home. Oh, oh, that's nice. Look at that. We brought a package to her work, chat. Look how nice we are. We did something nice for somebody. We're bringing in her package to her at her job, guys. Throw it through the window. <laughs> be hilarious. I thought I might as well give it to you now instead of, you know, waiting till you're home. Oh, What's thanks. Up, Steve Cook? That's super amazing. Thank you. Should I ask her what it is? Thank you for the gifted. Yeah, yeah. Dude, that is awesome. Glad you got one from Steve and Big T. Uh, we got Mike Hughes with that nine months Raya baby. Mike Hughes, thank you so, so much for the Raya baby, buddy. Uh, so just start delivering like the mail man in the movie Funny Farm. <laughs> what, just like chucking it? <laughs> Amber says, sure. Yeah, let's, uh, should I ask if it's anything illegal? Oh, yeah. Let's ask if it's illegal, chat, too. Yeah, let's ask number two. Yeah, let's pry a little bit. We're gonna, we're gonna pry, chat. It's nothing illegal, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm so excited about this. <laughs> I see. This is a guessing game. All right. Is it a... A new rocket? Oh, she did not just say that. She did not just say that. That's funny. Does anyone know the E.T. The e game? Does anybody know the E.T. game, chat? Four pounds a week. The E.T. game um, was a game that came out in the 80s for Atari. And it was widely it was widely known as the worst uh, video game ever made. Uh, E.T. for Atari, guys. 
and they ended up burying all the cartridges somewhere, like in the woods or somewhere. They ended up like burying all the uh, cartridges that never sold, guys. It was the worst selling Atari game. Yes, it was the worst game ever. <laughs> That's exactly what it was. There, there's actually a Netflix special on it. I highly recommend it. It's actually pretty interesting, guys. I don't know if it's Netflix, but yeah. Three is terrible. Yeah, three I think is good because you can't beat the game. Exactly, you can't beat the game either. Um, it's a horrible game. It was. Okay, so... Let's go with, um, let's go with, uh, number three. We'll go with number three here, chat. A bunch of copies of the E.T. game? I played ugh, it. I hope not. Okay. <laughs> She's like, ugh, I hope not. The suspense is killing me. Open it. Uh, you don't have to tell me. I mean, if it's illegal. Uh, yeah, open it. I'm gonna tell her to open it. The suspense sure. is killing me. Open it! Okay, you ready? It's actually a Yamaha DX7 synthesizer! Oh, that oh, is man, I'm super stoked this arrived so soon. I got this amazing deal on it through the classifieds. This old guy was selling it. Apparently, he had never really used it. I mean, what? How? Can you imagine owning something like this and not using it every moment you get? <laughs> I mean, this thing is used everywhere these days. So I was like, yes, this is mine. <laughs> Sorry, I can get carried away about this kind of stuff. She must have did so much c in the back chat. She is way too excited. That is BA though. That is really, really cool. Uh, a keyboard. That is pretty cool. Fr play Freebird. <laughs> yeah. I know you're doing that speed up, speeding up that thing again. Oh, yeah. I know you're doing that speeding up thing again. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do that. I know you're doing that speeding up thing blah, again. Blah, 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 to be honest, here. you lost me around the time you opened the box. But if it works like a computer, <laughs> it might be, Bobby. sign me up. Computers, eh? Oh, wait. Are you a programmer? Because if you are, you should totally check out the Insonic Mirage. Uh, you should totally try out programming. If you like sampling machines, you should totally try out programming. Oh, man. I have I a sampling machine right here. I would love to. So much to do, so Tobias. little time. Listen, Em, I totally owe you for lugging this around for me. Help. Now, what will you have? It's on the house. Help. Tobias. Help. Help. Tobias. Help. Tobias. Help. Help. Tobias. Help. Tobias. Help. Help. Tobias. Help. Tobias! Help! Help! Tobias! Sorry, Chad, I got carried away. I was playing with my keyboard. <laughs> uh, pie, I'd love some blueberry pie if you have it. No, I'm good, happy to help. Um, yeah, let's get some pie. Yeah, we pie. like pie, Chad. I mean, I'd love some blueberry pie if you have it. Oh, I just sold the last slice. We're clean out. Anything else? Yeah. I owe you? I owe you, it is. Did you just Apparently, offer me pie and then say we to sold get started out? On now, but Good to see you, and thanks again. No problem. Have Denied. fun with your synthesizer. Yes, thanks. Denied, chat. She like offered me pie, and then she like said we're sold out. What the heck was that about? Every time you play Coop's out, does he get commissions? Yes, I um I view his stream one minute every time I say Coop. <laughs> Thank you so much, Amber. Oh my goodness, we got Amber coming in with a vibe super sticker. Take up the vibes, Amber. As always, much, much appreciated. That's what I thought. I thought it was gonna be something like that, <laughs> but no. It ended up being a synthesizer. I guess the synthesizer kind of vibrates, chat. All right, let's head on over to Robert. We gotta go check out Robert, chat. Ah, uh, she won pie, she did. I did want the pie, but they were fresh out, chat, and I'm very, very sad about it. All right, let's head down this way. And we're going to deliver that last uh, package in the middle of the woods. Now, this is a place we haven't been yet, chat. Thank you so much, Amber and Mike Huth, for that nine months as well, buddy. Thank you guys so much for the support. Steve Cook with that five gifted and Big T with that one gifted as well. Thank you so much. Dan says she offered you anything you wanted. Oh, I thought she offered me pie. She said anything you want. Oh, I may have screwed that up. Sounds like you're going to get murdered. We might get murdered right now. This could be the end of the game. Chat, look at this beautiful view right here. Wow, look at that blue water, chat, blue water. Thank you so much, Amber. Appreciate you. Taco, she wants the tacos? <laughs> Dead in three, two, one. We might be. Hope I we haven't seen any bears yet in this game either. There might be bears, chat. Who knows? It could be wildlife. Somebody said they saw Bigfoot crossing the road earlier. I did not see Bigfoot, though. Um, she would have loved you a long time. Meredith gets hit on normal day. I know, she... How come I get hit on so much, chat? Chat. How come when I don't go out in public, people don't hit on me? Nobody ever hits on me in public. And now that I'm Meredith, I'm getting hit on it two ways from Sunday. 
That's not fair. Chris did. Oh, Chris, Chris did. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. I take that back. Crispy Chris. I forgot about Crispy Chris. Yes, he did. <laughs> Crispy. Never mind. Never mind. I retract it. Message retracted, chat. You're taking it. You're taking it. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying. Like, you know, it'd be nice. Uh, you don't go out in public. Oh, yeah, I don't leave the house. That's right, Bobby. All right, that explains a lot of it, too. All right, fine. These are all valid answers, chat. <laughs> These are all valid answers. Uh, look in the mirror. That's your answer, says Frank. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Frank. Look in the mirror, and that's your answer? Oh, that is brutal. Ooh, ooh, oh, look where we're delivering this. Uh oh. Hi, oh, I think I know what that is. What on earth did these folks order? Oh, <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre vibes, anybody? Picture time, Josh Miller. Is it picture time, buddy? Texas Massacre. Oh, my goodness. Reverse, reverse. <laughs> yeah. Saw three. Um, I mean, I'm a mailman. Nope. No answer. Thank goodness there was no answer. Why do I feel like I'm still going to get killed? Should we go around the back, chat? Let's go around the outside. Around the outside. Let's check this house out. See if we can see anything in there. You see any blood stains or anything? I don't see anything in the house, chat. I guess. Oh, my God, Lori. Yeah, I don't see anything, chat. No blood stains. Run. All right, let's run. Let's walk out of here quickly, chat. Go around the outside. Around the outside. All right, let's leave. We got to leave, chat. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel comfortable here. Go in the basement. <laughs> Cody, Cody, we're not going in the basement, buddy. Do you want to play a game? Oh, yeah. Wait, boy, Shane. Do you want to play a game? Holy crap. Holy crap, that's scary. Drug shop shaped like a saw. Maybe. Maybe, chat, maybe. That was scary. That's creepy. Let's get out of here. We gotta get out of these woods. Let's get out of these woods. <laughs> oh, I'm scared now. After that voice, I need my mommy. Me too. Help. <laughs> After that voice, we need to call for help. Oh wait, that's the wrong music. Help. Do you want to play a game? Help. Help. Um, off-roading with the mail truck. We are off-roading with the mail truck right now, guys. Thank you very much there, Amber. We got 400. Oh my God, Chad, you hit 400 likes today on a Monday stream. That never happens, guys, except for all the times that it happened. So thank you very, very much, Chad, for the 400 likes on the stream. Make sure you tap the like if you haven't done so yet. But we have met our goal for the day, guys. Yes, we are minimum amount of good today. <laughs> Let's get a couple of hashtag minimum good. We need some minimum goods, guys. Need starry eyed dance break. We do. We need a starry eyed dance break, chat. Yes, we do, guys. Yes, we do. How <laughs> about a high man Polly all around? That's right there, high man Polly. I don't know what you're saying, buddy. Name of the green dings, chat. We are minimum good. We are good enough. We are good enough, guys. Yes, we are. Feels like this song is fitting for some reason, and I don't know why. All right, we're going to meet Robert in the woods. Barely good enough, right? Thank you, Jared. Yes. Minimum effort. That's right, William. Minimum effort. Retired streamer. This is a beautiful area right here. <laughs> this Jared. Maybe Abraham. I should have probably kept it. You're right. Should have gave it to him. Nice favorite song, 2023. All right, we found Robert. 
Oh my god, he's in a tree. Robert's in a tree. What is he doing? He's doing lumberjack stuff, guys. He's doing jack stuff. We got Steve Cook coming in with a one nine. Or I'm sorry, that was Amber. Steve, thank you for the five gifted. Appreciate that, Steve Cook. Let's get a couple of hashtag got cooks in the chat, guys. We just got cooked by Steve again. Steve, thank you for the five gifted going out to Brian Cameron, Fisher PX, Philip Dean, uh, Je Joseph Kimball, and uh, Chris. Okay. Senile 911. I like that. Oh, wait, we don't have a package for him. We're just hanging out with him. <laughs> Climb his trunk. <laughs> Thank you so much, Steve Cook, for the generous five gifted memberships. Hey, Meredith, I'm up here. Hey, Robert. And we got Amber coming in. Oh, my goodness. Amber with a five gifted also. That is two bombs back to back. That makes 45 freaking gifted today. Amber. Thank you for the generous five gifted also. Uh, we got Casey Rogers, Sean Watts, Joshua McCracken, Tanner Time, and Josh Sell grabbing up gifted from Amber Walker. Thank you, Amber, for the generous five gifted as well. And Jason Owet. Oh my goodness. Jason giving gifted to Bob, Andrew, Ethan, Jeremy, and Jeremy Turner also. Two Jeremy's. That's Jeremyism, guys. That's Jeremyism. Thank you so much there, Mr. Jason Owet and <laughs> Patrick. Patrick, look what you started, Steve. Patrick Rowe to make it an even 50. No, wait, I'm sorry. There are, okay, these aren't even going all out yet. I think we have 60 gifted subs today. Oh my goodness, chat. This is absolute insanity here. Wow, 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 wow. We got Patrick coming in with a 10 gifted also. My goodness. And then we got Lori Stag with a six months. Thank you the six months, Lori Stag to Team Raya. Appreciate the six months, buddy. He's going to confess his love, then jump. Oh, my God. You better not, Rodney. Thank you so much there, Lori and Trucker Nathan with a one gifted also. They have a one gifted sub from Trucker Nathan and Chad Allendorf coming in with the five gifted memberships. Thank you, guys. All right. I think that covered the whole chat today. It was amazing. Happy gifted day, chat. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you, chat. Thank you so much. Seriously, that is way too much, guys. Way too much. You guys are absolutely awesome. Thank you, Amber. Steve, Jason, Patrick, Lori, Trucker Nathan, and Chad. Appreciate the love, guys. No more gray names. Nope, we got no gray names now, Chad. You guys are all members. That is amazing. Thank you for the huge gifted bomb, guys. Star Train. That is a that is a uh, sub train, guys. All right. Let, should we talk to him? You guys want to talk to Robert? Instead of Prime Day, it's Riot Day. <laughs> yeah, this is Rhyme Day. Rhyme. Oh, that doesn't make sense. Oh, dang it. I, I screwed up the whole vibe. I tried to make a funny and say Rhyme Day, but that's terrible. And we got Floyd coming in with a gifted as well. Thank you, Floyd, for the one gifted membership, buddy. Oh, my goodness. New York Tiki Bar grabbing a gifted from Mr. Floyd. Soul Train, yeah. Wow. It is Yes, it is Oprah today there, Nick Cross. My goodness. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Seriously. Huge, huge chat. All right, let's continue our conversation with Robert. We're going to talk to Robert now, guys. Let's do it. Um, should I say it's cold up there? Number three says Robert. There's just no number three. I'm going to say it's cold up there. Is it cold up there? What? I can't hear you. Maybe. Oh, I'm going to ask him if I should come up there. I'm going to come up there, Chad. I'm going to climb his trunk. Should I come up as well? Sorry, I can't hear you. Maybe I should come down first. You think? Cut down his tree. What if he falls? If he falls and we just leave his corpse in the in the woods. Can you hear me now? <laughs> Hi, Meredith. Uh, Trucker Nathan, thank you for the nine months also. Raya Baby says, look who's a Raya Baby. Oh, you are already a Raya Baby. So as I, get, I got to say these nine months, I would not look back. I would not ask back with you awesome people. Thank you so much. Thank you so much there, Trucker Nathan. That really means a lot, man. And thank you, Matthew Maynard, for the two months. How's it going, Ryan? Thanks for great entertainment every day. Thank you so much, Matthew, for that two months also. Appreciate you, Nathan and Matthew, guys. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for all the love today, chat. Uh, loud and clear, over. Uh, loud and clear, over. Thanks for coming out thank here. Thank you, Steve. This arborist job came up suddenly. What is an arborist job, guys? What does an arborist do? What, what is that? Awesome. I'd love to try that sometime. Yikes. I'm glad there's people like you for that. Uh, we're going to go with number two on this one. Or should we act like we want to do that? Uh, maybe we should act like we want to do that. 
Oh, it's tree work. Okay, tree upkeep. Gotcha, gotcha. Tree cutting. Okay, I got you. Cutting trees. Tree cutter. Tree cutter. Cutting trees. Tree tree pruner. Okay, so there he's he's maintaining the trees. Arbors. <laughs> Me OG since Facebook. That's awesome, Stan. Love to hear it, buddy. Uh, arbor stuff. Arbor stuff. <laughs> they, they arbor stuff. You know, Chuck or Nathan. Um, I'm gonna go with number one. Awesome. I'd love to try that sometime. It's great up there. I used to climb a lot. Still do, actually. But now I get paid more, Euros too. Euros and OG. Anyways, I figure it would also be good for What's you to see where the apartments are planned. Oh, here, really? What a shame. Oh, they're putting the apartments here. Oh, dang it. Oh, here? Really? Ugh, what a shame. Fear not. I have masterminded a wild card plan. His wild, his wild card plan. He's got a plan, chat. Remember he teased his plan earlier? Oh, what's up there? No, I didn't get rejected, Robbie. No. We we got we got into we got into some tea time, if you know what I mean, Robbie. Yes, we did, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, number 1. Okay, tell me about it. Tell me all about it. I've scheduled a recording session at a professional sound studio. Raya Studios? To do a tree version of We Are the World? <laughs> get out of here. Are we going to do a tree version of We Are the World? Yes, I can do Bruce. We are the world. We are the children. You guys better never say I sing, I sing bad again, okay? Wait. We are the world. We are the children. That was good. Or is this better? We are the world. We are the children. <laughs> Make them stop. Make them stop. All right, we'll stop. Yeah, we'll stop. Uh, Bruce is the spruce. Oh, Bruce is the spruce? Okay, that sounds great. I need some work, Robert. <laughs> Say that sounds great. That sounds great. I'll <laughs> be. Uh, who should I be, chat? Diana Ross, Cindy Lauper, or Bette Mildler, uh, guys? Bette Mildew, uh, Cindy Looper, or Deanna Ross? Who should I be, guys? Who should I be? I'm still the worst. <laughs> Am I worse or is Robert worse? Oh, my goodness, chat. How many voices are on that thing? Uh, like a bunch. <laughs> uh, two, three, or two. Uh, okay, we'll be Cindy Looper. Yeah, let's be Cindy Lauper. I think she's a fan favorite, chat. Cindy Lauper. Well, 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 let us realize all that a change can only come. Oh, yes. But no. Sorry. It'll be a radio message to get the people of Providence Oaks Team Robert. Oh, that was brutal. Okay, well, you're probably better that way. Oh, you're such a party pooper. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, yeah, probably better that way. <laughs> yeah, oh leave God. the singing to the pro. It's getting worse. It'll be this afternoon, by the way, at Jack Reynolds Barn. Are you in? I could use an extra set of ears. Chat, should we stop by Jack's studio, barn? Huh? He has a professional studio. We got to stop by the barn. Um, Wait a minute, what day is it? Wait a minute, what day is it? Didn't I have something I had to do? She's worse than Raj, she is. Wait a minute. What day is it in the game? Uh-oh. You made plans for tea. Oh, did I? It's today. It's Tuesday. Yeah, it's Tuesday in the game. On Wednesday, I have plans. Yeah, I have plans with the tomato plant RV lady on Wednesday. The chick from the video store was Tuesday, right? <laughs> Patrick, it's potato day. Wait, what, when do, do I even do I even have plans with the chick from the video store? I don't think I do. Um, we're getting high on Wednesday. Oh yeah, yeah. Wednesday's the day we're getting high, Deborah. Yeah, this is Tuesday. Okay, so we're safe, right? Yeah, I don't remember what happened with the video store lady. Uh, she just said swing by later. If you guys remember, that's all she said was swing by later. So, yeah. She, you said you would come by later. I did, Robert, but I don't know what that means. We didn't really have plans, though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, man, you get around. I do, Todd. <laughs> I do. Um, let, me, let me just say, okay, I'm in. And we'll try to do both. Maybe we'll try to do both. You said you'd meet her after work or something. Yeah, I remember that. I said I'd swing by later. But that's not really plans, dang it, Dan. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, she, I don't think she's going to be mad at me. Uh, goodbye, T. <laughs> goodbye, T. 
Cody, thank you for the 279 Canadian brother. Appreciate that so much. Says, do you do voiceovers for this game? I did not do the voiceovers for this game chat, unfortunately. I wish I would have. I would definitely love to. Okay, we're going to go with uh, two. Let's go. She will totally be mad. She might. She might zero, but let's do it anyway. Okay, I'm in. Okay, I'm in. Great. Meet me there after work. I'm going to get back up in this tree now. See you later. Okay, uh, good luck up there. Or be careful up there. Bye. Be careful up there. Thanks. We are the ones to make a brighter day. Not giving. Oh, I had to bleep some of that out. She'll watch you on your date. She'll be peed off at you. She might be. But here's the thing. I could swing by later now. You know what I'm saying? Or bring a chainsaw, maybe. It's <laughs> gonna cut me up into little pieces. Please bleep it. I did, I did. I tried to. I tried to chat. Oh my goodness, guys. Guys. Um, okay, so let's head on back. Tune in tomorrow when Ryan does the whole time. Eric, what do you think? Chat, do, you, do I look like a man that can't say no? Okay, I can say no. That's funny, says be right back. What's going on, be right back? All right, let's swing by now, though. Uh, what? I can't hear you. <laughs> let's swing by now, though. I think we should swing by the video store now. Oh, this is close to where I had my first kiss. Okay, she's talking about her first kiss, chat. Uh, where am I? Okay, we're over here. You look like a man that won't say no. This is Robert, that's true. Sorry, buddy, just call it like I see it. Ah, it's all right. It's all right. You're calling it correctly. Uh, thank you so much there, Cody Saiz. I appreciate that. Uh, 279 Canadian, man. Thank you for the support there, buddy. Um, yes, no, yes. Oh, dang it. How, there's, how did I even hit this? A little peck on the cheek, says Oliver. First kiss, not first tea time. No, first tea time is in my house. Oh my, Chad, I can't believe we did that. I'm still, I'm still reeling that in. All right, let's head on back to the post office. Let's swing by though. Remember when I said I'd swing by? We're gonna swing by the, the, uh, the video store, guys. Let's swing by. That way she can't get mad at me. That's coming out of your paycheck. Oh, I hope not. <laughs> right, is the town, oh my God, Bob. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm from out of town, remember? <laughs> I can do what I want. I don't even live here. I can do whatever I want, chat. Whatever happens in Providence Oaks stays in Providence Oaks, okay? I'm living on the edge. Um, gosh, should I key your car? Maybe I should key your car, chat. All right, I'm going to swing by the post office. Or swing by the video store. Let's swing by. Oh, it's closed. Oh. That's not good. But her car's still here, though. She's packing. Oh, yeah, she's still packing. That's right. You're right. Uh, ooh, you messed up. Oh, dear. I may have messed up, chat. Whatever happens to the back of the mail truck stays in the back of the mail truck. <laughs> we got Trucker Nathan coming in with a $5 super chat. Thank you for the $5 super chat. Mission Trucker Nathan says, Can't believe that I was shocked when I found out my toaster was not pro waterproof. Nathan, just get out. Key your car. We should have keyed the car. Yeah, definitely. Definitely should have done that. Stop buying you a new dress for a date that, I, that I'm going to stand her up on. Oh, we're out at the farm now. Uh-oh, we're out at okay, the farm. Okay, folks, it's showtime. Look, he's got Robert, a microphone you like your old pal yes, Ryan does. Before we start, I'm not a pro, so please bear with me. Uh, you'll. Should I encourage him? Should I encourage him or be a jerk? What do I do? Encourage him or be a jerk, guys? He's giving, I'm getting friend vibes from Robert, though. I don't know if I like that, chat. I mute him. <laughs> mute him. All right. Let's, do, let's, let's encourage him. Arm You'll wrestle. do great. Arm okay, wrestle. Robert. Take it away. <clears throat> Fellow Providence Okians, I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. Is this political? If you feel the same, this feels political. let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Perfect. That's a wrap, folks. Back to work. Hold on. Hold on, Jack. Meredith, what do you think? Yeah, I guess this is okay. Fellow Providence Okians, really, 
I miss a revolutionary vibe. It needs more passion. All right. I'm going to say it needs passionate vibes. Would you guys agree or disagree? I think we need passionate vibes. Would you guys agree or disagree, chat? Drop it in the chat. One, two, or three. One, two, or three. Mute two. Mute two. Uh, Trucker Nathan, thank you for that $2 super chat. I'm not reading that, Nathan. You're getting muted for that one, buddy. No, I'm just kidding. You're not. All right. <laughs> thank you very much for that too. Dollar super chat there, buddy. I appreciate it. Um, is it me or does Raya look like the Robert without hair? <laughs> Go on, chat. Thank you, buddy. Uh, Ham says, I hate when people tell people what to do uh, with land they don't know. I, 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 stop it, Ham. Don't get all political and crappy in my chat. Uh, tr yeah, chat, I just said. I just said, don't get political in my chat, <laughs> Bob. Um, I'll mute him. All right, thank you there, Dan. <laughs> thank you, buddy. Uh, Denver's going to as well. Thank you, Denver. Okay, so what do we do here, chat? I think we should go with number three. I think we should go with number three. Let's go the with the text. The text is fine, but I miss a revolutionary vibe. It needs more passion. Yeah. Um, okay, you might be right. Jack, one more recording, please. Sure, Robert. Here we go in one, two, three, action. Fellow Providence Okians, I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Better? <laughs> Should I give him? All right. He tried it twice. <laughs> actually, no. Should I say, yeah, that should do it, or actually, no? Let's go number two here. Robert looks like Raya while streaming. He does a little bit. Yeah. Except for the gray hair. I don't have any gray hair, chat. I don't have any hair. <laughs> yeah, let's go with actually no. Actually, no. Could you also try Attention Providence Oaks and Lake Lovers, listen up. Robert so, Z. just the first words. Yeah, Robert, if you could hurry up a bit. <laughs> Potatoes don't come out of the ground voluntarily. One, two, three, action. <clears throat> Attention, Providence Oaks. Lake lovers, listen up. Like that? A star is born. Now, let's do some real work. <laughs> no way, it's not quite there yet. <laughs> you know we gotta do number two, right? <laughs> not quite there yet. You guys are saying one. No, wait, it's not quite there yet. Well, Sorry. I don't give Sorry, a hoot. Jack. Robert, you said this would only take a minute. You're right, Jack. Sorry, Meredith. This will have to <laughs> Keep do. Trolling. Well, okay, it's your precious lake uh, or no problem. Oh, man. All right. No problem. All right, we'll say no, no problem. problem. This should be good enough. <laughs> All right. It's time to really roll up our sleeves. Be ready, Robert? Chainsaw you. Sure yes. thing, Jack. Meredith, I'm going to return the favor and help Jack out today. If you love birds wanting to spend more time together, she can come along too. Plenty of work to do. Ooh. Jack, what the? Okay, now we got the lovebirds going. Come on, Robert. Okay, so I better get going. Good luck with those taters. Nothing wrong with a bit of hard work. Uh, outdoors, let's go. Sure, I'll leave the lovebirds squabbing over to you. Squabbling. Heck. Okay, so we can, we can help by not being lovebirds. We can help by being lovebirds, or we can leave. I think we should, I think, oh man, this is this is the moment of truth right here. This is the moment of truth right here. Uh, they stopped the streamer, thank God, don't go picking potatoes. <laughs> Squab squabbling right, yeah. So, all right, so now we could, we could kind of pursue our original girl, or we could start to pursue Robert. I don't know what we should do here, chat, okay? Make a baby, says Jason Fanny. Make a baby. Uh, what do we do, guys? What do we do? Uh, we got uh, Trucker Nathan. Thank you for that $2 super chat there, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you for the $5 as well, my friend. You're awesome. Thank you so much, Trucker Nathan. Pick your own taters. Yeah. All right, maybe we should go with number two. Let's see where this goes. Let's see where this goes. Yeah, both. You got to pick potatoes. That's true. Yeah. Let's, let's go with both. Yeah. Nothing wrong with a bit of hard work outdoors. Let's go. Rock on. Let's do this. Yeah, let's okay, do folks. it. Yeah. Hop on my tractor. It's time for the real show. I get to ride a tractor. Woohoo, a shower. Uh oh. Do we get a shower? Did they say something about a shower? <laughs> what do I do? Uh, not Robert. Oh, what happened? Oh, I didn't get to ride the tractor. Meredith, it's me. Oh, 
Hi, Steve. I'm sorry. Didn't get the chance to look at the contracts yet. Oh, you didn't? Oh, we didn't look at the contract yet. Oh, the Sims. I gotcha. I gotcha. <laughs> no, not that type of shower. Uh, I'll look at them tonight, or I'm just very busy. Sorry. Ooh, I forgot about the contracts. The $5.5 million contracts. You rode enough in this town, says <laughs> Jason. Oh, dear, Jason. All right. Do we save our job and look at the tonight or say we're very busy? Sorry. I am going to say, I want to say I'm very busy. Sorry. Because I don't want to do any work tonight. We'll do them tomorrow. Yeah, we'll do them tomorrow. We'll do them tomorrow, chat. Yeah. We'll do them tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, Cassie Couch contract. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go. You guys all want me to say number one. I don't really want my job. I don't really care about the 5.5 billion Swedish kroner. <laughs> you know? Uh, Rip Meredith. Yeah. Let's, let's just say we're busy. Let's just say we're busy. You guys all want to do one, but I want to do two here. I'm just very busy. Sorry, chat. Sorry. All right. Hey, uh, I got to run. Corporate lawyer appointment. Bye. Uh-oh, he hung up on me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good answer, says Brian Cameron. That was a bad answer. Okay, do we review the contracts, stay home and watch TV, or read a book? <laughs> what do we do? What do we do? One, 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 one. You want me to review the contracts? Why do you want me to review the contracts? We could be watching TV, chat. <laughs> what did Dever say? Dever's laughing at me. Uh, Dan says, what did Dan say, guys? I missed Dan's comment, too. Son of a stick. Um, oh, my goodness, chat. Uh, one, one, one. All right. You guys really want me to review these contracts. All right. We'll review the stupid contracts, chat. Ah. All right. Here we go again. Watch Black Mirror. I love, dude, I watched all the new episodes of Gaming with Hero. They're so good, buddy. They're so good. All right, we reviewed the contracts, chat. It is now Wednesday. What did we have to do on Wednesday? There was good morning, Miss Weiss. Uh-oh. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. Tell Steve to shove the contracts where the sun don't shine. I would love to. I would love to do that. Oh, we're dead. Uh, good morning, Mr. Morgan, or good morning, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> good, good, mor good morning, Mr. Morning? Oh, yeah, we're supposed to get stoned after work. That's right. Yeah, okay. All right, let me say good morning, Mr. Morning. Good morning, Mr. Morning. <laughs> I need to inform you that your colleague, Frank Coleman, has been suspended. That was the stupidest thing ever. That was the stupidest thing ever. Frank was suspended. Oh, no. Oh, no. Should I say, okay, sir, anything else? Or say, why? Okay, sir, anything else or why? Uh, bye, Frank. Yeah, Frank just got suspended, guys. Visible confusion. <laughs> yeah, that was hilarious, Logan. Um, I think we should go with number two here, but we'll go number one. Frank? Suspended? Why? The only thing you need to know right now is that I will be filling his spot for the time being. Oh, no, he's going to be filling his spot. All right, what, where is Frank now? Okay, so do the ambulance, do the envelopes go to you now? Okay, so I'll, I'll ask him number three here. I'll ask him number three. Or maybe rip Frank. Did Frank die? Uh, Frank going to life crime now? He's just going to rob a diner next. He might, yeah. I think we should go with number three. Let's ask him about the job. Um, yeah, you guys are all over the map with this one. Justice for Frank. I am very sad about Frank, guys. Uh, don't rat out Frank. I would never uh, rat out Frank, chat. Uh, didn't do his reports. Three is the illegal thing. Oh, three is the illegal thing? Oh, pick one. Three is a bad idea. Okay, you're right. Three might be the illegal thing. You might be right, chat. Yeah, you might be right. Getting stepdad vibes from this mustache. I know. Okay, let's go with number... Let's go with number two. Let's go with number two. Anything but three. Okay. All right. But where is Frank now? Frank is not here. But I'm a little worried about him. Where is he if he's not here? Somewhere else. Have a nice day, Miss Weiss. Oh, man. That does not sound good. Oh, we got some nice rain, chat. Nice rain. Ah, delicious rain, guys. Okay, bye. Oates, good morning to you. Oh, my goodness, oh, yeah. chat. What a mess. 
<laughs> He's in the slammer. All right, chat, so today is the day we meet up with the I van people, so stick around, Last guys. Let's see what that's about. Lake, Ooh, he's gambler's in honor. Still the government got him. I think the government got him. In, You're right. That's scary, chat. That's scary. Rip Frank, Federal Postal Penitentiary. Here's your mail. <laughs> what a butt. I know. What a butt, Stephanie. CYOB, what does that mean? He's uh, he's in the chainsaw cabin. <laughs> he's in the chainsaw cabin, Cody. <laughs> yeah, what if that's what the chainsaw was for? They cut up Frank into little pieces, and now he's now he's wolf meat. He's probably in the lake. He's probably in the bottom of the lake. He went postal. I bet he's in the bottom of the lake, chat. I bet he is. Look at that station wagon, that's sweet. Cover your own butt. Oh yeah, cover your own butt. Oh no, no. What's this? The flick shack has closed down and will not reopen. Any unreturned tapes can be dropped off before September 22nd. It has been a privilege to serve as Providence Oaks premier oh, home no. cinema provider. Walter. Thank you for your patronage. All the best. Your Flick Shack proprietor, Angie. Hmm. She gone, chat. She gone. Her car's still there, though. Her car's right here. So she's not that far. <laughs> oh, no. Big sad. Yeah, that was sad, guys. I'm sad about that. Ah, uh, the Flickin' Shack. Yeah, the Flick Shack is no longer. Ah, uh, very sad, guys. But Shacks have back rooms. They sure do. They sure do. Eh, that's sad, guys. I'm sad now. Town folk are all resting in the woods. <laughs> oh, man, she left. I don't know if she left left yet. Hopefully she calls me. You think she's going to call me, chat? Hopefully she calls me, guys. Rip Flick Shack. I know. Guys, let's get some rips in the chat for the Flick Shack. Oh, bye, Taco Stand. I know. I'm so sad. I was in bed. Now she's running from you. You were bad, now she's running for you. That wasn't bad. Maybe she saw me with the with the lumberjack, Robert, guys. Frank just started a Twitch Hot Tub channel. Oh, did he? So you think he's on Twitch? He's on a Hot Tub channel now. Thank you, Trucker Nathan, for the supers there, buddy. I appreciate you. That the company car um, is a flick shack. Oh, really? Oh, it could be the company car. You might be right, Macaroni Tony. Yeah, maybe. Could be. Polly, I hope you're having a good day at work, says Steve Cook. Well, thank you there, Steve. Uh, no, he's, he's on Facebook, so this is Ferramero. Oh my goodness, Ferramero. Right, let's see here. Let's deliver this mail, chat. We gotta deliver the mail. Is that even the right house? I think it's the right house. Rips in the chat for the Flick Shack. I'm, I'm very sad about that. I miss the Flick Shack, guys. I really wanted to see, I wanted, I wanted to see her succeed, you know? You know what, though? Maybe, maybe we will run away together. I don't know. I'm kind of like settling into this town right now. And I was hoping that it would go in the direction of me staying in the town. But it's not looking that way right now, chat. Number one flick salute to me. <laughs> Cody, I don't know what you ate before the stream today, but I want somebody. Because holy cow, your comments are something else. Hmm, these look like bills. Tobias, I bet you are, buddy. You are pretty settled in. I, I am settled in. You're right, Jason Olet. <laughs> You're right, buddy. All right, let's see where else we need to go here. We have all our mail delivered in the town. Oh, we got one more package to deliver. Dang it. Missed the package, guys. Missed the package. Hey, Euro. What's going on, Euro? How you doing there, buddy? She's opening other people's mail. <laughs> yes, she is. Ryan's streams are always funny no matter what he plays. Well, thank you there. Thank you there, Power Man. Oh, we have a we have a package going to the general store chat. Oh, this is the mail. This is the photo place. You guys, remember this? I forgot about this place. Let me check this out. Down on Main Street, guys. I might have to take a stress pee before the end of the stream today. Okay, let's see. So we got 207 Main Street. It looks like that's our only Main Street package, guys. Take the photos. Yeah, we got. We did take a bunch of photos, Harry. We did, buddy. All right, let's talk to this lady. This is the smoking lady. Hello, Nancy. Look at this photograph. Ah, there's the mail. How's the photography coming along? Photography. My photography fests have been completed. Okay, I guess. I've been using the camera for a bit. 
Haven't taken any pictures yet, to be honest. I've taken uh, a few pictures. Which, should we say completed, though? Because I don't really care about that at all, you know? We might as well just say it's complete. Bring out the rubber chicken. <laughs> my rubber chicken's actually staring at me from across my room right now. That's kind of creepy. I don't like it. I need to put it somewhere else. I sit down when I stress peace. says be right back. That's right. All right, let's go with number one. My photography quest has been completed. Here's your equipment pack. Okay, then. Let me see if I can manage to develop them. Come back tomorrow for the results. Thank you. See you All tomorrow. All right, chat. Let's get a couple hashtag results, guys. We're going to come back tomorrow for the results, even though I'll probably forget. <laughs> uh, Game of the Euros dropping the, uh, the camera, yes. Uh, maybe she can help you take your pictures. Maybe. All right, let's go deliver the rest of these here, chat. We're going to deliver the rest of these. Results. Thank you for the hashtag results there, Robert. Appreciate you, buddy. Oh, God. I forgot I took a picture of that underwear, Robert. Oh, man, Robert. I took... Oh, my God. Doug. Doug, I forgot I took a picture of that. <laughs> there is a picture of some underwear in there. Oh, dear. And you want your pictures? I bet she does. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Blowing out the cobwebs. <laughs> Amber, are you here? It's just dead. Oh my goodness! Dong, da, dong, dong, dong. I did. I took a picture of those undies, chat. Yes, I did, guys. <laughs> All right, let's go over to the right. We got a package and a letter on this block. And then after this block, we get to go over to the west, guys, or the east. Did you take pictures of the tea? I don't believe I did, Jonesy. I wish I would have, though, buddy. I would like to get those developed for sure. I need to know what happened during the tea time incident. I want to know how far it went. I need to know, chat. I have questions. They kind of just blacked out there, and I'm very upset about that. Ooh, interesting. <laughs> Ooh, interesting. Weast East says Tobias. Tobias! She wants a picture of Raya with hair. John M., there is a picture of Raya with hair. You guys want to see it? There is a picture of Raya with hair. It is, it is buried, though. It is buried, chat. I've never shown it. I've never shown it, guys. <laughs> Somehow, some way, there were people in the community that got a hold of this picture. I posted it in Discord for like one second one time. And yeah, oh, I'll never show it. I'll never show it. No, no, no. We're, we'll never show that picture. It'll never be seen, guys. I flashed it in Discord one night at like three o'clock in the morning. And a couple people did get a screenshot of it, Oops. guys. Left the package in the Oops, truck. I left my package. The internet doesn't forget. I know. I don't know if uh, whoever has it is here. Welsh says I have it. No, you don't, Welsh. No, you don't. You don't have it, Welsh. That's lighter than I thought. Wait, which package did I get? Oh, crap. Did I get the wrong one? Ham says I got it. Oh, Ham does have it, yeah. 202 Lake Road. Okay, 202 Lake Road, that one. That's the one, guys. Oh, How much is it going to take to be right back? No, 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 no. It is not for sale, guys. Um, let's see here. Do not use anyone else's name or photo or change it or you will get banned. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Yeah, guys. All right. So apparently, uh, anybody that's um, impersonating anybody in the chat, if you are impersonating someone in the chat, change your name right now. Do not leave another comment until you change it or you will be banned from the stream. We do not do person impersonations anymore, chat. Especially of other people in the chat, guys. Do not do it. Do not do it. To Discord, we go. Exactly. <laughs> no, don't drop it in Discord. Do not drop it in Discord if you have that photo. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Deborah. I, I can't believe that. That's ridiculous. People are so ridiculous with that stuff. Um, but thank you, moderators. Right, I'll leave it on thank the doorsteps. Uh, there's two people impersonating people, says uh, Paul. I got you there, buddy. Yeah, we're going to ban him. We're going to ban him. You drop another comment in here if you're impersonating someone, uh, you will get banned, chat. We're not doing that, guys. All right, so we're going to drop the package. I'm the real Ryan. <laughs> you are a real Ryan there, Mr. Ryan Paul. Yes, you are. It's my other name. This is my other name. That's okay. Just don't impersonate other people from the chat, guys. That's all I'm asking. Um, I don't know, Faramero. It's really weird, buddy. It, it's cre borderline super creepy. Not borderline. It is creepy. It honestly is. Um, I want to see that photo, says uh, Power Man. No, no, no. I, we're not talking about it anymore, guys. I gave you another clip. Thank you, Crispy. 
<laughs> I'm the real Ryan, says Ryan Aggie. Really, buddy? I'm a Canadian Tobias. I bet you are. Uh, I'm the real Slim Shady. Hey. Will the real Slim Shady please stand up, guys? John Collie says I'm actually sober right now. Does that count as impersonating? <laughs> if Drunk Holly is actually sober, does that count as impersonating? Chris Myers, no. Anybody that has the picture knows not to post the picture. We're not going to post the picture to Chris Myers. <laughs> Do not. If anybody that has it posts it, oh, there will be consequences the likes of you've never seen, chat. Oh, the consequences. When I impersonate Rogan or Lupin Logan. That's fine there, buddy. If you're impersonating yourself, that's fine, guys. <laughs> Terrence isn't posting it. You better not post it. There's only like three people that have the picture, guys. <laughs> I'm Euro. You're real. You're the real Euro? All right, 500 Lake Road. We got a package for Lake Road, guys. Chat, don't listen to Raya. Don't listen to Raya. Don't listen to Raya. Uh, Dennis Gers, thank you for the 11 months there, buddy. I appreciate this. <laughs> There's people in Discord right now. Hi, Maureen. <laughs> P.O. people, I need to pause the music. All right, let's play the game. Uh, gosh, darling, I want to hear this. And so do you. It's from our own Robert Harris, who wants to keep Providence That's true, Steve. Free. That's exactly right, Steve. Uh, don't Cook. lie to yourself. He's talking about the trees. <laughs> Take it away, Robert. Dear people I'm going to shut Robert down Stokes. Discord if I I'm have Robert to. I'm Robert Harris. I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Isn't that something? It could have been more juicy, I guess. But it does say exactly what he wants it to, which is rare for our Robert. Even though he does have his redeeming qualities, doesn't he just? I wonder how he came up with the idea, though. All right, what should I say, chat? What should I say? All right, guys, stop, stop with the Discord. <laughs> guys are in Discord. Stop with the Discord. I'm going to shut down Discord. i got to shut down Discord now. Stop stop asking for photos in Discord. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. <laughs> God, there's like a war. There's a war. Here we go. Shut it down. <laughs> shut it down. I shut it down. Ryan's so scared right now. He's watching Discord. <laughs> I am so scared. Uh, Dennis Gersh, thank you for the red level re-up, man. 11 months to red level for Dennis Gersh. Thank you for the 11 months, buddy, says Peepin' Raya. Thank you for the 11 months of support, Dennis Gersh. You're awesome there, buddy. Nice files, right? Don't look at my files either. You base open. <laughs> They'll be selling pictures. Why no photos too juicy or something? It is the worst photo ever, Josh. Okay, I'll, I'll tell you this. The next stream that we get 500 likes on, if we actually get 500 likes on a live stream while I'm live, I will show the photo, okay? But that's the only way we're doing it. I'm gonna bribe you, chat. No, let's make it 550. Let's make it, let's make it really hard. You guys are gonna have to do work for that photo, chat. <laughs> Look at these photos. Look at these photographs. 550 likes on a live stream. The next time it happens, I will show you the photo, chat. <laughs> like the tank stream, Jerry. Uh, thank you very much there, David Rivers, for that 11 months, man, of Team Raya also. Thank you for the 11 months. Dennis Gersh and David Rivers, appreciate the resupport. Dennis says, Peep and Raya. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Is it worse to be playing the French horn? Oh, yeah, way worse. Way worse. It's the worst photo that's ever been taken of me. The absolute worst photo that's ever been taken of me. <laughs> I like the photo on Discord better. Me too, me too. Hurry up and like the stream. Oh my god. All right, I help out when he's recording at Jack's studio. Robert set it up himself at Jack's. He mentioned it was going to be recorded at Jack's. Should we tell the Why would we lie about this? Why would we lie, chat? I'll just say I helped out. Actually, I helped out a bit when he was recording it at Jack's studio. Is that right? It wasn't dropped in Discord, guys. I closed the Discord. <laughs> uh, stream mysteriously ends at 488 likes. No, 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 no. Um, thank you very much there, John M., my dear good friend. What's going on there, John M.? How you doing, buddy? We got Crispy Chris as well with the $2 super chat. Says, hey, what did I miss besides sitting on the toilet? Um, somebody fill Chris in, please. Now, Maureen, don't Maureen this out of proportion. I don't even know what this means. I wasn't paying attention. So you're it making is. me distracted, chat. I see. Robert wasn't kidding when he said uh, he wants to keep pretty things around in Providence Oaks now, was he? Oh, chat. 
No, he just asked me to help keep it pretty. Oh, that's not exactly how he put it, and neither should you. So should I snip back at her, chat? Should I snip back at her? <laughs> or what should I do? Um, three, two, one. I don't know. I don't know what we should do. 3.333. The picture is in your only... No, no, no. The picture's not in my OnlyFans chat. I did, says Chris. You did? Uh, snip it. I think we should snip back, yeah. Uh, or maybe we should say three. Yeah, maybe we should say three. I, I want to snip back, but no. You think so? I don't so? want to be like a prude, you well, know? Well, that's what I heard. Anyway, I actually wanted to talk to you about something else. What are you doing this Sunday evening, hon? Um, something tells me I'm about to find out. Something tells me I'm about to find out. You know it. Listen here. I'm hosting a very special first time open mic night this upcoming Sunday. We'll have some drinks, some food, discover the town's hidden talent or not. If you know what I mean, <laughs> it'll Jerry. be a hoot. More like a hoot and a half. Count me in. <laughs> Feel cold coming on. Cough, cough. Oh my God. Chat, should we go? No more singing. Oh God. Oh heck no. I think we should not. Wait, what, what did she ask? What did she ask? Two or one? Oh, heck no. Open mic night. Oh, yeah. Open mic night. Yeah. I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with two on this one. We gotta go with two on this one. You gotta go. I don't wanna go, Jared. I don't wanna go to open mic night, guys. I don't. Two, 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 two. Okay. Oh, I feel a cold coming on. <laughs> I do hope you are not mocking my open mic night idea, Miss Wise. Or my food. Oh. I've settled it. I will see you this Sunday at 8 p.m. She won't and take tell no everyone for an you answer. meet, okay? Let me see you put those postal delivery muscles to good use. You can't get out of it. You can't get out of it. Why do I have a feeling I don't have a choice here? Why do I have the feeling I don't have a choice here? There you go. You're catching up. Now I have to go unpack some deliveries out back, but I will see you soon, darling. And don't forget about the open mic. I couldn't if I wanted to. Oh my God, Chad. So, dang, we couldn't get out of the open mic night. We have to do it. Oh, that's bad, Chad. That's bad, guys. You and Robert can't do, can't. The lady's almost bad as Callie. She is. I, I can't stand her. I'll be honest with you. I cannot stand her. She is the worst character. I think I don't like her worse than the old lady. Honestly, I don't know why. I just hate her. <laughs> I just hate her. Sometimes I wonder if no matter what you choose, and so, yeah, I think some of the responses you have to do, Jason, I agree with you, buddy. Some of the love interests, I think, are all optional. Um, but some of the other stuff, I think, is mandatory. Like, I think going to smoke some... Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah, that's what we are going to do, actually. <laughs> all right, let me go to the farm. We got a package at the farm, guys. We got to deliver this package to the farm. I hate pushy people. I know, Jonesy. Yeah, yeah. They're pushy, pushy. Yeah, I don't like that either. Can you drive into the drink? Yes, you can, Chris. We did drive into the lake earlier. <laughs> or yet, yeah, last stream. I'm sorry, not earlier. It was the last stream we drove into the lake. Who was here when we drove into the lake? Show of hands, guys. Who was here when we drove into the lake? You guys remember? I'll take my chances at the chainsaw cabin. And yeah, I know. We might as well go to the chainsaw cabin, to be honest with you. All right, there we go. Oh, there was like a big crow stalking me. Uh, thank you for the hands there, Mr. John Malina. John Malina was the only one here. <laughs> Chad says me. Chad was here. Doug Meyer was here. Uh, Ham Handling was here. Wait, thank you, guys. Where's the package? I love how it reminds you about the package, guys. Here. Oh, wow. A lot of you guys were here for that. Yeah. We did drive into the lake there, Crispy. Okay. One Reynolds Farm. One more package here, Chad. Amber was here. Uh, Mario Ford was here. Uh, hi, Mail Daniel. Mail Carrier Meredith. Oh, wow, that was a fake one. Oh, my goodness. Wow, good eye moderators. Good eye moderators. Wow. Thank you, moderators, for getting rid of that. Wow, they even use their profile picture and everything. That is really creepy. You should probably never come back, whoever you are. Okay, so let's see here. Farmer Jack, hello, Jack. And I'm going to look at that profile and try to figure out who it was, too. And I will ban your real profile as well. Yep, that is so nasty. All righty. Uh, here are mods. Thank you, mods. Quick finger mods. They got quick fingers. Yeah. That tricked me even. Uh, quick fingers Denver. Hey, 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 hey. A bias. <laughs> Farmer Jack. Hello, Jack. We'll call him Farmer Jack, guys. Farmer Jack. 
good to see at least someone working today. They were, I don't think they were subbed. No, they weren't subbed. Great job, mods. Yeah, the mods, the mods are on top of stuff, guys. They are, chat. <laughs> Dan, what are you doing? Don't be posting that stuff. That's not even the photo. Dan, that's Dan. Not Dan. I'm trying to do a live stream here. Do I have to ban the mods from the Discord? <laughs> All right, as opposed to you, as opposed to Frank. Right, I can't even pay attention to these to conversations. You, you guys yep. are too distracted. Can't harvest taters with all this rain. Luckily, <laughs> Frank's keeping me busy. <sighs> it's true, Dan. You're right. You spoke to him. I'm not surprised. Okay. You spoke to him? Yeah, just talked to him on the phone. He's mad as a wet hen. It's quite entertaining, actually. Thanks for dropping by, mail yeah, carrier. I, know I freaked out about I it. I gotta get back to it. <laughs> is it well past harvesting season? I feel like that photo is like inciting things, though. <laughs> yeah, All right, that wasn't even that bad. But Dan, Dan did drop a public photo of me. That's true. It was a public photo of me. Why did I get all bent out of shape? Uh, thank you for the Chris. Thank you, Chris, for the two dollars super chat. Says you know what they say about quick fingers right. What do they say about that, Mr. Chris? What do they say, buddy? Isn't it well past harvesting season? Good luck with the weather. I hope it clears up. Okay, yeah, we'll say Jack. Good, luck with, the good luck with the weather. Hope it'll clear up. Thank you much. Yeah, I didn't want to get in a whole, whole thing with him, chat. All right, there we go. Let's return to the post office. Now you know what it's time for, right? Let's do it, chat. Oh. All right, now we have to go meet the people by the lake. You guys remember the people by the lake that invited us to um, hang out with them on their last night? That's what we're going to do right now, chat. Thank you, Crispy, for the $2 and the $2 there, buddy. I appreciate you, buddy. I really do. Swift fingers, Ray. Swift fingers, Ray. Uh, it's doobie time. It sure is, guys. Let's get weird in the woods. We're going to get weird in the woods, chat. Let's do it, guys. All right. Oh, wait. We actually have to go to the post office first. Let's not use the postal van while while we're doing this. I almost went in there. I almost went there in the postal van. Oh, dear. Time to show the photo. It's full. We got full. We need 90 more likes, chat. 90 more likes. We haven't got 500 likes on a live stream in probably months. Random drug test tomorrow. Exactly. Yeah, that could be too, Jason. <laughs> What's the postal van? Right, let's go see what this is all about, though. We're going to go back, chat. Let's go back to the post office. Uh, what would our new boss think? That's true, Nick Cross, but yeah, we're not going to do that. We, we're, we're currently being watched by our new boss. I forgot about that. We do have that new boss, guys. Thank you, New York Tiki Bar. I appreciate the like there, buddy. Uh, we also have Mr. Crispy Chris. Thank you, Chris G and Julia. Says quick fingers. Uh, hey, Chris. Chat, is it my fault that this chat is just full of pervs? Or is it your fault? Whose fault is it? We're not doing that anymore, okay? Creature from the lagoon, visit the campsite in 321. <laughs> yes, it is your fault. It is my fault. You're right. Uh, it is my fault. Yes, I let it happen for so long. Now I'm trying to like go back on it, and then we got Chris dropping those types of comments. That's your fault. They need help. That's true. Hello. Hi, Meredith. It's me. Why am I at home right now? <laughs> Thank you for calling Alcoholics Anonymous. How may I help you? Oh, please, Meredith. It's not that bad. You're just jealous. You trained us. Had a few drinks here as well. 6040? <laughs> no, I'm fine. <laughs> Had a crew. few drinks here as well. Nice. It's good to hear that you're enjoying yourself. Why haven't you told her yet? Let me talk to her. Well, excuse me, Mrs. Weiss. Meredith, sorry to break it up. Your mom wants to talk to you. Meredith, I'm so excited. Your dad and I found this cottage this weekend near the beach. It's so pretty. Not too big, but who wants to be inside anyway? Um, that's a weird response. We'll go wow, number two. Wow, that sounds great. <laughs> What's the plan? Live there? Yes. We talk to the owner. We can rent it for the Peace time this, being, this spend the bias. winter here. And if we like it, we can buy it and settle down here for good. Well, that's quite a big step. Life changing and all that. Awesome. I'm so happy for you. Let's awesome. be happy for them. I'm so happy for you. Isn't it something? And uh, it means that our house will be vacant for a while. Oh. We won't put it on the market. 
until we've tried out Florida for a few months. They're moving to so, Florida! If you want to extend your stay in Providence... Guys! Uh, no thanks, I need to get back. Dude, we can extend our stay in Providence! What do we do, chat? Oh my goodness! Probably Bubba's boarded up Shaq, maybe. <laughs> so does this mean you have to work at the post office permanently? I guess so, Deborah. I don't know. Um, two, two, two. Yeah, I think we should stay in Providence Oaks. I think we should stay, guys. We got a free house here, chat. Free house. Oh my goodness. Yes. Yes. Are you serious? I'm pretty serious, yes. But uh, it's a pretty big deal, so just think about it for now. Hmm? Can I talk to her for a sec again? Yeah, uh, here comes your dad again. Yeah, Hi, stay, Kira. Rodney. I'm going to get us something bubbly. Hey, Meredith, just wanted to say that I'll call again at the end of this week. Have a great one. Oh, that's okay. what I. I'll Bye, do Dad. that, Patrick. I'll do that if that opportunity comes up, buddy. But it looks like uh, it looks like the video store clerk isn't including me in her plans. Oh, here we go. Or two times. Memories, memories, memories. Here we go, chat. Of you and me. Oh. oh, please stop. Memory. No, that's not Robert Denver. That's not Robert. That's the that's the hip. That's the 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 drug lord guy. <laughs> Whatever he's doing. Oh, done. Mickey. The couple that's going to Canada. That was so deep. Right, Meredith. <laughs> Hit the mute button. Uh, should I say, uh-huh, or should I say, wow, yeah, awesome. That was the worst. I'm going to say, uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's in the darkness <laughs> when my soul stars align and, and illuminate the real me. Oh, baby, I'm so happy for you. Oh, baby. We, we need to celebrate this moment. I'll be right back, ladies. Mickey can be difficult sometimes, but nights like these, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else but with him. That's because we're live, Macaroni Tony. The chat and the Discord was being bad right now. So you have to chat here, guys. You got to chat here, not the Discord. <laughs> Get high out of your mind. That's why you're following him all the way to Canada? How did you two meet? So what, what should I ask him, chat? What should I ask them, guys? Um, let's see here. So what are we asking him, guys? What are we asking him? One, two. Um, I, I, yeah, I don't know. I kind of want to, like, pry into their personal life. I want to figure out what they're doing here and where, where they're going. Um, but I don't want to, like, screw this up, you know? Two. All right. Let, yeah. Let, let's do number two. We'll do number two. Chat. Finish him. How did you two meet? At a dorm party. He was the cool guy who dropped out of college, and I was about to do the same. Is she interrogating you again, June? Wait, he's back. Oh, Mickey. Be nice to sweet Meredith. <laughs> I'm just kidding now. Uh, sorry for being a hard ass the other day, Meredith. It's just that we need to be a bit cautious. Cautious of what? Cautious of what? That's what I want to know. That's what I want to know, chat. Possibly, Brian. We don't know, buddy. We don't know enough about it to dispute it. Uh, he appears out of thin air. He did. He did. Uh, let's see. Yeah, number two. Let's, let's pry. Yeah. Cautious of what? The man, of course. Always the f***ing man. Oh, my God. I bleeped it in time. <laughs> he, said, he said a bad word. He did it dirty. Oh, man, good thing I blew... Man, I get them fast fingers. You guys think Denver's got the fast fingers. Your old power eyes got those fast fingers, chat. <laughs> I got it. Great timing. We nailed it. I nailed it. Yeah, that's the first time I ever nailed it. That was perfect. It was. <laughs> man, good thing we nailed that one. All right. The man, what man? You guys are sticking it to the man, eh? Uh, let's go to... Let's go to number two here, guys. So, you guys are sticking it fingers to the man, on the man, button. eh? Hell yeah. Can't stand the man. Anything with authority in whatever shape or form it appears. I know what you mean. Feeling like a prisoner of society. Sometimes I think a bit, bit think a bit of authority is useful. Okay, chat. Do we like authority? Oh, oh. Oh, wrong button. Do we like authority or do we not like authority, guys? What do we like? Number one or number two? I think we're. Gonna, I want to go with number one. I'm gonna go with number one here, chat. Uh, sounds like Riot as a teenager. Oh <laughs> God. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, R2. Don't be a square. Yeah, I don't want to be a square, chat. I don't want to be a square, guys. What'd Kyle say? What'd Kyle say? I miss Kyle's comment, chat. Son of a stink. Um Oh, oh, because I did Kyle. I did the Kyle. Yeah, I did the Kyle. One. Alright, I think we're I think we're all in agreement. I think I know what you mean. Feeling like a prisoner of society. Hey guys. 
Let's not spoil this evening with heavy stuff, okay? I like heavy stuff. Ah, you're so right, Junebug. Who cares about the man when I've got you? There's something that'll make you feel lighter. Much lighter. <laughs> That better be harmless tobacco. <laughs> Should I do it? Should I do it? Let's ask the chicken. What would you do, chicken? Oh yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> oh my god! My turn. You need a U-Haul? Yeah. How Where's about the U-Haul? How about some booze? How about some booze? <laughs> I already know what the chat's gonna say. Sure. What do you have? Beer, wine, and whiskey. Alright, do we want beer, wine, or whiskey, chat? I think we should be classy. And go with the wine. You guys want to do it? Yeah. All right. You want to go with the wine? Let's ask Drunk Holly. Drunk Holly, you still here? Where's Drunk Holly at? Drunk Holly, what would you what would you prefer out of these three options? Let's ask Drunk Holly. Uh, Denver says the whiskey. I think we should go with the whiskey. Yeah. Let's go with the whiskey, guys. I think we should definitely go with the whiskey chat. What do you guys think? <laughs> uh, Steven Taylor drop of the whiskey. A lot of you guys saying three. Yeah. And a lot of you guys are saying three. Maybe maybe three is the way to go. All right, let's go with three, chat. Let's go with three, guys. Whiskey. Why not? <laughs> gotcha. Be right back. Oh, my goodness, chat. The sober drunk hall. Yeah, sober drunk hall. <laughs> Memory. Oh, he's Memories. ruining this evening. Memory. Sorry, I had to mute it, chat. I had to mute it, guys. Had to. It was terrible. Hey. Oh, he's still singing. All right, here you go. <laughs> Terrible. Oh, all right. We had a little swig of whiskey. Ah, uh, this is the life. So are you guys on the run? Should we ask them if they're on the run? That might be a bit too intrusive, guys. What do you think, though? Now that they've had a few drinks, um, almost at 500 likes. Oh, my God, Dwayne. No way. There's no way we're getting 500 likes today. If we get 500 likes, I got to show the photo. Oh, dear. Uh, she gave you the red solo cup. She did. Um, yeah, let's go with number, we'll go with number one. Most of you guys are saying one. Ah, oh, this is the life. It sure is. It will be even better once we're finally in Canada. Hope you guys will be happy in Canada. How are you guys going to cross the border? Should we ask them about the border? Should we be a buzzkill or just say number one? Number one or number two here, chat? Oh, lick that like. Thank you, Crispy, for the $2 super chat, buddy. He says it's like... Van Driesen all over again. Yikes. <laughs> what is Van Driesen? <laughs> Once again, I have no idea what Crispy Chris is talking about. Thank you for the very, very kind $2 super chat, Mr. Crispy Chris. Thank you, brother. Thank you for the support, my friend. Number one. I think we should go with number one. Yeah. I'm sure you'll have more peace in Canada. I hope you guys will be happy yeah, there. I don't want to be a buzzkill. so exciting. Damien will pick us up with his Jeep tomorrow morning. We'll have a cozy hour under That's the blanket, right. swim Jeep. across the border. And then we're good. Jeep, Chad. Hey, He's got a Jeep. I just realized we're abandoning the RV. You should totally have it. Mickey, can Meredith have the RV? What piece of junk? <laughs> Knock yourself out. I just got a free RV! Chat! Chat! Uh, well, they won't make it with a Fiat. They're gonna make it. <laughs> Rise Red Jeep. All right, Brian Lima, you have a good one, buddy. Dude! Dude! Let's get some great days in the chat. It's not theirs to give. Oh, it's theirs to give. I'm taking it. Is it even yours to give away? What do we ask? Really, guys? That's awesome. I think we should take it. <laughs> should we take it? I feel like we should take it, guys. We got to take it, right? Uh, I know. You're right there, Denver. All right. One, one, one. Yeah, look, we're taking it. Let's really, take guys? It. <laughs> that's awesome. No problem. We don't really believe in possessions anyway. Whatever you decide, we'll leave it at the gas station. That's where we rendezvous with Damien. All right, they're wow. going to leave it at the gas station chat. Nice. 
Memories, memories, memories of you and me. Memories. <laughs> Sorry, Jack. Finish him. Oh, dang it, I didn't do the thing right. I hit the wrong button. I'm still getting used to the buttons. It's just, that was just me saying finish him. Finish him. <laughs> that was just me saying finish him. Power Mad is right. What did Power Mad say? Cops are ready the RV. You're being set up. Am I being set up? Let's take the RV and leave. <laughs> Cops the Thursday morning, P.O. Oh, we drug don't have test any callers time. today, so I'll bring up one of my own pet peeves. P.O. Positive <laughs> or that key. Chad, what day of the week is the it? idiotic plans for pedestrianization of Main Street. It's... <sighs> Well, Jack's like going crazy. Don't get me started or I won't even have time for the wet. Speaking of, a few clouds early on, but they will be gone soon. Music time. The RV is secretly a meth lab. It might be, yeah. It's Thirsty Thursday. Oh, okay. It's Thirsty Thursday in the game, guys. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. You don't know anything about the RV? 100% uh, deniability. <laughs> Thursday. Uh, thank you very much there, Crispy Chris. Appreciate the love there, buddy. Thank you for the supers, my friend. You are awesome, man. Um, Breaking Bad RV. It might be. We'll have to, we'll see what's in there. Um, whenever we get it, I'm definitely gonna get it, chat. Um, and the chat wants the picture. <laughs> I know they do. All right. Should I end the stream now and we continue on a part three, or do we continue the game? You guys want a long stream today? We could do a long stream today, guys. It's Thursday, uh, 9/11. Okay. Oh, really? Is it September 11th in the game? It is. You're right. That is crazy. It is, chat. Uh, but we're in the 80s right now. You gotta remember, this is before before all those events, guys. Uh, we need the pick. <laughs> continue to finish the game. All right. If I if I decide to continue, guys, then um, I'm gonna have to go take a stress pee. So we're gonna have to take a little bit of a of a little um a little break here, chat. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. Yeah. I'm gonna have to take a small diet, Doctor Peebus. So if you guys will excuse me, um, let me deliver a few more pieces of mail, though, guys. Uh, continue after go. All right. Yeah, I, I, I'm definitely uh, having to take a stress pee right now, chat. Finish it. Eight-hour stream. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> no, we're not going to do an eight-hour stream. This game's not super long. I think we're getting close to the end here. So, yeah, open the Discord, right? I'm not opening the Discord. No. <laughs> uh, chicken stream says drunk holly. Yes. Oh, yeah, the chicken takeover. Yeah. I got the chicken here, chat. Oh, dang it. I just ripped his tag off. Oh, no. Chris. The tag came off. Dave and Buster's. It says Dave and Buster's on it. Here, let me put it back on him. Oh, no. Put it back on his head, chat. Uh, 420 stream, 420 likes today. Yeah, we, we have, uh, yeah, there's only 300 likes on today's stream, chat. 300. Yeah, that's what it is. I did say if we got, was it 500 or was it 550 likes we had to get? What did I say, guys? Did I say we had to get 500? Or 550 likes. I can't remember what I said, guys. Sure lie. Sure lie. It was 500. Was it 500? You said 500 first, then 550. Oh. So it is 550. You said 600 likes. Oh, is it 600, Dakota? Okay. How are we getting 500 likes? You guys never liked the stream this much. It's not fair. It's not fair. Uh, remember Ryan, I still have 300 points. That's cool, Crispy. 500 likes. All right, 500 likes, chat. 500 likes, and I'll show the picture. Oh, my goodness. We're like three away. We're like three away. Oh, I'm so frightened. I'm so frightened right now. This picture was never supposed to get out. It was never supposed to get out, chat. I'll call up my friends to like it. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the Discord. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right. Oh, no. <laughs> Good job, chat. All right. Give yourselves a round of a hand. Give yourselves a round of a hand. But I have to admit something. There, there is no picture. There never was. Yes, that'll stick. Yeah, there was never a picture. It was just a joke. It was just a joke. 
You liar. You liar. It was a joke. All right. I'm opening up the Discord. Whoever has the picture, you can show the picture. I'm not showing it. I know Ham Handling has it. Uh, nice try. There's only like three people that have this picture. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. I will show it on stream. I'm going to show it on stream. You don't have to leave the stream. You don't have to leave the stream and go to Discord. I will show it on stream. All right. <laughs> Whoever has it, you can show it. Uh, liar, liar, pants on fire. Freedom. <laughs> oh, man. This one is so bad, though. It's so rough, chat. I'm telling you. This is the worst picture that ever existed to me. It was a picture after a show. I have it now. <laughs> it was a picture that was after a show. Eddie Lund just dropped the picture of him. Uh, leave it up after for the stress beat. I will. I will. I'll leave it up. It was after a show I played when I was like 19 years old, okay? And I had hair back then. I had hair back then, chat. <laughs> oh my. Nobody's dropped it yet. Nobody's dropped it yet. I know only like three people have it, guys. Nobody's dropped it yet, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely gonna dislike this dream. And Terry, don't you dare. Don't you dare. All right, let me deliver this package. We gotta deliver these packages, guys. Nobody's dropped, them, dropped it yet. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the 500 likes on the stream chat. I appreciate it, guys. 510 <laughs> likes on the stream. It's a wig. All right, I'll, I'll just show it. If nobody's dropping it, I'll just show it. All right, where are we? 200 Jackson Street. We're going to deliver this package. <laughs> it wasn't a wig. Oh, my goodness. That is not the picture, Chris. Who has the picture? You guys all threatened that you had the picture, and now nobody's, nobody's posting it. I think they're scared, guys. He's got the picture. That's I think he has than it. I thought. It hasn't showed up yet. It has not showed up yet, guys. I never laughed this much since Eddie London. Oh, my God. Dusty Old Crow, thank you for the $2 Canadian Super Chat. Says this just turned into why? Nope. Uh, no, I don't know fine. what that means, Dusty Old Crow, but I'm definitely not going to read it there, buddy. Thank you for the $2 Canadian uh, Super Chat there, sir. My goodness. <laughs> my goodness. Uh, how do you not have the picture? Uh, ham. Bunch of liars. Oh, did they lie about the picture? That's not it, Dan. That's not it, buddy. That's not the picture there, Dan. It's not public, Dan. It's private. Uh, the chicken. Oh, the chicken. Oh, I'm sorry, Dusty. I didn't know what you were talking about. <laughs> My bad, Dusty. Now I know what you're talking about. All right, these are all not the pictures. Nobody even has it. They want five million to show it. <laughs> uh... I think they were fooling you. No, 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 no. It exists. I know people have it. That is not the picture. I will let you know when it's when it's up. Oh, no. It's Granny. Granny. Thank you, Dusty Old Crow. Now I understand your comment, buddy. Oh, no. Granny's going to oh, talk Jesus. to us, chat. You're a sight for sore eyes. Oh, hi, Miss J... Show the picture, Mildred? right? How so? All right. Ham has a screenshot of it. Hannah Ann doesn't have the original picture. He has a screenshot of it, which is not the original picture. But I will, I will copy it, and I will show it to you guys here. So this is me after a show. The worst picture that was ever taken to me in the history of man. It is horrendous. Why is this not centered? There you go. Ugh. I think we broke the chat. I think you guys broke the chat again. Definitely broke the chat. Chat is broken. <laughs> chat is broken again. You guys froze the chat again. How did that happen? Oh, it's in there now. It's in there now. Oh, God. This is so weird, too, because the YouTube chat broke. Hopefully, it fixes itself in a minute. There it goes. There it goes. 
Yeah, I was like 19 years old. I was 19 years old. That's my actual hair. It was like, it was like slicked back a little bit and like, like a palm tree, sort of. Oh my God. Everybody save the picture. Oh, that is, I can't believe that got out. I've been hiding that for four years. Four years. Screenshot. Four years. Four years. That's fake hair. I was 19 years old. That was my real hair. Well, what happened to your hair? <laughs> Bro, my hair was like slicked back there, buddy. And it just so happened that the, that the picture was cut off at the top. So it just so happened that the picture was cut off right where my hairline was. So that's why it looks like I have like no hair on the top. But there was hair on the top, guys. Oh, was that like the 80s? I don't know when that, that was like two, that was like, um, that had to be like 2000. That was probably like 2000, 2001 maybe? Uh, maybe 2002? Yeah, that was a long time ago, guys. That'll haunt you for the rest of your career. It will, yeah. That is the worst picture. Uh, right, says Gaming Dior. Yes, a receding hairline at 19. No, 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 no. I was probably like 21, 22 at that point. A scarlet would be cool, bro. I don't know when that was exactly. I, I don't remember. Maybe it was like 23 or something. He had a five finger forehead. Maybe it was like 24. I don't remember exactly when that was. It was before I cut my hair. So it had to be, it had to be uh, at least 23, 23 years old. Something like that, guys. Uh, it was about 50 years ago. Yeah, it was a long time ago. All right, let's get back to the game, guys. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna recover from that photo, but now we have to go, now we have to uh, now we have to play this game. <laughs> let's say 20 years ago. Yeah, it was a long time ago, chat. That's a lot of forehead. It was. Oh, that's a rough picture, isn't it? All right. So now that that's out there, chat. I hope you're all happy. That is now out there for all to see. <sighs> Why does it sound like a baby crying? I know. Oh, I know. Yeah, what? Oh, that's the cats. That's the cats, guys. You're never going to live that down. No. That's going to be out there forever. I can't believe that one's out there now. Very happy, says Logan. Oh, I bet you are, buddy. Logan's already coming up with the memes, chat. He's already coming up with the memes, guys. <laughs> uh, can't unsee it. No, you can't. That's going to be, that's going to haunt your uh, nightmares, chat. <laughs> Thank you. For 500 likes, man, what a, what a weak person I am. I showed that picture for 500 likes on one stream. What a sad little streamer I've become. All right. Are you expecting uh, more mail from your son? Is something wrong with the cat skin? Are you really that happy to see me? Are you really that three. happy to see me? It's just this week. It's <laughs> all a bit much for me. I need to get my hair done for Sunday's special evening. But I can't leave my She's going to be at the alone. party. And then all of a sudden, Frank has gone missing. He still needs to bring me an envelope. Please tell me that you have it with you. I'm afraid this is just a postcard. Chance, oh my god. Oh, it's already starting. Oh my god. That's too small, dusty old crow. I can't show it, buddy. I can't show it. Oh, oh dear. Oh. Oh, it's already starting. The low effort memes are coming out. <laughs> two. All right, let's go with number two. Mildred, you gambling? Mildred, are you gambling? Oh, don't be a nosy posy, Meredith. Oh, dear, oh, dear. He can't just have vanished into thin air, can he? Uh, I wish I could tell you where he is. Don't worry. I'm sure Frank will show up again. Okay. I wish I could tell you where he is. Don't worry. I'm sure Frank will show up again. Yeah. Don't worry. We'll I'm her. sure Frank will show up again. <laughs> Thanks, Jimmy. <laughs> oh, Frankie boy. Always making me worry too much. And I need to cancel the hairdresser's appointment. But what if I can't reschedule? Oh, don't worry about it. Your hair looks just fine. Um... Or, wait, should we actually, should we, like, volunteer to look after her cats, guys? I feel like we should. Gambling ring in the RV. Oh, yeah. Maybe we should offer to look after the cats. Or should we say number two? I don't really want to look after the cats, guys. But, you know, maybe, maybe we should, guys. Maybe we should. One, all right, you guys are saying one. No Perhaps cat duty? Perhaps I should look late. after your cats. <laughs> would you, my dear? It's tomorrow evening. That would be such a relief for me. 
And the cats. Aww. Tomorrow night? Friday night. Do we have any plans for Friday night chat or am I a loser, guys? What, what, what do we have here? One is fine. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's look after the cats. We'll look after the cats. Sure. No trouble at all. <laughs> I don't think I have any plans oh, in the game. Thank you so much, dear. Just show up at seven and eat as many cookies as you like. Oh, free cookies. Nice. Hey, we get free cookies, chat. All right. We got a date with Granny's cats in the evening. <laughs> nope, loser. I'm a loser. Yeah, I, I don't remember the last time I had plans on Friday night either, chat. So, yeah. There we go. No plans on Friday night. Uh, on a Friday night, he'll do. Yes. All right. There we go, chat. There we go, guys. All right. Now we got a package for the for the uh, mechanic as well. Oh, there's the RV. There's the RV. Uh, no, that's M's drinking night. All right, there's the RV, chat. Here, let's go grab the package for the RV lady and, or the mechanic, and let's pick up our RV, guys. Oh, I'm excited now. Take a picture, right? All right, ham handling. Yeah, I don't see anything in the Discord from you there, Mr. Ham. There was only one. Ham handling? You didn't even drop it. Oh, should you? No. <laughs> no, definitely not. Don't drop any more photos. Oh my goodness, no. That was more than enough. Absolutely not. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Ham. Jeez, oh, man. All right. 300 Lake Road. Just saw the picture of Riot with hair when Riot was lead singer of Shinedown. <laughs> That's the one. Lead singer of Shinedown. Uh, yes, do it, Ham. Don't do it, Ham. Don't, don't succumb to the Murder. peer pressure. <laughs> Look at this house on wheels. I didn't I even no know there was a second picture. From, but it's absolutely rad. It's oh, mine, I know actually. what the second picture Mickey is. I know what it me. is. Yeah. You know, that young the second one, the, the the second one's not as bad. It's still rough, Whoa, but it's really? not as bad. That's I know so which tight. one you're talking about, Here, Ham. They left this note on the driver's seat. 600 likes next stream. Oh, yeah, let me read 600 it. likes next stream, Ham. Life's Help me out, buddy. And not yeah. a destination. We get 600 Just likes tomorrow. Just grab the wheel and enjoy the ride. Love, M and J. It's not even that bad, though. So, what are you going to do with it? You have to hit the road. I don't know. Could it stay for a while? You can have it if you want. Um, I like how we, we've completely checked out of this game, haven't we, guys? Have we checked out of this game? Do we even need to finish it? Or should we just wait for people to post photos of me? 600 on this stream? We're not going to get 600 on this stream. No. Uh, two. Finish it. Okay. I don't know. Could you stay here for a while? You can have it if you want. Okay. Um... Actually, let's, oh yeah, we're at, she's asking about the RV. This is important. This is important, guys. Yeah, let's, let's focus on the game from now on, guys. I'm sorry, but we're not, yeah, Ham, hey, just put that aside, buddy. Um, everyone in Discord, you know, shut up. <laughs> and we're going to focus on the game, guys. Let's focus on the game. Let's do that, chat, because I do want to finish this game. If we, if we continue to just worry about photos of Raya, we'll never finish this game, guys. So let's worry. About, let's focus on the game. We're going to focus from now on, chat. All right. I don't know. Um, could we stay here for a while? You can have it if you want. Okay. I don't know. Could it stay here for a while? Let's do number one. I don't know what I want yet. I was hoping it could stay here for a while. Team game. Yeah. I'm you team can game right now. You tinker on it, too. We put a lot you of hours into this. You know I love tinkering, <laughs> but it's going to need a lot of work. It can stay here for as long as you need. Good oh, to well, hear, thank Lori. you. I can already hear the cogs in your head spinning at top speed. What are your plans? Well, if it's going to be here a while, I should give it a name first. Can't have such a beautiful vehicle and not give it a name. How about the Sea Turtle? Big, slow, washed up. I know, Bob. Yeah, focusing like me in the same sentence is a very bad combination. The raccoon. <laughs> because it's got brown spots and is full of trash. Oh my God. Or. The Hermit Shell. It had many owners over the years, just like the shell of a hermit crab. She is crapping all over my van. Well, all right, what do we name it? The Sea Turtle, the Raccoon, or the Hermit Shell? <laughs> I, I don't know. Um, the Methmobile. I, I would say that's more appropriate, Denver, yes. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, number three, maybe the Hermit Shell, guys. I would say the Hermit Shell chat. Yeah, let's do that, guys. Hermit Crabs, yeah. Sea Turtle? All right, let's do that, guys. Hermit Shell. A lot of you guys, I see a lot of threes. Yeah, I would say three is the best name, too. I the agree hermit with you, Hermit Shell. <laughs> Good choice. I'll get working on it right away. Had a lot of See owners. you later. Bye. All right, there we go, chat. 
Oh, I don't even want to know what that's full of. Okay, so we delivered the package. We got one more package to deliver on our Thursday. And I don't think we have any Thursday plans either. How did I get so lonely? We went, we went from having dates with people to the girl I was in love with left town apparently. And Robert doesn't talk to me anymore. anymore. Dave with the cat. We got Dave with the cat. Now, now, yeah, the flick chick left. Now, all we have is Granny's cats. How did this happen? You got rejected over and over. I did, Faramara. I got rejected over and over again, guys. Over and over again. Oh my goodness. Should have named it the bad cave. We should have. You're being repulsed. We are. Oh, oh my god. Alright, I know we're moving on, but this is this is just too good. The truth is out there. Oh! That's too good. Went from being the town something to being a cat sitter. It is what it is, chat. Uh, yeah, exactly. That's a tongue twister there, gaming with your. You ain't kidding. More ways than one. <laughs> All right, let's go deliver this package to the woods. We got another package in the woods here, guys. Uh oh. Oh, this is the same. Uh oh. This is the same area. Chat. This is the same area as the chainsaw house. We got another delivery to the chainsaw house area. Oh my god, that's great. <laughs> that one is brutal, chat. Oh, absolutely brutal, guys. All right, let's go this way, guys. Go talk to Robert, see if he wants to visit the RV with you. That's that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking, chat. Oh, this is a different house. I'm sorry, different house, guys. So this is a this is like a nice house here. Nice house, guys. Ah, uh, no, that's Rise real original Rise Sean costume. <laughs> I didn't wear a costume for that. Dang it, I keep hitting stuff. What a mistake. Uh, you had a life, and now you have Granny's Kitty. That's true. We did live a life. All this in two weeks, guys. Can you believe it? All right, we're at Raven Way. Raven Way. There we go. Uh, Chainsaw Shack is Mr. Morgan. Oh, really? Is it? Is this more Mr. Morgan's place? <laughs> it might be. He is the son of a steak. This, th this doesn't look very well kept either, though. But it looks a little bit better than the last place, though, guys. Knock on the door. I hear something going on. Ah, yes, yes, the future. yes. He could only look on in sheer terror as Madeline threw the key straight into the lake. What is happening oh, here? Yes. <laughs> this is good stuff. Um, it's a writer. It is a writer, Patrick. That's the writer of the books, I think. Axe murderer for sure, definitely. Uh, a writer. How interesting. Ah, a writer. How interesting. Oh, for Christ's sakes, go away. If I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times. You haven't told me anything. I'm, I'm new here. Who is this oh, weirdo? Heck, do I sound like I care? You lot are all the same to me. Just go away. How many yokels are there in this backwater town? Oh my god. I didn't realize people come out to these kinds of places because they're supposed to be remote and quiet. Uh... Maybe you shouldn't mail order things then? <laughs> How rude. I know. Uh, not everyone wants packages left at their doorsteps. I guess we'll be nice to him, chat. Let's be nice to him, guys. It's not that. It's just that not everyone up here in these parts feels comfortable with us leaving packages on their doorsteps. Oh, you said two. I should have done two. You're right. I should have done two. David <sighs> Hayes, thank you for the nine months there, I buddy. I do beg your pardon. I, yes, I am expecting a package. I didn't know you were from the Postal Service, ma'am. Oh, see, that set him straight. David, thank you for the nine months of support, buddy. Appreciate the generous nine months, man. Says if the RVs are rocking, don't come a knocking. Thank you there, David Hayes. Appreciate you, my friend. Number two. All right, what do we say to him? And yet you started shouting. So we, should we be? Should we do the typical thing where anytime someone gets mad about something, all the other person does it says, "Well, you did this and you do that." Da, 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 da. Nobody knows how to settle an argument these days. They just said, "You did this and you did that," or should we continue the conversation? Number three. I'm thinking number three, chat. Oh, so now I have something you need, 
And you quite miraculously are capable of common courtesy. All right, all I'm right, I'm sorry. It's just... They are all snippy, Robert. I've been under a lot of pressure lately from my publisher, as well as my wife. I do appreciate your driving all the way up here. And Lord knows I'll be needing those ribbons. Just please leave them on the porch and thank you. You're welcome, sir. Yeah, You're that welcome. was the most snippy one. It was, yeah. <laughs> it was. I think I did pick the mm. most snippy one. Mm. All mm. right. Now, where was I? She threw the key in the lake. Then what happens? Oh, Christ's sake, she made me lose my bloody train of thought. He's talking no, smack wait, in there. I got it. And then he says... He was talking smack on me in there. All right, at least we avoided a conversation with him. Uh, wife problems, that explains it, says, uh, Jason, what are you talking about there, buddy? <laughs> oh, he has wife problems. Maybe, maybe he does. He might. That's okay. He's out in the cabin in the woods. He's doing some writing, guys. He's just trying to clear his mind. Hope you get paid by the hour. I do, Ringo. Yes, we do, buddy. All right, let's return to the post office, guys. Um, why is my beard so itchy today? I've been getting eaten alive by mosquitoes. I recently bought, like, a patio set chat, and I've been sitting outside. Um, he's, uh, he said the key is in the lake. Oh, the key is in the lake? Faramero, is there a key in the lake? The guy for a beginning. The guy's begging for a pile of poop on his doorstep. Ew. <laughs> like in a little brown bag. Maybe we should light a bag of poop on his doorstep. I think we should, guys. I think we should. All right, here's what I'm going to do, chat. After we finish this day, I am going to... Let me see where we're at. Um, okay. Way to go back to the uh, to the post office. I'm going to take a stress pee. We're going to come back, and we're going to finish this game. Do we see it through to the end, or do we quit now and save it for another time, guys? I think we should see it through to the end. Key is cabin. <laughs> Key is cabin, Faramiro. Uh, 80 more likes, still the second photo. No, 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 Power Mad. We're not doing a second photo today, buddy. We never said that. GG rises, <laughs> says DJ. Thank you, DJ. How much is left? I don't know, Ringo. That's a good question, buddy. I think we're close to the end. We got to be close to the end, right? I think the party's the end, right? You can't quit now. Oh, yeah, I don't think we can. I didn't realize it was going to go on this long. You're the boss, says Justin. I am very much not the boss. Uh, finish it, man. All right, let's finish it. We'll finish it today, guys. See you through. Okay, Tobias. Let's do it, buddy. Let's do it. Long stream Monday. Long stream Monday. That's okay, because tomorrow we're going to play D-Rail Valley. Oh, crap. I forgot about tomorrow. I forgot about tomorrow. So tomorrow... Is Frank okay? Yeah, we need to know what happened to Frank. That's what we need to know, guys. So tomorrow, I told you guys I was going to do a train... A methane train. We're gonna hold nothing but methane because apparently somebody in the chat told me that the most explosive thing is methane, and I was like, it would be a good idea to do nothing but methane. So I'm running a methane train tomorrow, guys. I forgot about that. So, so tomorrow could be very explosive. It could be a very explosive day, guys. <laughs> Proctologist appointment. No, no, no. Good it just could be a rough wife. day on Mariah's stream. Two long streams make up for no stream Friday. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. We're not going to do two long streams in a row. Good afternoon, Mr. Morgan. Yikes, you creep. <laughs> I think we got to say yikes, you creep, right? Like we got it, right? <laughs> yeah, drug test time. Number two. <laughs> Number two. Creep? Uh, you keep giving me jump scares. What? <laughs> so to say what back? What? Don't try to be a wise guy. Or a wise gal, Miss Weiss. <laughs> uh, I can't help being a wise gal. I can't help being a wise gal. Oh, that's Very good. funny. That's also what your dad used to say. I'll continue. I wanted to let you know that today was my last day here. Yes! Oh, really? Will Frank be coming back then? Oh, really? Will Frank be coming back then? That's all I have to say. Good luck. Uh-oh. I think Frank's dead in the chainsaw house. What do you think, guys? You think Frank's dead in the chainsaw house? I think he is. <laughs> this is going to go very, very badly. All right, we're here at Thursday afternoon, a lonely night. A lonely, lonely night. Because we don't have any dates, chat. No Roberts. No Hello? whatever that Hi, other girl's name was. Okay. Oh, hi, Kay. Good, you're home. Listen, I don't 
don't know if you're busy tonight, and I wouldn't normally bother you like this, but I'm kind he of did. in a huge pickle at the moment, and now I'm imagining huge pickle. inside of a huge pickle. Thanks, brain. She said something about a huge pickle. <laughs> sure, what's up? Okay, so this is going to sound like I'm 16, but I have these tickets to a really big concert tonight for Barry and me, and it seems the babysitter has just bailed on me. All right, so maybe the babysitter part doesn't sound like I'm 16, I hope. <laughs> Chad, I think we have anyway, plans now. Anyway, journey, so I'm like, I need to go tonight, and I got these tickets ages ago, and it's a long drive to Portland, so we'll probably be out all night, and I promise you I've called everyone and their brother besides. They're really good kids to watch tonight. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I thought we were gonna have a. Sh I thought we were gonna get the tickets. Oh man, babysitting. I thought we were gonna get the tickets to the concert. You're not the baby. We did babysitting yesterday, Ham. This does sound like a pickle. All right, can I get a shortcut to the question? Can I get a shortcut to the Dang question? It. Yeah, sorry. You're totally right. I'm blabbering on R and I. Okay, don't freak out. You got this. All right, recap. Journey tonight in Portland. Got tickets. Sitter bailed. So I guess you figured out by now that I'm awkwardly trying to ask if maybe you could do me a huge favor and watch Grace and Max tonight. Oh, watch your kids? Am I your only option? Hey, I'll do it. Oh God. Oh. All right. You guys fight amongst yourselves about what we're supposed to do here, and I am going to take a stress pee. I will be right back. So tell, tell the chicken what you want to see. Should we babysit or should we not babysit, guys? What do we do, chat? What do we do? All right, I'll be right back. I got a stress pee. Okay, we are back. What a clucker. <laughs> Sorry. All right, we are back, chat. Oh my God, you guys, I was gone so long that you guys started sending super chats. Holy cow. <laughs> Holy cow. Um, have the cat. Okay, so you guys are saying, let me let me go up and um, let me go up and uh, just try to figure this out, guys. Uh, let's see here. That is the real Amber. Yes, the real Amber is back in the chat. No, not the impersonator. The impersonator got banned, chat. <laughs> okay. Thank you very, very much, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, the chicken is hilarious. The chicken is is, is pretty cool. I'd, I'd say, wait, who's cooler, me or the chickens? You didn't wash your hands. I washed my hands. All right, let's see what the chat said. First of all, we have a massive, massive super chat. Oh, my God. From Mr. Dennis Gersh. Thank you for the $50 super chat. It says, for the chicken. Oh, it's not for me. It's not for me. The chicken's cooler. The chicken's definitely cooler. Thank you very much, Dennis. I will see that the chicken gets it. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. I gotta get 50. Chat, do I li do I have to strap a $50 bill to the chicken now? And the $50 bill has to be on the chicken. Dennis Gersh gave that to the chicken. <laughs> Should I have to strap a 50 to the chicken? <laughs> oh my god. The chicken's rich. He's rich. He can buy more chickens with that. Thank you very much there, Dennis Gersh. I appreciate it, buddy. Thank you for the $50 chicken fund. I appreciate it. Yep, strap it to the chicken. All right, when that comes through, I'll, I'll strap it to the chicken, guys. I will. Chicken cam. <laughs> thank you so much, Dennis. And thank you, Frank Mason, for the $5 super chat. Says, throw the kids in the lake. Gaming chair for the win. All right, have we decided? Are we babysitting or not? Are we babysitting or not, guys? What do we do? I feel bad not doing this, so I think we should, baby. Uh, maybe we should babysit the kids. But I really don't want to at all. <laughs> so there's that, too. Um, thank you so much, Dennis Gersh, and thank you, Frank Mason, for the $5 super chat. To throw the kids in the lake, 
Gaming Chair for the win. Thank you, Frank. Appreciate the love there, buddy. That's a good idea. We got Mr. Jason Olet as well with the $2. Let's bring back the chicken for the chicken. Thank you. Now that's $52 for the chicken. Sit on babies. All right, let's sit on the babies. All right, let's do it, chat. All right, let's do it. Hey, it's fine. Don't worry. Oh, I can't believe we're doing tonight. it. Oh, my God. You serious? That would help me out in such a big way. And I would owe you big time. Huge. All right, no problem. So when do you need me? Uh, you would, wouldn't you? Interesting. <laughs> no problem. So what time do you need me? I know, Deb is very favor. upset. As soon as you can make it. You don't have to bring anything. <laughs> There's food, videos, even a cardboard replica of Apollo 11 with a set of matching helmets. You're covered. See you in a bit. All right. See ya. All right, so guess we're babysitting tonight. No wonder we didn't have any plans for Thursday. IOUs are got. Okay, thank you, Dennis Gers, is strapping All on right. the chicken. Thank you, buddy. Who wants s'mores? Oh, we got a babysit chat. Oh, they skipped it. Hey, hey, hey. guess who's back? Frank? Hey, Frank's back. Frank is back. They skipped the babysitting scene, and this game's awesome. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Skip the babysitting. And Frank's back, baby. What's up, Frank? You gambling illegal son of a <laughs> Thank you, Dad. Oh, I hope that beat. I hope that beat. I didn't say stink there. Thank you very much there, Jason Olette, for the $2 super chat. I appreciate it. Uh, we got Dennis Gersh as well coming in with the $2. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. I will strap it to the chicken. And Christian Julio said chicken was another trip to DNB. For a good cause. I agree. I agree, Chris. I agree, buddy. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Uh, Frank, I'll put 50 on the cat. <laughs> oh, you guys are hilarious. Okay, let's talk to Frank chat. Let's talk to Frank, guys. We gotta talk to him. Thank you guys for all the super chats. I will see. The chicken made more money than me today. Hey. Hey. <laughs> the chicken's doing better than your old pal, Ryan. Nine out of ten, they skipped the tea party. Oh, I bet. I bet they did. Oh, I bet they did, Ryan. Okay, I'm so glad to see you again. I didn't expect you here. All right, let's say we're so happy to see him, Chad. I'm so glad to see you again. I'm so happy to be here again. I guess Morgan didn't stick around to welcome me back. Morgan doesn't like him, does he? Good riddance. Good riddance. Hell yeah, that clueless piece of work. I'm glad he said piece of work there. Now you got more gifteds. Oh, yeah, we did get gifteds. I'm sorry, we, we got gifteds. I did see the gift. Yes, we have 67 gifteds. Never mind. I made more than a chicken today. Uh, tell me more. How do you get rid of them? What happened in the last few days? Okay, tell me more. Tell me more. How'd you get rid of them? Well, what can I say? Don't mess with the big boys. I guess they didn't understand that some of my customers do a little more than talking about their cats. Ooh, Tracy, don't say that, buddy. Oh, this sounds very useful. So they were ratting them out. The town was ratting... Oh, dang it. I was in dead serious cam the whole time. Oh, God. <laughs> Sorry. I was in dead serious. Oh, you had to look at my face? Oh, that is terrifying. Oh, I am so sorry, chat. Oh, man, that is embarrassing. Amber dropping the 149. Peach super sticker. Thank you for the peach. Appreciate it. Big noggin. <laughs> Big noggin. Oh, I'm so sorry. That was up for so long. I hate when streamers do that. Oh, man. I don't hate it, but, like, it's, it's always, like, weirdly uncomfortable. <laughs> Thank you, Amber, for the 149 super sticker. Appreciate you. All right, very juicy, guys. Ooh, you can still hear it, though, right? Frank Coleman's no stranger to the high-stakes game. I've got lawyers in my inner circle. All it took were a couple of lawsuit threats. Oh. Sweet. Uh, that should keep them off our backs for a while. Um, or should I, use, should I have a conscience and say, but Frank, isn't this all just really wrong? Should I be that guy? Harry B, thank you for the 14 Swedish Kroner mustache super sticker, buddy. Appreciate you, sir. Thank you. God, look at this picture. Do not put my haired picture on Pee Wee Herman, please. Chat. Okay. Uh, doesn't that guy? Yeah, yeah, we're going to go with the first answer. That should keep him off our backs for a while. <laughs> yes, but that buffoon will be back. You can bet on it. Um, what odds can you give me? Oh, that's a good one. Uh, let's dial down the betting for a while, Frank. No, no, no. We ain't dialing down nothing. What odds can you give me? <laughs> <laughs> Meredith, <laughs> I better get back to work. 
Oh, this chat's out of control. Uh, thank you so much, Jared, for the $10 super chat. It says, gotta get the chicken's numbers up. Thank you. Is that for the chicken, Jared? Oh, is that for the chicken, buddy? So now the chicken has $62. The chicken made $62 today. I wonder what it'll thank you, be Jared. today. Actually, My goodness. no. <laughs> Nancy, the floor is yours. Yeah, Jack, I've got a pet peeve. Why do people start fake coughing when I'm smoking in my store? If you don't like it, just leave. Thank you much, Nancy. Karen, and, Nancy's well, a Karen. If you're asking, it's not like people have other places to go besides the smokehouse that you call a general store. On to the weather forecast. Oh my God. Sunny in the first half of the day and some clouds in the second. Back to the playlist. People don't like Nancy smoking in her store chat. And she got yelled at, guys. Uh, did you see the uh, pic Jonesy posted? I did not. I did not. But I will I will look at it, guys. Just give me a minute, all right? <laughs> all right, we're here on Main Street. Oh, wait. I don't think we have a parcel here. This is a letter, guys. Uh, he told her. He did. Yeah, he did, guys. The smokehouse, he called it. Oh, did I grab a package? I didn't mean to grab a package. Son of a stink. People want that chicken riot? Not right. That's true. That's exactly right. <laughs> That's exactly right. Thank you very much there, Jared Cope. I appreciate you, buddy. Should I just put the chicken in the red box and I have to stream from, like, the floor or something, guys? Here's your mail. I'll do it. I'll do it, Chad. I'll do it. I think this is the last day of the week. Chad, do you guys remember? Do we deliver mail on... Oh, look at this photograph. I did see that, Chris Myers. I did see that one, buddy. Yeah, that was a good one. I did see that one. Yeah, I did see uh, I did see that picture. <laughs> uh, yes, <laughs> put the chicken in the red box and I'll stream from the floor. That's a good idea. I like it. I do have a wireless keyboard, Chad. I could do that. I could actually do that. I'll take my keyboard and my mouse, thank you. No backseat streamer. Much better. <laughs> Much better. Still can't hear it. <laughs> Still can't hear the chicken. I ain't no backseat streamer, guys. Am I a backseat streamer? My goodness, chat. Free the chicken. That's why, but that, that must have been why I uh, I secretly, oh, wait, where are we at? We're at Pine Street here, chat. Down on Pine Street. Uh, you guys go to the same barber. Oh, that's good. That's good, buddy. That's good, buddy. Uh, bummer, he's back. Yeah, I'm back, chat. You got to deal with me now. <laughs> Sorry. Tracy says, yes. Thank you again, Jared. I appreciate it. Thank you, uh, Amber and Harry, for the love, guys. I appreciate all the support. Um, thank you, Joe Wolf says, for the chicken. That is $64 for the chicken. The chicken has made $64 today. I got to strap $64 to the chicken. Thank you, Joe Wolf. <laughs> thank you, buddy. My goodness. A few more for the chicken. Yeah. Somebody's singing, Hello? chat. Friday delivery day. Friday delivery day. Well, just call me Friday delivery K. Okay. No, that <laughs> sounded better in my head. Someone's in a good mood today. Yes. That was a knee slapper. Thanks for looking after Max and Gracie last night. You were a real trooper for stepping in last minute. No problem. They were great. It was an interesting evening. Um, are they okay? Did they mention anything? Uh-oh. What, what did I do? Are they okay? Did they... Mention oh, anything? yeah, we gotta babysit Max the cats, did Ringo. say right. I owe him pancake breakfast for the rest of the week, and Grace said she will never sleep again, but yeah, pretty much. What movie did you watch with them anyway? <laughs> so... 
<laughs> so we're, what movie did I watch with them? Um, let's ask her how the concert was. How was the concert? <laughs> oh, yeah. Man, Journey is so good. Those songs have been stuck in my head all day. Um, that sounds great. <laughs> that sounds great. <laughs> I know, right? There's just so much cool stuff being created right now, you know? I mean, Journey was cool. I got to know them through Barry at first, but I tell you, if Prince or New Order ever came to Portland, I would sell my spleen for tickets. Sell your spleen. Got it, lady. Uh, spleen, two bands, quite the dilemma. One spleen, two bands. Journey. That's quite What's the potential dilemma. Oh, Don't stop. And I haven't even mentioned Cyndi Lauper or Run DMC. Or Stevie Wonder. Run and before DMC. you go there, I know you're I probably so setting too, up a joke about yeah. spleens and ham and organs Definitely. right now. <laughs> Don't stop. Hold on. Don't stop. Believe it. It's all too good and good and good. Was that good, chat? That was good, right? They watched Rye Stream playing Babysitter yesterday. They sure did. Joke's on you because I don't even know what that means. Joke's on you because I don't even know what that means. You know, music organ, body organ. Never mind. Wait, body I'll organ? Aside, though, I spent half the concert thinking about how I haven't really focused on my own music for a while now. Kids, work, all that stuff. Dance. So much going on. Believe and I mean, I love tinkering, but right now, I'm I not sure I'm even too. creating anything cool or just... You know, not even Barry is allowed to listen to my songs at this stage, to be honest. There you go, says Robert. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Something about his, her music. I'd love to hear your music sometime. I'm sure it's great. I'm sure you'll never know until you put yourself out there. Yeah, yeah, let's listen I'd to I'd love music. to hear your music sometime. I'm sure it's great. Thanks for the vote of confidence. <laughs> Maybe I'll hold you to that. I was thinking, I have a mixtape with some of my stuff, you know? Just something I've been trying out with my she new synthesizer. She's trying to she's trying to pedal her mixtape mixtape on me uh, at the mall, guys. That used to happen at the mall all the time. Remember malls? Terry, thank you for the two dollars super chats. Is for the chicken, guys. Stop giving the chicken money. That's literally sixty six dollars. I have to tape to a chicken. I have to tape sixty six dollars to a chicken. Stop giving the chicken money. Thank you, Terry, for the two dollar chicken. I appreciate it, buddy. <laughs> The whole town and the little old lady seems very suspicious. I, I agree. I agree. I'd be honored. I'd, I'd be, be honored. honored. That's great. Mall it's just something yet. I've been playing around with. Don't internet. expect any fireworks. And hey, don't tell me what you think yet. Yeah? You'll be my secret special audience of one. So I can get used to the idea. What did Doug Meyer say? You'd rather have a rose on your piano or tulips on your organ? Tulips? I would say a rose, Doug. I would say a rose. Roses are nice, nicer than... Doug's saying that, so I know it's bad. Uh, Mike Amaki says, for the chicken with a $2 super chat and $20 super chat for the chicken. Terry, thank you for the $20 super chat. I appreciate it. Thank you very, very much, Zach. Let's get some Zachs in the chat. He's giving it to the chicken. Now yeah. Chat, you're gonna make me you're gonna make me take like a hundred dollars in the chicken. Oh my god. Now the chicken's made way more money than me today. Zach Jock, save the $20 super chat for the chicken. Michael Monkey with a $2 for the chicken. Robert Colvin, thank you for the $5 super chat for the chicken. Ringo Garbanzo, thank you for the $10 super chat for the chicken. And Michael Monkey with the additional chicken. Says for the chicken again. Thank you guys. Thank you. Chicken's gonna go get some bling. You're gonna see the chicken next time with this like gold chain on, Chad. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. Any special reason? Any special reason? Give a fake okay. hundred dollars. Don't tell anyone. But my god, it's like a hundred dollars for the chicken. My new this Sunday. <laughs> Thank you, Chad. Holy crap! I just said that out loud, <laughs> dude. You are coming to the open mic, right? Of course. Of course. That's great. Wild horses couldn't drag me away. But act cool, yeah? No one else knows yet. See you there. Sure thing. Chat, should I order some tra Taco Bell for the chicken? Maybe I should order some KFC for the chicken. <laughs> oh my God. Chris Myers with a $20 super chat says for the tulips. Oh dear God. Thank you for that, Chris Myers. I don't know how to transfer that. <laughs> but thank you for the massive super chat, Mr. Chris Myers. We got Justin Vanderford says for the chicken with a $10 super chat. 
Thank you Have so much. Have a great much. day. Thanks. Appreciate you it. too. And Harry V coming in with a 20 Swedish kroner to two dollar reduce for the chicken. Thank you, buddy. I lost count. How much are we up to for the chicken right now? <laughs> Thank you so much, chat. I appreciate it. Thank you, Justin, Chris Myers, Harry Vanola, and Mike Hamaki. Thank you, guys. Seriously. Too much, guys. Too much. This reminds me of Coop Stream. We're Deadpool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Coop's, Coop Stream. Um, I think the chair and Luna made more than him as well. <laughs> yeah. The chat likes the, the inanimate objects. Well, I guess the Luna wasn't inanimate, but the other ones were. Uh, over $100 for the chicken. We're over $100 for the chicken today, chat. That is insanity. <laughs> that is insanity. Thank you so much, guys. Appreciate it. I'll make sure the chicken gets it. The chicken will have $100 strapped to its face on the next stream chat, all right? Hold me to it. Hold me. Don't, don't, don't let me take that money. Seriously. That's going to the chicken. Make sure it's in singles. I'm not going to... What? No. I'm not going to the bank. I'm not making two trips, guys. <laughs> Good job, chicken. The chicken did a better job of streaming than me today. Chat, rate, rate. Oh, okay. Who did a better job streaming today? Me or the chicken, guys? Me or the chicken? Uh, DJ Cluck in the house. That's right there, William. That's right there, buddy. All right, let's hop on up here, guys. We got to deliver this mail. Let's deliver the rest of this mail. Dollar bills only. <laughs> what kind of traffic jam did you just create? I have no idea. If you don't park on the side of the road, yeah, it's it really messy in this game. Ah, uh, chicken for shirt. Uh, report the chicken to the IRS. <laughs> Does the chicken have to pay uh, taxes? That is a good question. I wonder if the chicken has to pay taxes, guys. That is a great question, actually. That's blatant chickentism. It is Brayden. That's what I was going to say, buddy. That is chickentism. Okay, so where are the rest of our... I got to move this mic here, Chad. It's in the way of my map. Um, okay, so the rest of ours are in the village... Um, and we got one to the cabin as well. So we got one to the cabin, two to the village, guys. We got left here. Thank you very much there, Joe Wolf, for the $2 super chats. The chicken did, and here be more for the chicken. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> I appreciate that. Another $2 for the chicken. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. My goodness, chat. Then I missed the picture, says Dan. Yes, you did. Oh, the picture. We're not talking about the picture anymore, guys. Chicken got Raya give rent. <laughs> Chicken's got to pay rent now. Should the chicken have to pay some bills? Now that the chicken is making money, should the chicken have to pay some of my bills here? Or do I have to pay the bills for the chicken? Dinner is on the chicken. Yeah, dinner is definitely on the chicken tonight. I feel like chicken tonight. Like chicken tonight. Like chicken tonight. Uh, yes, I think, the, I think the chicken should have to pay some of the rent. I agree. Thought Raya was a chicken, says Daniel. No, I'm not a chicken, guys. Guys. Yes, rent. All right, he's going to pay some rent, chat. Definitely. KFC for Raya. Should I order KFC right now? You know what, though? I don't want to order anything too greasy. Because if this game goes on to, like, 6 o'clock tonight, which it's looking like it's going to, I don't want to order something too greasy, you know? I don't want to be eating greasy food and getting it all over my keyboard, you know? Uh, thank you, Faramero, for the $5 super chat. Says, for Raya, I feel bad. Aw. Guys, let's get some awes in the chat. Faramero, I knew I liked you, buddy. Thank you for the $5 super chat. You're awesome. Look at that. I made a super chat today. I got a super chat today. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> so kind. So kind. Thank you, Faramero. Appreciate the love there, buddy. I got a little secret for you, though, chat. That chicken ain't got no soul. So he's not allowed to make money. That's the rules. I'm just kidding. Fair Mary's dropping the, uh, the little uh, the little sad faces. That's a happy cry, not a sad cry. <laughs> Your pen is still up. Oh, gee. Oh, my God. That has been up for the whole stream. Thank you. I just had Chick-fil-A. This is Ariel. Oh, really? Guys, if I leave a pin up for like three hours, remind me. Most of you guys probably closed it, though, I would imagine. <laughs> Order chicken tacos from Taco Bell. Oh, that sounds delicious, or red taco. Although, Taco Bell delivery always takes, like, way too long for me for some reason. Does it take, like, I think there's only, I think it's because there's, like, one Taco Bell near me, and everybody goes to it. And it's, like, in a very populated area. There's always, like, a line at that Taco Bell chat. We need a chicken sticker now. Well, we, yeah, we do, actually. We, I think we do. All right, let's go into the woods here, chat. Oh, Robert's getting a letter. Uh-oh. Robert's getting a letter, chat. Ooh. 
Robert's getting a letter, guys. Guys. All right, let's pull on up here, guys. Thank you there, Ro uh, We got uh, Mr. Tobias. Tobias Steen with a $10 super chat. Says for you to take the chicken for a massage. Ugh. Tobias! Tobias? First of all, where can you get a $10 massage? Second of all, that is the weirdest thing ever. But I appreciate it. Thank you, buddy. Meredith. Oh, he's wearing a blue. Look at him. He's all dressed up in his blue. That's a frosty blue flannel chat. Yeah. $10 massage. Yeah, where can I go get a $10 massage chat? Order Popeyes. <laughs> Thank you very much there, Tobias and Jonesy coming in with a $5 super chat. Thank you, Jonesy. It says, for Raya, the chicken wouldn't be where it is today without Raya. That's true. I was the one who adopted the chicken. That is true. Thank you, Jonesy. You make a good point there, buddy. I appreciate you, man. Uh, it's from his wife. Uh-oh. Hey, Robert. Hey, Robert. How are you? I was away for a few days on an urgent job out of state. Should I say, it's nice to see you again? Or, oh, okay, here's the mail. What do I say, chat? What do I say? What do I say, guys? What do I say? Cheap massages? Oh, my goodness there, William. That, that's not appropriate, William. What are you saying, buddy? Oh, that. <laughs> um, is it Robert on Mom Bazaar now? I think it is. Yeah, he might be on Mom Bazaar now, chat. Uh, one, 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 one. All right, yeah, let's be nice to him. I'm good. He's our only nice chance at love, chat. Here's the mail. He's Thanks. our only chance Likewise. at love. Hmm, priority mail from Town Hall. Uh -oh. Let's see what they have to say this time. Dear Mr. Harris, on behalf of yada, 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 concerning Environmental Management Act, one, two, one, three, yada, yada, yada. Uh, wait. What? <laughs> Listen to this. We have decided to postpone the construction of apartments for at least six months. We hope this satisfies you as well as the many residents of Providence Oaks that contacted us with their unfiltered and enthusiastic comments. It worked. The plan worked. Unfiltered comments. Nice. Yes. Wow, great. So Let's happy get some for you, Robert. In the we chat. need to celebrate this. Uh, how about tomorrow night? Steak dinner at most. Steak dinner. Oh, something else on me. Okay, he said tomorrow night. That's Saturday. That's Saturday. Yeah, I'd rather go out with Robert than do that other stupid karaoke night, right? Oh, I would love that. Do we love that, chat? We did the thing. We did. We postponed it. See, I knew, all my, I knew all my nagging him at the radio station would have paid off, chat. You guys told me not to nag him at the radio station. But I nagged, him, I nagged the shit out of him at the radio station and it paid off <laughs> look at that we did a thing open mic is sunday oh crap that's right open mic is sunday this is saturday oh dang it son of a stink <laughs> potatoes potatoes tea at her house all right all right we're gonna go on it oh, though i'd love that that's right i forgot great I thought it's open gonna mic be fun was sunday see you tomorrow saturday. night then Gotta go now. The telephone troops need to know the assault can be abandoned. The beep didn't work. It better have worked. It better have worked, guys. Does the beep work? I can't hear it. That beep better work. <laughs> Does the beep work on your end? That better work. <laughs> go, gotta go out to an open mic. Yeah, we still gotta go to that stupid open mic night chat. Some stink, guys. Ha 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 ha, says Welsh. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Chat, should I just give them... Should I just keep... Should I pocket Tobias's $10? and give the chicken massage myself live on stream. I could do that, guys. What beep? Oh, dear. Uh, the beep didn't work. Oh, dear. Well, I'm ruined. Are you pushing it now, says Tracy? I am pushing it. You're right. Okay, let's go to the right, guys. <laughs> what beep? You guys better hear the beep. Is that going through? That better be going through, chat. That would be awkward. It would be. You're right. Uh, I'd like to watch that. <laughs> I'm not, not going to do that, guys. That's a little too weird for me. Even for me. Like, I'm a weird dude, but I, even I would not massage a rubber chicken on stream. Uh, no, don't do it. Yeah. Oh, crap. You guys can't hear the beep. I got this new mixer. It's supposed to beep. No beep. Wow, everyone's saying no beep. Okay. All right. I'll have to fix it. I'll have to fix it, chat. I'll fix it after the stream. Do it. I know it's working, Eric. The chat's messing with me. I knew it was working the whole time, okay? I f knew it. Uh-oh, I hope it worked. Oh, uh, did it work there? <laughs> Better have worked. 
Only my dog hears it. Oh my god. Only my dog hears it. All right, we gotta go in the woods here. For some reason, we have a, a letter in the woods chat. There's a lot of people live in these woods, guys. Pretty cool. Oh, it's this guy again. Ah, na 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 na. It's Faramero. Yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> my noise canceling filtered my the beef. <laughs> noise canceling. <laughs> Got him. Eric, Eric ratted you guys out. Thank you so much there, Tobias. I appreciate it. It works. I know it works, Gregory. I know it works. Why would it, how would it not work? <laughs> of course it works. At first, I wasn't working when I asked if you were pushing it now. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, the problem is it's right next to this button. So I, I might accidentally one day press this button instead. This button right here. So you might hear a weird, like... Son of a... Stick. Like that, chat. And it might be a, a very deep swear word. So I apologize if that happens. But it is possible. I was messing with you first two right. Oh, Eric. Eric, you silly goose. Right, let's see where this is going. Okay, we have a package at the bait shop. All right, we gotta go to the bait shop, chat. Bait shop. That'd be awesome. No, it won't. It won't be awesome, chat. <laughs> it could happen, though. Um, thank you very much, Tobias. Uh, nothing like a deer. <laughs> no. <laughs> That'd be so weird. Uh, potty mouth. I'm not, I'm not really swearing, guys. When I say, when I say things like, what the f***, I say fudge. I, I really don't swear. I just like the beep because I like the I like the sound of the beep. You guys believe me, right? Not like it would be the first time. That's true, yeah. I always press the wrong buttons, chat. Uh lies, demonetized, right? We're not demonetized, guys. Guys. <laughs> guys. Hey, you're a retired streamer, you can you can let loose. Eh! You really can't though. See, YouTube has this thing called terms of service. I have to abide by YouTube's rules, guys. I can't just say anything I want. I'm pretty sure you can swear on YouTube, but I don't I don't really want to either. You know, I, I feel like you guys, you know, this stream's very wholesome and innocent. And, uh, you know, we have we have standards here. And we, we like to we like to have, um, you know, very clean language. So, yeah, you know, I like to... Robert says, what are you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> We're an innocent chat. <laughs> what standards? <laughs> what standards? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, wholesome. Very wholesome, guys. All right, let's go over here. <laughs> we gotta go over here. Oh, jeez. Stop lying, says Dakota. Dakota! All right, let me get over here, guys. Oh, all right, we gotta deliver one more package to the guy with the mutton chops. All right. The only guy we're not back in this town. Uh, Jonesy says, complete BS. <laughs> complete BS. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's just get our package, chat. We gotta grab our package, all right? I'm surprised you guys haven't made a joke about that yet. Rye's still on, t on YouTube's permanent watch list. I feel like I am, yeah. I definitely am, chat. Guys, who here is an OG? We have been streaming for four hours and 45 minutes. Can you believe it? Give yourself a little round of a hand, chat. Give yourself a round of a hand. We're gonna play the new song that I use in the ending credits. Give yourself a round of a hand if you are an OG, if you have been here the entire time. It's fine if you haven't. I don't care if you've been here for two minutes or four hours. Thank you, chat, for hanging out today. You guys are absolutely awesome. We got some OGs in the chat. Look at all the OGs. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Thanks for sticking it out with me today, guys. I didn't think it was going to be that long of a stream, but it, it was, guys. It was. All right. Where do we deliver this? Because he's not even here. Where is he? You guys see the dude anywhere? Where is he? Hashtag hand. Thank you for the hands, chat. Appreciate the round of hands. Did he fall in the lake? Is he dead? 17-hour <laughs> stream. It could, it could be a little bit longer. It's probably not going to be that much longer, guys. Down by the boat. Uh, coming up. Oh, really, Robert? Okay. He was down by the boats. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Don't forget to uh, pick up your pictures. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Oh, there he is. Hey. Ah, the wax worms have arrived. Wax worms. Ew, I've been Ew. walking around with worms. Have I been walking around with worms? <laughs> you sure have. They're just in time. I'm taking a boat to the island this afternoon. Oh, nice. A boat trip. I love boat trips. Oh, I want to nice. go on a boat. A boat trip. 
I want to go hey, in the boat. Hey, you can tag along if you want, like your father used to. But I'm not helping you with any wax picks, worms. Yeah. Really sounds like fun. I appreciate the invitation, but fishing is not for me. Uh, yeah, I want to go on a, oh, really? on a boat. Definitely. Sounds like fun. Okay, we'll show up here at 4 p.m. sharp. Yeah, let's go on the boat, chat. We're going on the boat. All right, let's return to the post office. And we got to show up there at 4 p.m. sharp. Get wax. We're going to get wax there, Dwayne. Yes, we are. Oh, yeah, let's stop by the photo hut, too. We got to stop by the photo hut, too, guys. All right. Pick up our photos. Right, couldn't even catch a cold. Chat, I could catch a cold. Oh, guys, I want to let you know. Um, there's still a company out there that has not forgotten about me yet. And they gave me a free, uh, a free Steam code to play a fishing demo. Now, it looks really crappy. <laughs> but should we play it anyway? Even the video of it looks horrible. Needless to say, it's from Playaway. Um, but yeah, should we play it? It's called, like, uh, something fishing. Play it, it's free. Yeah. Maybe we should. Raya, uh, you... Looking for his panty photo. Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah. We got to go back to the photo hut, guys. General store. Yeah. Why not? Yeah, play it. All right, we'll check it out. I'll check it out, chat. Yeah, we'll check it out. Why aren't all demos free? Well, it's a, it's like an early code. I don't think I don't think it's out yet. It was like an early code. Or did they give me a code for a free demo? Maybe they did give me a code for a free demo. Oh wait, general store is back here. Thrustmaster forgot about you. Oh, yeah. Thrustmaster, Thrustmaster don't talk to me anymore, chat. I still love them. But, yeah, they don't message me. <laughs> I said, I'll be honest. I'll be honest, chat. The last contract I had with Thrustmaster, which was a long time ago, um, not, it wasn't worth it. I had to do ATS three days a week for a month. That is the first time in my life I ever felt like a sellout. And they, they offered another sponsorship to me, and I turned it down. I did. And then they never talked to me again. So. That's not bad. Three times a week for a month? Three times a week for a month. What did I say? Did I say something else? Yeah, I, I was not happy with that. Uh, you return to the post office or the general store. Yeah, yeah, I gotta get my photos, guys. I gotta get my photos. Uh, do you fly anymore? I, I will, Big App. Yeah, I will. I will uh, eventually. I just haven't set it up yet, my friend. I got a long, long setup process. Because I got a new PC. And when you get a new PC and you have to set up Flight Sim again and all your mods and everything, I would do that. You would do that? I wouldn't do that. I would never do that again, chat. It's only eight hours a week. No, it wasn't eight hours a week. I think it was, um, um... Nine hours a week. <laughs> it was nine hours a week. Three times a month for a week. <laughs> a, no, it was three time, three days a week. You, you guys would sit through three days a week of ATS for a month? No. Nobody's sitting through that, guys. No. So I, I did not want to do that. Uh, I did not like that, guys. I did not enjoy it. Uh, heck yes, is Ringo. No, you're the only one, Ringo. I don't see anybody else to saying get the yes. To work. Yes, is Here Major. are the pictures. No. Don't say yes. Oh my god, all the pictures. She's showing me the pictures that I took. Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. All the weird pictures I took. Through the through the crack. Yeah, so you can set the rack record. That's a no for me. I wouldn't want to do it. That's a good picture. That's a good picture. That's a good picture. <laughs> Busted! <laughs> Ooh, creeping on Angie. I was creeping on Angie. Busted! <laughs> what you doing with that pic? I took that picture. Oh, man. I didn't know we were going to have to see it. Oh, I didn't know we were going to have to see the picture that I took. <laughs> All right, Chad, are we happy with how they turned out? Thank you. I guess. I'm happy with how they turned out. Perfect. If you'd have picked them up earlier this week, you could have participated in a photography contest. <laughs> I don't think I would have won anyway. Really, I would have loved that. Okay. Oh, we could have. Oh, 
Oh, I'm so mad. If oh, we would if we would have picked them up earlier, we could have done a photo contest. I could have entered that photo into a contest. Oh, I'm so mad right now. That would have been the greatest thing in the world. Could you imagine? Could you imagine a photo contest and that is the that photo was in it? Oh, I'm so mad. What a missed opportunity. What a complete missed opportunity. That would have been the greatest. If that picture would have won, could you imagine? <laughs> oh, really? I would have loved that. Of course really? I would have loved that. I would have loved that. Ah. You can probably only win contests like those if you're a professional. Oh, I'm a professional. Um, Yeah, good equipment is expensive. Yeah, good equipment is expensive. I know. She yeah, should have told us to buy it. you probably need an extra mail route to be able to afford it. This girl's a son of a stink. Uh, if you would have been the hero of per Pervert Oaks. Dude, I'm so sad. I'm so sad we missed that opportunity. I didn't realize. We should have We should have came back and got the pictures. Uh, I completely forgot about the pictures. You know why I forgot about, about the pictures? Um, because I forgot about it. Thank you for the son of stink stickers there, David Rivers. I appreciate that, buddy. Oh, man. I didn't, I didn't take a screenshot. I see all the screenshots, chat. I see them all in the Discord. <laughs> Oh, we're out on the boat now, <laughs> pervert oaks. <laughs> oh, we're out on the boat. I need a little so, drink of water, chat. Can we get some coffee cups, please? I do, Nick. Is this a quiet day, or does it always take this long? I think he's going to murder me. Fishing requires patience. We've only been here for two hours. Wow, this guy changed his tone real fast, didn't he? Uh, that's, that's the nice thing about fishing. <laughs> and that's the nice thing about fishing. Yeah, there's a fine line between boredom and relaxation. There sure is. I find it hard to relax sometimes. I find it hard to relax sometimes. Fishing also requires silence. Key his boat. I think we should key his boat, Dan. Chad, permission to key his boat. This guy's being a jerk. Yeah. Bert? Can I ask you a question? He's getting mad at me. <laughs> All right. So should we bother him? Ask him about life or do we? does he like Maureen? What do we like? Kit? Yes. Okay. Granted, <laughs> we're keen as both. Uh, is she about to go overboard? I think she is. All it is, we are one push away from being shark food here, chat. Uh, push him overboard <laughs> about life. All right. Let's ask him number three. I like the juicy details. Do you like Maureen? Bias. We ought to be heading back home. It's been a fine day, and I thank you for the company. Well, none of that went well. That went very, very awkward and poor. That was terrible. All right, we're back at home, though. At least we're back at home. It's Friday night chat. Kay's tape. Let's have a listen. All right, this is Kay's mixtape. Got rejected again. I did, Dan. Ooh. Sarcasm is a second language. I think so. I don't hear it, though. Oh, the music's copyright. Oh, wait. Here, maybe I can turn it on. I don't... So I turned off copyright music, chat. Um, so... That might be an actual song. Let's... Thinking of what might have been... Radio keeps track of time. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, that was terrible. That was terrible. <laughs> Ooh. She's terrible. Hello? Hi, Meredith. Guess what I shine today. <laughs> What's up, Asus? Haven't seen you in a while, buddy. How's it going? Turn back off, this big half. Oh my god. Oh my god. Better than Raya, says Troy. Oh, the dogs are howling. All right, let me turn that back off, guys. Settings. Music off. <laughs> You're disappointed in the old lady. Yes. Oh, definitely. Definitely, Chad. What a mess. Nikki Vance says, like you could have done better. Uh, Ryan, come on. Hey, I could, should I try to do better? Let's try to do better. Wait, hold on. Uh, 
I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, hear me shout. Tip me over, pour me out. All right, let's never speak of this again, guys. Let's never speak of this again. Yes, turn the music all the way back down. All right. All right, I will. I will. Let me just let me just get that sound back off, chat. <laughs> oh, I already did. <laughs> I already did. Okay, that was way worse. <laughs> Sorry. I've ruined the stream. Hmm. Let me Negative see. Ghost Rider. The m, -m, -m monster deal? Oh, yes. You are now talking to Steve Mitchell, CEO of a multi-million dollar enterprise. Chat! But before I continue my insufferable bragging, I have a thing or two to say to you about you. You've been a huge part of the success of this company, and I feel this is just the beginning. We're entering the golden age of personal computers and personal computers, we've got front row yeah. tickets. The past two weeks have made me realize that I couldn't have done it without you, and I'm going to need you even more in the coming years. So oh. here's a new monster deal I uh -oh. want you to think about. Become a partner in the company for 20% of the shares and a significant pay raise. Sig Kent. The only condition is that I need your commitment for the next five years. Five so, there years. It is. Think about it, and let's talk about it more when you're back in the office. Wow. Okay, so we did that homework that we were supposed to do. Steve made $5.5 million. He wants to give me 20%. What is 20% of $5 million, chat? And a massive raise. But he needs me for five years. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I'm going to say this is a bit of a surprise. This is a bit of a surprise. Just let it sink One in. One million? Uh, I don't need an answer right now. I have to get back to my uh, million-dollar lifestyle. Actually, no. Holy I, I crap. I need to get on lots of stuff. Talk soon, Meredith. All right, he said something about doing crank, and then he hung up the phone. Uh, he's going to give you a Monopoly money. Uh, he might. <laughs> this is so crazy, chat. Oh, my goodness. One Good million says Logan. Good line friends. Aunt oh, yeah, we got a babysit. I forgot we got a babysit tonight. for Granny, too. Come here. Kitty, kitty. Ow. Hey, kitty, kitty. Aw. <laughs> kitty, kitty. His last name is Jobs. Is Steve's name Jobs? Oh, my God, Brian. Saturday, September 13th. Morning time. Do a it. postcard from Angie. Miss Meredith, it's Angie. I'm so, so sorry I haven't been able to see you. Aww. It's just that I've been swamped organizing my not-so-timely exit from Providence Oaks. I'm sure you understand. You've probably seen the foreclosure notice. That certainly helped expedite my decision to leave. Aww, she got foreclosed anyway, I'll on. Anyway, I'll be honest. I'm still Dang. thinking about that kiss we shared in the car. Don motion. And I don't usually dwell on these kind of things. So, feel special, Meredith. Thinking about I the hear kiss. you're going to the open mic night on Sunday. I wasn't planning on going, but I want to see you before I leave. I'm really anxious to find out what you've decided to do. Whether you're going to stay in this town or go back to the city or do something else entirely. And I'm going to be forward, as you know I always am. I'd like to know if little old me figures into those plans somehow. So anyway, I'll see you there, yeah? Love, Angie. Rekindle the flame! She's gonna be at the, the karaoke! And she wants a long term future with your old pal, Female Raya. Uh, no, 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 we're leaving for the million. Oh, Josie! Oh, Josie! Go be a millionaire. This is true. Think of how many bodacious babes we could buy with a million dollars. But do we take this true love and see if she... F Maybe we could take Angie with us. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. Well, forget about Robert now. Forget Robert now, guys. Return to the post office. All right, we're going to return to the post office, chat. What's going on in here? <laughs> Robert might be better. I doubt it, Chad. I don't think Robert's better. Uh, Robert's a bit of a... I don't know. Robert's kind of a... a Fuss pot, if you know what I mean. Would you guys describe Robert as an old fuss pot? Why are there floating things in the post office? There are floating. What is happening here? There's floating pens. 
Oh, man. Everybody forgets me, says Robert. Oh, I, no, what I meant was... No, Robert, what I meant was... What, what I meant was... Um, Robert's really cool, and we love him, and we hope he stays here all the time. Alien, says this is. <laughs> There's likes men and women, says Maddie. Um, I don't know. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm backpedaling here, chat. I'm backpedaling, guys. <laughs> Everyone forgets me. I'm sorry, Robert. All right, let me see here. Not you, not you. Okay. Well, I am in the post office. What's going on here? It says return to the post office. I am here. Well, what's happening right now, chat? I didn't even deliver the... I didn't even deliver anything. Happy Saturday, everyone. It's time once again bomb. for a... Theo, oh, it's broken chat. Okay. Today's verdict is from Cheryl. Hi, Jack. I went for a walk the other day and... It's going to your mailroom? All right, Chad. Got you, buddy. Okay. Jack. All right, we got a package for the general store here, Chad. Robert and Lumberjack in 321. Oh, my God. All right, let me see here. We got Main Street. Justice for Robert. This is our last day as a mail carrier. Chat, I gotta say, it's been very, very bittersweet, you know? Uh, would you guys say it's been bittersweet as our time as a mail carrier, guys? This is our last day as a mail carrier. Oh, you're still here, huh? In the game. That makes two of us. That makes two of us. When are your parents coming back? Do you miss them? Do you miss them? What would make you think that? Dump Angie, jump you, Justice for Roger. Do you guys think we should go with Robert or, or Angie? Well, they're nice folks, aren't they? You're so warm-hearted. Everyone probably likes You're you. You're so warm-hearted. <laughs> Everyone probably likes you. That's sarcasm. Everybody's nice to me because P.O. would fade away without this door. It's a bittersweet symphony. They should replace the deer statue with one of you. <laughs> they should replace the deer statue with one of you. A bit of appreciation every now and then would be nice. Oh. Well, I better be on my way. Angie's at the top of that list. I, I, I'm going for Angie, guys. I got to go for Angie, chat. Angie, Robert, you guys get them both? I don't think we could, I don't know if we could get both. Uh, if we can, maybe. Uh, postal worker to millionaire. Rye went from postal worker to part-time streamer. <laughs> I did. You're right. So long, Miss so Sunshine. Long, Miss Sunshine. Justice for Newt. I, I think Newt should get his justice. I agree, chat. I agree, guys. I don't know. I'm thinking we take Angie and go be a millionaire with Angie, chat. Let's go do that. What do you guys think? <laughs> go be a millionaire with Angie? We could probably have both. Oh my goodness. Joe Wolf, come on. Cut the, cut the stink there, buddy. All right. Uh, looking for another replay and you're still live? Oh, what's up there, Cody? Yes, we are still live today, buddy. This game is taking so long. So long. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but I'm having fun with it. You guys like the long stream? I'm liking the long stream today, chat. All right, let me see here. We got to deliver a letter to the farm. Oh, we got a couple more letters up this way, too. Son of a stink, guys. All right, let's knock out all the city letters, too. We're going to knock out all the city le letters. Tag comment. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Let me uh, get rid of that. There we go. Um, what is the metal detector guy? Oh, that's right, Nick. I forgot about the metal detector guy. I forgot about him. Andrew Salish is fun. Thank you, Andrew. Thank you, buddy. You're very nice, sir. Lick long streams. <laughs> I lick long streams, too. Let's get all these letters out of the way. Well, good, Balsh. I'm glad. The only thing is, I, I feel like I lose a little bit of steam after about three or four hours, chat. So, like, right now, I'm feeling like, I'm feeling like I have to, like, it's, 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 I'm hungry, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I'm starving. Chat, should I order a Sandy? I feel like I, I should order a Sandy. Let's order a Sandy, guys. I lose my voice before that. Me too. Usually I do, but my voice has taken such a beating over the years that it doesn't even go away anymore. It's like always bad. <laughs> uh, you fatty. I'm starving. Order food. <laughs> order food. I'm so hungry, chat. Uh, order eats from Crispy. Oh, I don't live near Crispy, guys. Yeah. If I did, I would love to. What if, what if I ordered Uber Eats from Crispy and he actually showed up and like came to hang out? Uh, boo your belly. Uh, I'm making dinner right now, says Robert. That sounds delicious there, buddy. I am starving. Nick Cross with Here's a burger. Thank you, Nick Cross, for the 149 burger super sticker there, buddy. I appreciate that, Nick Cross. Thank you so much for that. You're awesome, man. We got Mr. Harry V with the thumbs up as well. Thank you for the thumbs up there, Harry. Get you a cheese toasty. Should I order a cheese toasty, guys? Maybe a cheese toasty? Uh-oh. I have, like, so many missed calls. Why? 
Why do I miss calls? Hold on a second, chat. Nobody ever calls me. Okay, never mind. Nothing important. <laughs> uh, my mother is making tacos for lunch. Order Chet food, too. See, I feel bad. I feel like I should order Chet food, guys. Uh, we got, oh my goodness, Asus Server Tech uh, with a brand new but not quite new membership. Let's get some Asus in the chat. Asus, thank you for the brand new but not new. You, you are caught, you, you're hitting a purple R there. I think, what is purple? Purple is two months, right? Thank you for the two months and the re-support. I appreciate that very, very much, Asus. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Welcome back. That is awesome. I haven't seen you in a while. Becomes a new member again. Thank you, buddy. Thank you very much. Thank you to the Asus's, guys. I appreciate it. Asus Server Tech. All right, am I at the right house? I think I am. Yes, I am. Um, Robert's been calling you. <laughs> Robert's been calling me. Was that Robert on the phone, guys? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, chat. Robert was on the phone. Just, just dump the mail in the dumper, you slacker. <laughs> Thank you. I should. I should do that. Yeah, we should just dump the mail. You know what we should do? We should just run this postal van into the lake. Let's do that. Right, can we group call you? No, please don't do that. I mean, we're kind of on a group call already, aren't we? I feel like we are, chat. Hey, Ryan, how is Lauren? I haven't heard much about her lately. There it is. It only took five hours today. I appreciate that, Troy. I'm, I don't mean to be a son of a stink, buddy, but every day somebody comes in and says, how's Lauren been? We haven't seen her lately. She's a word, chat. She goes to work. For like two years, she didn't have to go to work every day. Now she has to go to work a lot. He lost her. He lost her. Oh, man. <laughs> it's just funny. It's just funny. Like, everyone thinks she's like gone or missing, chat. Uh, <laughs> I was going to say something there. I was gonna say something there, but I won't say it. I won't say it. I won't say it. <laughs> Someone has to pay the bills. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? What do you think? I'm like paying these bills on my own. Oh my goodness, chat. Uh, <laughs> thank you again, guys. Cody, thank you for the four dollar or three dollar fist bump super sticker. I appreciate it. The chicken's paying the bills now. Uh, she's locked up in the shed. She's not locked up in the shed, guys. Oh my goodness, chat. Do I look like a man who would lock, lock up his girlfriend in the shed between the streams? No. Um, you should put up that explanation on the soundboard. I should. <laughs> She's locked in the basement with Dr. Dre. Oh, my goodness, chat. Thank you so much there, Cody. I appreciate it. Thank you, Asus. Appreciate the love, guys. You guys are awesome. You guys are awesome. Uh, yes, kind of. Yeah. Oh, stop it, chat. Stop it, okay? <laughs> She's with Drew now. She's with Drew. You know, she was talking to Drew the other day. And Drew Barter, after you barred the Wi-Fi, oh my God. I feel like we're gonna. I feel like we're gonna get into a conversation that's gonna, that's gonna go way too far. So let's drop it now, chat. <laughs> let's drop it now. That's a low blow, chat. That's a low blow. That is a low blow. Even for the chat. Even for the chat, guys. All right. Don't be putting ideas in my head. It's a Drew Spiracy. It's a Drew Spiracy chat. Yes, it is, guys. <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, my goodness, chat. Uh, I'm going to shut up. Thank you, Jared. Thank you. Thank you. Let's just get through the game. we got to focus on the game, guys. All right. Let's focus on the game. Blushing Riot. Uh, this is not going to go away. Yeah. There's going to be something that will be said if we go down this road, chat. And uh, I don't want to go down that road, guys. <laughs> Drew's calling you. All those missed calls were from Drew. Uh, that's favoritism. That's favoritism. That's right there, Harry Vanilla. That's right there, Harry Vanilla. Jealous Ryan. I'm not jealous. Chat, hey. Do I look like a man that gets jealous? <laughs> yes. Yes! No! I don't get jealous, guys. My goodness. Yes. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. So cheese toasty? Yeah, let's get it. Let's have a cheese toasty. I'm not even at the right house. This is the right house. What? 
Oh, it's a package house. It's a package house, guys. Dungeon payment is due. Dungeon payment is not due, chat. All right, we're at Vintage Street, guys. 103 Vintage Street. No, 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 no. It happens. It does. Ha it happens from time to time, guys. But I'm definitely not a jealous guy, all right? Uh, absolutely, you're green. <laughs> green. All right. Nope. No answer. No answer for this package. Everyone does. Everyone does. Yeah, exactly. If you, if you don't, if you say you've never got jealous before about anything, then you're, you're obviously lying, Chad. Uh, it puts the lotion on its skin. Or as it gets the hose again. I can see you getting jealous about Lauren performing a kickflip before you could. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if, if Lauren performs kickflips on a skateboard before I do, I will definitely be very, very jealous, Chad. Uh, not an email. It's the mail. Yeah, it's not an email. It's the mail there, Vishal. What's up there, Vishal? So it's not clicking right. Whenever whenever Here's I click to deliver the mail, it's not doing it right. I think the game's starting to bug out a little bit. I'm jealous of retired streamers. Me too, Eric. Yeah, I'm, je I'm definitely jealous of retired streamers. Especially retired streamers that say they're going to be done, and then they just stream even more. <laughs> they stream five to six days a week. You know they say they're retired, chat. I'm definitely jealous of them, for sure. The game is sick of us. I think so, Rob. We played it for far too long today. You're right. <laughs> Fair Marrow. Hey, I used to have a real job, Fair Marrow. I was a truck driver for 16 years. And before that, I smoked. Never mind. Um, I'm glad you're still here, brother. Love you. Thank you there, Vishal. You're being very, very nice to me today. Oops, I hit the wrong button, chat. Um, I'm a retired streamer, streaming six-hour days. I know. Yeah. What are we on right now? Five hours and 15 minutes, guys? Guys, should I force an ad on you? Oh, man. YouTube just popped up. It said now would be a good time to insert an ad. Oh. YouTube is being a son of a stink. I would never, ever force an ad on the chat, guys. Never. Not in a million years. Uh, you should have forced an ad when you went to the bathroom. No, no, Robert. I'm not forcing ads, guys. You guys would probably, probably um, do it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. This is fair, man. Should I force an ad? Still here. No, 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 no. Gringo. No, no, no. Um, do it. Do it. I don't want to do that. That's a son of a stink move, guys. Streamers of force ads are son of a stink. I got premium, so bring it. I don't know if you get an ad with premium. That's a good, I, I don't know. That's a good question. Would you get one? Double dog dare you to? No, I would never do that, guys. I would never do that. How about this? If we hit 545 likes, I will force an ad. <laughs> I would never do that. That's some of the thing move. Do it for science? Maybe we should do it for science. All right, let's try it for science. If you get paid, then do it. Um, I don't think I get paid very much for that. I mean... Uh, a forced ad on 250 people, that might be like a dollar chat, honestly. Maybe like five dollars. Whoa, it is storming. Chat, it is legit storming right now in this game. Why is it storming in the game, guys? Uh-oh. And we're... And... Money's money. No, your, your happiness is way more important than money, chat, for me. Chat, it is storming and we're going into the woods here. Uh-oh, I got premium says well. Really, buddy? Oh, man, it is coming down. One ad in five hours ain't bad. Ah, I wouldn't. I'm not going to do it. Wow, listen to the rain. The rain looks really good. We got trees blowing here, too. Premium here, too, says Jordan. Really, buddy? You guys are hooked up. Jeez. Five bucks will eliminate one um, of Cody's payments for the fast food restaurant. That's true. You're right. Star. Thank you, Sue's Turbo Tech, for that brand new membership. Thank you, Cody. Thank you. I appreciate the support, guys. This is loud. Where's the ad? I didn't force it. I didn't force it, guys. Why is it so loud? Okay, we got one more package um, for the motel. Oh, we got to go to the motel and Reynolds Farm, guys. One more package for the motel and Reynolds Farm. He added me for science, D. Colby. All right, let's do it for science. All right, I'll, I'll leave a poll up. I'll leave a poll up. And we'll see. I've never forced an ad before. All right, you guys vote in the chat. Do you want to force an ad for science and see what happens? I'm actually curious as to see who would get the ads. Uh, storms are usually loud. It's true. That's true. 
I didn't say it was bad. I guess I am kind of pointing out the obvious. You're right. Uh-oh, my lights are going out. What the heck? Chat, did you see my lights blinking? That is so weird. That is so weird. My lights were blinking. What was up with that? That was so weird, guys. Um, oh my goodness, we got a LinkedIn coming in as well from Asus Server Tech. Asus, thank you for the brand new gifted to the one, the only. Who got it? I didn't even see who got it. <laughs> Let me help this algorithm. <laughs> Thank you so much, Asus, for the gifted sub. Who about that gifted guy? Why didn't it tell me? I thought it showed up, but it didn't. Oh, there it is, Princeton. Princeton got the gifted. That's awesome. The poll is gone. Oh, really? Oh, no. The poll is gone. No poll. The poll should be up. It should be up, chat. What happened to the poll? Uh, we got 75% of you guys said yes. Some... Uh oh. All right, we should force an ad, guys. Let's force an ad, chat. Here comes the butthole. I know. I know. The lights blink. He's coming. <laughs> Thank you very much, Asus, for that. Uh, gifted to Brenston. I'm sorry I couldn't see it. I don't know why I couldn't see it for a second. Oh, it's because Bashal was getting all his comments deleted. That's why. That's why I couldn't see it. <laughs> okay, bye, says Bashal. Bashal, you just calm down there, buddy. If you're going to spam, you're going to get muted there, buddy. Uh, Ryan playing ATS. All right. It's the mail. Grab his wig. I'm busy. <laughs> okay. Good luck. No. Damn. Ooh. I almost had. I almost fucked. Oh, Thanks for Jesus. breaking my concentration. He's swearing left and right, chat. <laughs> I got the bleep in, though. I got the bleep in. Oh, my God, guys. <laughs> wow. Okay. Holy crap. Too slow right No, I got him. I got it. I got the swears, chat. I didn't get all of the D word, but I got a lot of the F word. <laughs> I did. Thank you very much there, Faramero, for the $2 super chat as well. Since I got pregnant, bring on the ads. Oh, thank you there, buddy. Thank you there, buddy. I don't want to force an ad. I feel bad, chat. But I will. I will. After, when I'm just driving around, I'll force it. You're welcome. All right. Take it easy. It's just a game. Oh, I'm sorry. Should I tell him to take it easy, chat? Way too slow. He's playing SnowRunner. He is playing SnowRunner. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to tick him off even more. Ooh, take it easy. It's just a game. <sighs> Video games are supposed to be fun. I feel horrible. Absolutely horrible. Maybe you should try a different hobby. Maybe you should try a different He's playing hobby. Farm Sim. You know what? I can beat this game, and I'm not quitting until I have. <laughs> Good luck with that. He's playing Only Up. Oh, he might have been playing Only Up. Yeah, that didn't go well, chat. That did not go well at all. <laughs> that did not go well at all. Thank you again, Asus and Faramero and Zachary Wisson dropping a gifted also. We got Zachary coming in with a one gifted membership also. Thank you very much there, Zachary Wisson. Appreciate the love there, buddy. Thank you so much, guys. Wow. I have to go take my daughter to gymnastics. You outlasted me, Ryan. Well, thank you there, Jordan. You guys have a good day at gymnastics, my friend. You're going to miss the ending, though. Guys, don't you want to see what happens? Don't you want to see what happens? Is that Ryan? Is joke guy? Yes, that is me. That is a very loud storm. Um, when is the next only upstream? I don't know, Faramero. Next time you guys talk me into it, I guess. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Why are my lights blinking? Whoa! That lightning looked awesome. That lightning looked super, super awesome, chat. That looked really, really cool, actually. Amo says yes. Um, we got Tobias said, I do. You know, I do. I'm going to mess with the game, you too. Yeah, I want to see the ending, too. I'm excited to see what, what kind of, uh, consequences we're gonna have for our actions i'm very very invested chat all right let's go to the right we're gonna do our last um mail delivery here at the farm guys uh it did yeah it did look cool i liked it, it looked awesome uh rain sounds good it does i like the rain chat i do i do i like the rain guy tobias 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 ryan do ryan gotta go in 18 minutes only up. I'm not. There is a there is a speed run of only up, but the speed runs a little. The speed runs a little sus because they use game bugs. I, I mean, I know that's fine. You can play the game as it lies. Like that's the rules of speed running. But 
I don't know. I feel I feel like I wouldn't be able to do it. I I, I don't like. It's not that I don't like. It's just that I don't think I would be able to exploit the bugs. You know, you gotta exploit bugs and all that stuff. Headlights are red from all the wrecks. <laughs> Probably. Probably. Oh wait, this is just a. This is just yeah. This is empty. Okay. Just a, a letter. Speed run for Ryan would be like three hours. Exactly. Yeah. This was supposed to be three hours today. How many hours are we at? This this stream was supposed to be three hours today, Chad. Okay, fellow Providence Okians, it's time once again for the sent-in letters and announcements. This one's from our very own Maureen, or Mo, as we all know. Hey, foe. Just wanted to grab your ears for a second to let you know all about the upcoming open mic night over at Mo's Diner this Sunday. That's right. Claim your 15 minutes of fame, enjoy some whale performances, and the usual good food and drinks for everyone. I expect to see all of y'all for a great evening. And maybe even some dancing. You know who you are. Come join the show at Moe's at 8 p.m. this Sunday. She's inviting I'll the whole town. You if you don't. Well, you heard her, folks. Shut up, lady. And I'll be there, too, so you better not she miss so Back much. to the music and to one of my favorite songs. They should have a game mode where you don't have Meredith. her character in the game. Farmer DJ Jack. Farmer DJ Jack. Seen any ghost drivers on the way here? Do too thick listen. Ghost drivers? Ghost drivers? Yeah, you know, people driving on the wrong side of the road. Nope, haven't seen them. Okay, I was just wondering. Don't bother. I need to get back to the live show. See That's you tomorrow, good. I reckon. Bye now. Uh, bye, Jack. Oh, and please close the door. Don't want to broadcast any mail truck noise. Thank you much. Close the door. So, okay, so... What is he talking about ghost drivers for? That sounds a little bit strange, guys. I don't know how I feel about that. There's no, there's, called Ryan, he's streaming, so you're safe. <laughs> it's true. I'm a ghost driver. He said ghost driver. Yeah, what are ghost drivers? That's weird. I guess we better be on the lookout for him. That is sus. I agree, Dan. Yeah, that's very sus. I don't know what the ghost drivers are. Thank you again, Zachary. I appreciate the sub, man. Thank you for that one gifted sub. I did not see you get it, who got it, but uh, thank you very, very much for watching. Whoever got that gifted, appreciate you all. Thank you so much, guys. Some ghost drivers, maybe. Is that a ghost driver? He said they were driving on the road, the wrong side of the road. We'll have to keep an eye out, chat. Let's keep an eye out, guys. Shaw says, I'll behave now. Well, thank you for Shaw. Thank you, buddy. Raya is the ghost driver. I'm not the ghost driver. All right, so that was the entire mail route. Let's head back to the post office, guys. And it is now the end of our week. Tomorrow's the party. We get to meet up with Angie. Oh, I'm excited, chat. Guys, if you're excited to meet up with Angie, drop a, uh, drop a Chrome Dome sticker. If you would rather me meet up with Robert and try to get with Robert, drop a clown sticker. Chrome Domes for Angie. Clowns for Robert, guys. What do you think I should do? What do you think I should do, chat? Uh, what did William say? Oh, my God. William says... Oh, yeah, I read that. <laughs> Thank you. I'm I'm Team Chrome Dome, chat. Yeah, I'm Team Chrome Dome. Dakota thinks we should do the do Robert. Okay, I got you. What about the cats? I forgot about the cats. Did we watch the cats? I think we did. I think we did watch the cats. Pretty sure we did, guys. All right. We're, we're pretty much Team Chrome Dome, guys. Yes, and we are. so ends a week full of turmoil. You can say that again. You can say that again. If only the Angels hadn't lost to the White Sox. That would have made it perfect. <laughs> Never underestimate the White Sox. How much uh, would you have won? I guess you can't have it all, Frank. Uh, how much would you have won? How much would you have won? dollars and 34 cents been a nice payday, That would have huh? been a real nice Playing payday. each other again tonight. Should I change the bet? Uh-oh, he's asking me about the bet. I don't know. I don't know if I should be asked about the bet, guys. Nope, hold the line. Yeah, that sounds logical. Sorry, I don't care one bit about sports gambling. So what should we tell him to do? We're going to leave this up to chat. Let's leave this up to the chat. Should we tell him to continue to bet how he's betting? Um, or should we... Um, hold the line chat or change the better hold the line change the better hold the line i think we should hold the line uh the black Sox uh will throw the game <laughs> maybe hold the line yeah i think hold the line yeah i agree i agree amanda says three though i i also don't care about sports betting either amanda but you know in the game i think we're gonna hold the line chat let's be responsible for his riches or okay let's see what happens 
Maybe you're my lucky charm. Oh, we might be his lucky charm, chat. Dinner's finished now. Time Have a to great weekend, watch. Meredith. Oh, wait. Sounds good, Robert. This was your last day. I totally forgot to tell you that they still haven't found someone else for the job. So, I guess you can have it if you want. We got the job. Chat, we got the job. Uh-oh, we gotta start making decisions like right now, chat. Oh, man. Oh, man. My boyfriend does that crap. I can't stand it, Amanda. I'm sorry, Amanda. I, I feel you, though. I feel you. Uh, cue the leprechauns. <laughs> this is William. And now, 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 we got one million. Wait, we have a million dollar job already. Oh. <sighs> All right. Do we give up the million dollar five year job for Steve? Or do we continue the postal service job in this hillbilly town? What do we do? Let me let me ask the chat. We gotta pull the chat. I'm gonna pull the chat. You guys are gonna decide right now. chat vote in the poll vote in the poll this is very very important guys i will do exactly what the majority of the chat wants me to do your girlfriend don't want to stay though right that's true dano king we have to take into account that the girlfriend might not want to stay might not want to stay guys oh really michelle that's really weird buddy uh, money can't buy happiness, but it certainly rents a heck of a lot of it. That's true. The girl isn't staying. I know to buy. I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do. Oh my goodness. Screw this town. <laughs> Ross is like, screw this town. Let's go postal. I don't know what to do. I am. I have no idea what to do. I honestly, I have no idea what to do. City go job gets the girl too. Really R2, huh? All right. We'll see what the chat says. Uh, she might go to the big city with you. Maybe Jonesy. Maybe buddy. I was liking this town though, man. The pole is neck and neck. It is, it's so close. It is so close. All right, let's check these results. Here we go, 115 of you voted. And ladies and gentlemen, 60% of you chose the million dollar Steve Jobs job. There it is. Honestly, I think it would have been, either way I'd be happy. No, dang it, I know, man. All right. Thanks, Frank, but no. Oh, I'm so sad in a way, though. I am sad in a way about this, though. The Paul doesn't count chicken to do the poll. It's true. Thanks, Frank, but no. City money. Sure. It's a great job. You know what? Think about it, man. Let me know Monday morning when you return your stuff. Okay. Gonna run now. He's letting Red me think Sox about it. Red Sox are playing the Yankees. He's letting me think about it. We have to we have to answer again on Monday. So we, we, we don't have to answer till Monday, guys. Feels like we're selling out. It does, Nick. I sold out the first master again. Redo the poll and reload the same. No, 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 no. We get to we get to we get to do it again on Monday, Hello? chat. Big money Hi, if you don't Mary. get fired the first. That's true, again. sir. How was your time in the mail delivery business? Oh, hi, Dad. Well, don't take this personally, but I'm glad it's almost over. It was okay, a nice change of scenery. I actually really loved it. I did love it. I did love my time I here. I actually really loved it. Awesome. Maybe you should just keep doing it. Worked out well for me. Seems like they haven't filled the vacancy yet. I'm afraid it'll be a bit, bit too monotonous. No. Actually, it seems like they haven't filled the vacancy yet. They haven't? Well, you know what I'd do. Oh, hold on, Meredith. Well, let me guess. Mom wants to talk to me? Hi, Meredith. Yeah, we got the re Sorry weekend to rethink it, it Fair Mero. You're thinking about staying in Providence Oaks? Hi, Mom. See what your girlfriend wants to do. She's not my girlfriend yet, Nuthouse. Uh, well, yeah, why not? I like it here. I'm not sure, to be honest. I'm going to say I'm not sure, to be honest. I'm not That's sure, what we'll to say, be guys. Honest. What are you not sure about, dear? Are other people involved? You know, any interesting, interesting ones, perhaps? No, that's not it. It's just easy going here. Well, there's some interesting developments. Yes, yes, I well, would say. Too, yeah. There are some interesting developments. Yes. Oh, there are. 
but are they really interesting enough to give up your entire career? Oh. Oh. Hold on. I have a suspicion Dad wants to talk to me. Meredith, I just wanted to say, you need to clean the lint filter on the dryer every once in a while. If you never do That's that, That's true, Denver. You bring up a good point. Yeah, she did kind of flake out on me, but I don't know. I mean, hey, guys, I, I do agree with Denver. I see what she's saying, but I don't know, man. That kiss in the car. You remember the, yeah, the kiss in the car? Do you remember the kiss in the car? I'm hanging on to that kiss in the car, chat. <laughs> I'm hanging on to it. Ooh, she sent a letter. Yeah, she did send a letter. That's true. She sent a letter, guys. Yeah. Second chances. I agree with Denver. I don't know. I, 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 see, it's so hard to decide, guys. And it's purposely hard to decide. Uh, no problem. I'll make sure I do that. You care more about clothes driving than my future. Oh my no God. problem, Dad. I'll make sure to do that. Great. Thanks. It could, Dakota. I sometimes suddenly worry about things like that in the middle of the night. And it's not about the dryer, of course. I want you to be safe. And I'm we'll, sure you'll We'll be decide okay. when it when the time comes, guys. All right? We'll decide when the time comes. We, don't withhold your judgment until we meet up with Angie, okay? Let's withhold our judgments until we meet up with Angie, guys. All right? Let's see what she has to say. Maybe it'll be a good thing. Maybe she'll take me in the back room and, you know, do stuff. <laughs> All right? It'll be fine. Don't lose sleep over me. I'll tell the dry. All right. I'll be fine. Whatever. Don't lose sleep over Jesus me. Jesus, Jordan. Okay, Em. Take care. I gotta go. We're running out of coins again. Bye. Bye. Judgy chat. <laughs> I don't know. We'll say. I mean, they, they bring up a good point. I think it's more of a conversation uh, than judgment. I hope you don't it's, think yeah. I'm a cheapskate for having dinner here. There aren't a lot of other restaurants around, and I'm uh -oh. pretty sure their food isn't better than Mo's. I forgot we had to have dinner with Robert too. Sorry about all those things I said about you, Robert. <laughs> don't worry about it, Robert. I love it here. Astoria has a few nice restaurants. Don't worry about it, Robert. I love it here. Thanks, Meredith. You're such a kind person. Good evening, you clean up beautiful nice people. Ready to order? Ladies first. Hi, Maureen. Okay, should I have a salad, a juicy steak, or pancakes, chat? Pancakes, I need pancakes. It's hard to pass up a juicy steak or a salad, please. I think we go for that steak, chat. T-Bone? I mean, he's paying for it probably, so, you know. <laughs> pancakes. <laughs> Gotta Hard go to for that juicy bone. Juicy T-bone steak. Excellent choice, Meredith. And what would you like to wash it down with? Hmm. I think I'll have a wine, beer, water, or coke. Wine, beer, water, or coke. I think we should go with the beer. We gotta have a beer, Andy Burleson. We gotta have a beer. Yeah. Wine. Um. I don't know. Wine and steak. I guess they go together, right? All of the above. <laughs> All of the above. Uh, Coke says Gregory. I think we go with the. I think we go with the beer chat. Beer, gotcha, Robert. The usual for me, Maureen. All right, Robert. T-bone steak and a beer. Doesn't get any more lumberjack than that. Be right back, folks. Ashley, His get the His usual out. is what I ordered. Maureen's the best. Did you hear about the open mic night she's organizing? Chat. Yeah. She only told me about it a dozen times. Chat. We just I ordered the same go. thing as his Especially usual. Especially since I heard that Jack's gonna do a thing. Jack. What's he gonna do? Give a lecture about potatoes? <laughs> Believe it or not, he's a very good ballet dancer. Jack's a ballet dancer? Uh, yeah, right, and you're his stage manager. Yeah, right. And you're his stage manager. <laughs> no, he's into comedy. I knew Would've it. Would've loved to heckled him. Oh well, this is a good week anyhow. It must be nice uh, that the apartments are off your mind. Or, or do I say because you're sitting here with me? Let's poke him a little bit. Let's poke him a little bit. Because see if he bites back. Because you're sitting here with me. All right. Here it are is. your beverages, folks. I'm afraid the food might take a little longer. As a certain kitchen Hashtag helper <laughs> thought the freezer was a good place for storing steaks. Uh, I really should get one of those microwave ovens to defrost them. You seem a little stressed. Is it the upcoming open mic? Why should I be stressed about that? It's going to be lovely. And you better be there, Robert Harris. Maureen, I'm sorry, but I'm afraid I won't be able to make it. I did not just hear you say that, young oh. man. Oh, by the way, Meredith, I need to steal him for two minutes. He needs to check on some wiring for me. Excuse me, Meredith. What? This is Maureen's jurisdiction. Have to obey the law. <laughs> Steak in the microwave, shut the mm, diner down. I know, right? so good. 
Thanks, Maureen, for the fantastic blueberry pie. What just happened there? You're welcome. <laughs> it's my way of making up for stealing you away from Meredith. Ooh, I swear. She can give quite the stink eye if she wants, can't you? Stink huh? eye? Oh boy, the world would be boring without her. <laughs> Fix the of, wiring, yeah. Are you gonna miss the your daily wiring, delivery Michael. round? Uh, it depends on who's on the round. Um, looking forward to going back to the big city. Oh, rejected again. Yeah, you ate alone again. I think I did. Check some wiring. Hmm, yeah, I know. Um, okay, what did he ask? I wasn't paying attention. What did he ask? Crap. <laughs> I forgot what he... I didn't realize what he asked. Son of a stink. Uh, two. Okay. Looking forward to going back to the big city. Yeah, I think we have to kind of like... Uh, what's up there, Cliff? How you doing, buddy? Uh, two. Yeah, just say yes. Uh, yeah, we'll just say yes, Andy. Yeah, are you going back? I'm, I don't know yet. I kind of the chat wants me to go back So maybe we'll just say that guys. Yeah. Not really. Two. I'm looking forward to going back to the big city. Ah, uh, the big city That's not for me Do you think you'll always live here? Nothing's for sure, Oof. but I like it here. I needed to change towns after my divorce Everything and everyone reminded me of these damaged goods anyway. I can imagine that hey have you gotten over it? And how are you now? Have you gotten over it? But maybe I shouldn't bother you with the innermost feelings of a lumberjack. Wouldn't be a bother at all. Robert and Meredith, sorry to break up your conversation, but we're closing up early tonight. Gotta set up some stuff for the open mic night, and I can't use any peeping eyes. Oh, okay, Maureen. Peeping no eyes? Problem. Let me get the check for you, so I can leave you two to your lovely evening. Can you put it on my tab, Maureen? Anything for you, darling. Chet, Chet voted to go back, Denver. Yeah, but we still have till Monday to decide. So that's not set in stone. Man, she's annoying. She sure is annoying, isn't she? <laughs> All right, thanks, Robert. Uh, should I offer to pay? I feel like I should offer to pay for half, right? Since it didn't really go uh, Do you mind his if way. I pay? Or at least for half of it? Meredith, after all your help. This is the least I can do. Well, at least he's so, so nice to yes, me. Yes, I mind. Yeah. Now let's get going before Maureen gets her broom out. Oh, he's still paid. What a gentleman. Meredith, thanks again for your help. I'm not sure what would have happened if you hadn't come here for your mail delivery vacation. You're welcome, Robert. I was happy to help out. Oh, it's nothing. I might actually extend my stay here. See, I could be... Let's be, like, super indecisive. I might actually extend my stay here. <laughs> Are you serious? That would be nice. Nice. Yeah. Uh, okay. All right. Wagon West. Good night, Meredith. Oh, I should get a hug. Should I get a hug off him? Robert's such a nice guy. He's so nice. He's so nice, and I'm playing with his feelings, guys. I feel like I'm touring with his heart string. Yeah, he's nervous. He is nervous. You too, Robert. But Kiss him already. Not leaving without a hug. Oh, I got a hug out of him. All right, we got a hug out of them, guys. <laughs> I agree, Cody. All right, it is now Sunday morning, chat. Sunday morning. You're a jerk. I am, yeah. I'm being a jerk, guys. I'm leading them on. Oh, at least we got a hug out of them. Still on. What a late stream. I know. This game never ends, chat. This game literally never ends. I can never have predicted delivering mail for two weeks would be like this. I met so many new people. Some of them were really nice. Clack, 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 clack. Some of them a little less so, but all of them interesting in their own way. Did AI write this? My temporary mail job ex officially ends tomorrow. Regardless of the actual experience, a change of scenery is always has its upsides. I have to leave, says Jamoy. No, Jamoy! That probably also holds out for tonight's open mic at Moe's Diner. I feel like this would be a big event, chat. Can you type that fast? I can type fast, guys. You guys want to see how fast I can type? <laughs> I, can't, I can't. I can't type that fast. All right. I think my Guam is like <laughs> anyway, 60 or 70. I love this town. You know I do. Here we so, go. I'm dedicating my last jokes to specific people here tonight. Great. The first one's for Maureen. A guy walks into a bar, and dozens of slabs of meat are hanging from the ceiling. So he asks the bartender, what's up with the hanging meat up there, man? So the bartender says, ah, you're new here. Well, we like to play a game here. If you can jump up and slap a steak, the house will pay for your drinks all John. night. However, if you miss... You have to pay everyone else's bar tab. So, want to give it a go? Nah, says the man. <laughs> Those stakes are too high. <laughs> this one's for our own newcomer, Meredith Weiss. So, a woman's driving down the freeway. 
and all of a sudden, she hears a local news bulletin warning drivers on the very freeway she's on. They're saying, please be advised of this very dangerous situation of a car going the wrong way. So the woman says to herself, one car? <laughs> Why, there's dozens! Well, folks, wasn't that special? Now, let me know if any of you have any jokes about Jack, you hear? It's an open mic, after all. Well, it was better than Especially her talking. It's time for a little break right now. So, come on up to the bar for she some needs of to our take a stress fee, Jack. concessions. Why are people we'll not laughing? Why are people like laughing? I don't know, fair Mildred, amount. Mildred, how Small are town? you? And how are the cats? <laughs> Fine, on both counts, dear. Thank you for asking. Yes! So, we took care of the cats. Do you like the hair? Uh, what should I tell her? What should I tell her? <laughs> it doesn't look all that different. Should I be a jerk to Granny one last time, chat? Jerk to Granny one last time. I think we should. Once. <laughs> to be completely honest, it doesn't look all that different. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, it feels like a waste anyway. So I can only stay for a few moments. Aw, I heard her feelings. What's the rush? Really? What's the rush? You see, my son decided to drop by. On Justice for Granny? Yeah. And he's staying the whole weekend. I know. I feel bad now. Why was I a jerk? Oh, that's wonderful news. That's quite a, uh, the imposition. It sure beats getting the teddy bear in the mail. <laughs> that's wonderful news. Oh, that's I'll be nicer the rest news. of the time, I promise. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, anyway, take care, dear. Now, where did you park get with the Granny's car? Son? Captain yes, Crunch? it's me, Matt Kearney, in a neck brace. Real funny, huh? He got, he's in a neck brace now. Why? Uh, I must admit it's a little funny. I'm gonna be a jerk to this guy. I must admit Definitely. It. It's at least a little funny. What happened? Well, I was about to send the final boss to the afterlife, but then the computer crashed. I kicked my foot out in anger and fell from my chair, and now I'm here looking like a loser. <laughs> Dan, oh my god. Oh, poor you. You'll be okay. Oh, poor <laughs> you. I hope you'll be okay again soon. I hope so. I can't even use my computer right now. Oh, poor fella. Guess who? Jack Burton? Ah, <laughs> oh, now I'm going to be a disappointment. There she is! It's just me. Oh, it's her! Oh, that's a real bummer. Even better. I never thought I would have guessed. Well, Dahl, you're a little late. What do I say, chat? What do I say? What do I say? Angie's here. Angie's here, chat. Woo! What do I say to Angie, guys? Help me out. Maddie James says, giggle, giggle. What do I say to Angie? Three. Well, duh, you're a little late. Uh, kiss her. <laughs> I will. Uh, scissor time. No, no, no. One? No, 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 no. Uh, it's a real bummer. I don't even know what she asked, guys. I don't even know what she asked. <laughs> uh, two. All right, let's say two. Even better. Though I never would have guessed. So, what have I missed? Not much. Jack just did some comedy. While Matt Kearney's condition is worth a mention. Oh, it's great so far. Uh, we won't mention either of those things. Oh, it's great so far. But the final act is supposed to be the real showstopper. At least, that's what Maureen tells me. Really? Well, then, I guess I arrived just in time. So, how have you been? Busy packing, I guess. Thanks for the note. It was very sweet. I expected to hear for more, more than just a note. Oh, we could say more than just a note, guys. Oh, we could be, we could be... A little jerky. Yes, we could. But I don't want to be jerky. I'm going to go for number two. Number two is the safe answer, chat. Three. Three. I'm not doing three. Thanks for the note. It was very sweet. Hit it with a K. I meant every <laughs> word, babe. So, have you... Hey, Meredith. Hey, Angie. Sorry to pop in like this, but I just wanted to inform you I fixed everything on the RV. She's got a new radio. I replaced some wiring, adjusted windshield wiper speed... The hermit shell is ready to go. Nice. Our <laughs> RV is ready to go, chat. That's great, Lori. Thanks. I'm sure she's just like new. Well, I wouldn't say that. Get lost, Lori. <laughs> you'll see. Gotta go later. Heck an yeah. RV? She did call you me never babe. told me you had an RV. Well, it's kind of a recent development. You know Mickey and June? The hippie couple? Sure do. They told me it was mine if I wanted it. Goes 37,000 cash. Then Lori gave it a checkup. I forgot and about the RV too, I Tracy. I am the proud owner of the Hermit Shell. Wow, good for you. I'd love I a free know, RV. I know, Marcus. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. 
Oh, should I give her the RV? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. We can give her the RV. Yeah, I think we should give her the RV. What do you guys think? Give it to her? Do we give her the RV? I think we should definitely give her the RV, chat. That would be points. Mike Fusa is like, no. <laughs> no. Uh, two, 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 two. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. We're going to give her the RV. Come to think of it, you might have more of a use for it than I do. I... I'd love an RV. I mean, that'd be perfect. But I, I don't know if I can accept it. I mean, June and Mickey must have entrusted you with it for a reason. Are you sure you don't want to keep it? I can, t I can take it back. <laughs> Should I take it back? Oh, that'd be a son of a stink move. No, no, no. I'm not going to do that, though. It's hers. You're right, actually. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm keeping it. Cool. So where are you going to take it? Oh, I hit the wrong one! Oh, I hit the wrong one! <laughs> no! No! Can I reload the save? Load the save? Oh, I messed up big time. Alright, I just all that Ford. Oh man, I hope you don't have to do all of that again. Why did I all that Ford? I panic all that Ford. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I panicked. That's loud. Why'd I do that? Bring back the chicken. <laughs> Bring back the chicken. Why'd I do that? Uh, all right. Uh, continue. Oh, don't tell me we have to sit up, sit through that stand up again, please. Please don't tell me we have to sit up, uh, sit through the stand up again, chat. What if I have to do the whole day over again? Oh man, I'll be so mad. <laughs> I'll be so mad. Doesn't have auto save. Uh oh. What do you mean it doesn't have auto save? I didn't save it. Oh, 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 thank God, thank God, oh man, I almost freaked out, okay, yeah, all right, we're good, oh my God, chat, oh my God, oh my God, no, five hours out, no, 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 we're good, we're good. It, we're, we only got, had to go back to the previous day. It's the beginning of the previous day. Oh, thank goodness, chat. We're good. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. I, I freaked out. You got to get turned down by Robert again. Oh, are you serious? Son of a stink. <laughs> Should I force an ad? Could have been worse. That could have been way worse. I thought it would start us on Sunday. I thought it would start us on Sunday, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, chat. I really wanted to give her that RV. It's for an ad. Joe Wolf, thank you for the gifted buddy. We got Joe Wolf coming in with the one gifted to Gary Snotty. That is awesome. Thank you, Gary Snotty, for the gifted there, buddy. Might have been fibbing. Oh, my goodness, chat. It's time. Have white wine and pancakes. Yeah, let's have wine and pancakes this time. Zero. Yeah, you're right, buddy. Then I have dinner with Robert again now. Let's be there. Dang it. Thank you, chat. So sorry about this. I am so sorry. I just, uh, I freaked out there. I, I, I made the wrong decision, and I didn't want to make that decision. I wanted Angie to have the RV. She's got to have the RV, guys. Greedy Ryan, not giving her the RV. I want her to have the RV. I, I hit the wrong thing, Chad. What if I hit the wrong thing again? <laughs> Thank you very much, Joe Wolf, for that one gifted sub, man. And we got Joe Wolf coming in with a 99, a 199 Super Chat as well. So one gifted in $2 for Angie. All right, we'll give it to Angie there, buddy. Yes, we will, my friend. I am so sorry, man. Alright, we can speed through it though. Yeah, you're right. We can speed through it. We'll get through it quickly. We'll get through it quickly, guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, let's get those emergency pancakes down. And so ends a week full of turmoil. Brian. Sorry, buddy. Okay, you can say that again. You can say that again. Speed through it, chat. Only the Angels hadn't lost to the White Sox. That would have made it perfect. Yeah, that, that, yeah, Ryan, right. we will, buddy. How much would you have won? I know that most of you are, buddy. dollars and 34 cents. It'd have been a nice payday, huh? They're playing each other again tonight. Should I change the bet? You can't skip the dialogue. Nope. Hold the line. Okay. Let's see what happens. Maybe you're my lucky charm. Have a great weekend, Meredith. Oh, wait. This was your last day. I 
totally forgot to tell you, but they still haven't found someone else for the job. Google the game? So <laughs> Google I guess the game? you can have it if you want. Uh wait, did we say no or yes? I can't remember. What did what did we say, Chad? I can't even remember. Did we say no or yes? I think we said no, right? Yeah, Thanks, we said no. Frank, That's but right. No. Sports for the day. Are you sure? It's a great job. <laughs> You I know what? what we said. Think about it. And yeah, we said Monday yeah. morning when you return your stuff. You're gonna run now. The Red Sox are playing the Yankees. No, but it doesn't matter. That's true. Yeah, you're right. We have till Monday to decide anyway. That's right, guys. Uh, she said no. Yes. Okay. So we're gonna go to the Weiss residence. Now we're gonna talk to the mom. I didn't realize how much we, stuff we actually did. It seemed like it seemed like it wasn't that much, guys. Joe Wolf, thank you for that Hello? 199 super chat. Hi, Meredith. It's your dad again. Parents now. Your yeah. Time in the mail delivery business. Oh, hi, Dad. Well... Jared, thank you for the 99 cent hot dog super sticker also, buddy. Appreciate the hot dog, my friend. Thank you, buddy. Thank you very, I very much. I actually really loved it. Discount Glizzy. Awesome. Thank you. Maybe you should just That's awesome, man. It. Worked out well for me. Actually, it seems like they haven't filled the vacancy Yeah, Mom yet. wants us to sell out. That's right, Nick. Well, you know what I'd do. Oh, hold on, Meredith. Let me guess. Mom wants to talk to me? Hi, Meredith. Sorry to butt in, but you're thinking about staying in Providence Oaks? Hi, Mom. Well, yeah, why not? I like it here. Well, P.O. is wonderful, of course. I know. Doesn't but P.O. Do mean something bad? Out? Do you want to leave all that behind? Yeah, Philip. Philip, we're still live there, buddy. We're, we're at the end of the uh, end of the um, game pretty much right now so if you don't want to see the ending and you want to watch the replay there buddy you might want to dip out for that buddy but yes we are still going to be going for at least another half hour because i'm probably going to screw it up all over again chat <laughs> thank you so much there jordan carl for the five dollar super chat buddy i appreciate that thank you so much yeah. you're awesome I guess you're putting it in overtime to. today we are it's jordan we are doing overtime i want to finish the game though we probably could have got two streams yeah. out of this Any actually we definitely could have got two more streams out of this Parole officer. No, it's not parole officer. Oh, yeah, it does mean parole officer, too. Uh, peed off. <laughs> Post office, peed off, and parole officer. Okay, that's not it. It's just easy going here. Yes, well, the interesting developments. There Thank are you, Jordan. some interesting developments, yes. Oh, there are. But are they <laughs> I don't mean to go away. I mean, you know, if you if you don't want to see the ending, if you don't want to be spoiled. Uh, he's definitely welcome here, obviously, but if he doesn't want to know the ending, I have a suspicion you know, but you're, of course, welcome here. Meredith, <laughs> I just wanted to say, you need to clean the lint filter on the oh, dryer. Oh, welcome back, Lindsay. While. You never I know, that, right? You burn the house down. <laughs> Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Okay, no problem, Dad. I'll make sure I do that. You care more about... Okay, blah, 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 no blah, blah. No problem, blah, blah, Dad. Blah, 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 blah. I'll make sure to do that. I know, Maddie, and now Great. I feel like Thanks. a jerk. Thanks for I calling me up. I suddenly worry about things like that in the middle of the night. And it's not about the dryer, of course. I want you to be safe. And I'm sure you'll be okay. I'll be fine. Don't lose sleep over me. Okay, Em. Take care. I gotta go. We're running out of coins again. Bye! All right. We got out of that painful conversation. Now we gotta go on the date with Robert. Let's get pancakes and wine this time. We're gonna get pancakes and wine, guys. I've taken three naps and still alive. What a guy, Eric. We're having dinner here. There aren't a lot of other restaurants around, and I'm pretty sure their food isn't better than most. Brian Cameron, thank you for the 99 cent Canadian sweaty emoji sticker. I love it. I love the sweaty emoji sticker, guys. You know what? Let's do a completely different conversation I went to the with a few uh, days ago. Astoria has a few nice with restaurants. Robert. Oh, okay. I guess that <laughs> makes me a cheapskate. Good evening, you two beautiful people. Ready to order? Ladies first. Hi, I think Maureen. I was just a jerk to him. Uh, pancakes, I need pancakes. Mm. Oh, pancakes. <laughs> I need pancakes. Excellent choice, Meredith. And what would you like to wash it down with? Hmm. I think I'll have a... Pancakes and wine. Glass of wine. Gotcha. Robert? <laughs> the usual for me, Maureen. All right, Robert. T-bone steak and a beer. Doesn't get we got, more we got the beer and steak that. last time, Jack. Be right back, folks. I just want to see if Ashley, it changes anything. it's pancake time! And get the steaks out. Maureen's the best. Did you hear about the open mic night she's organizing? Yeah. Are you going? I wish I could go. Especially since I heard that Jack's gonna do a thing. Jack? What's he gonna do? Announce the weather for next week? Believe it or not, I know, he's a Ringo. very good ballet dancer. 
You're right. And you're his It's like the same one. He told us about it. He told us about it yesterday. Would have loved to have heckled him. Oh, well. This is a good week anyhow. We got to sit through those jokes again, guys. Because uh, you're sitting here with me. It must be nice. Yeah, let's because you're sitting here with again. me. <laughs> All righty. Here are your beverages, folks. I'm afraid the food might take a little longer. As a certain kitchen helper thought the freezer was a good place for storing steaks. Yeah, don't go to well, open mic night, Sarah really one of those microwave ovens to defrost them. You seem a little stressed. Is it the upcoming open mic? Why should I be stressed about that? It's going to be lovely. And you better be there, Robert Harris. <laughs> Maureen, I'm sorry, but I'm afraid I won't be able to make it. I did not just hear you say that, young man. Oh, by the way, Meredith. I need to steal him for two minutes. He needs to check on some wiring. I do, Manny. Excuse me, Meredith. This is Maureen's jurisdiction. Have to obey the law. I know, Jimmy. We have gone way too long mm, today there, buddy. That tasted so good. Thanks, Maureen, for the fantastic blueberry pie. You're welcome. It's my way of making up for stealing you away from Meredith. Ooh, I swear. She can give quite the stink eye if she wants, can't you, hon? Oh, boy. The world would be boring without her. Speaking of, are you going to miss your daily delivery round? Have to obey the law. Uh, looking forward to going back to the big city. Not really. I'm looking forward to going back to the big city. Ah, the big city. That's not for me. Oh, thank you, Jimmy. Uh, do you think you'll always live here? Do you think you'll always live we here? We had this conversation for sure, to but I like it here. I needed to change towns after my divorce. Everything and everyone reminded me of her. Chad, are you guys mad that one misclick has cost us 15 minutes of our lives, guys? I'm a little bit upset that. about it. Deja vu, yeah. But maybe <laughs> I shouldn't bother you with the innermost feelings of a lumberjack. Wouldn't be a bother at all. Yes, you're divorced. Robert and Meredith, sorry to break up your conversation, but we're closing up early tonight. Got to set up some stuff for the open Kinda, mic night, yeah. and we I can't PO'd. use any PO'd. Deja vu. Oh, okay, right. No problem. Let me get the check. Yeah, what do I, what so I, I make the, you two What if, to what your if I click evening? it again? Can you put it on my tab, Maureen? <laughs> Anything <laughs> for you, click, darling? What if I click it again? Uh, thanks, Robert. Uh, yeah, I'll Do you mind pay. if I pay? Or at least for half of it? Meredith, after all your help, this is the least I can do. <laughs> I so, yes, I my mind. Now let's get going. You can't before save it right now. This is all like the ending cutscene, I think. It won't Meredith, really thanks again for your help. I'm not sure what would have happened if you hadn't come here for your mail delivery. Oh, here it comes. I might actually extend my stay here. Please don't, Are you say yeah, I won't. I won't. I would, I would never nice. do that. At least on purpose. Nice. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, we got a hug. All right. All right, let's hug. Wait, Good night, Meredith. You too, Robert. But you're not leaving without Public a hug. Shaming. Public shaming. Public shaming. Don't shame me, Chad. Don't shame me. I already was publicly shamed today. Remember the picture? Who remembers the picture from earlier? <laughs> Grab his butt. <laughs> I'm not grabbing his butt. All right, here we go. It is now morning time somehow. What? What is this? Oh, yeah, we got to sit through this, too. That's right. Uh, hug it out. If you do it again, you should have to take your hat off for at least two minutes. I'm not taking it off for two minutes. All right, here's what I'm going to do, Chad. I'm going to grab a granola bar because I am starving. I need something to give me energy for the rest of this stream. So uh, while you're sitting here through this again, I'm going to grab a, uh, a granola bar. I'm so sorry. I'll be right back. Oh, yeah, I'm good. Getting hungry. I'm getting hangry. I'm not hangry. No, but I know after this stream. Sorry, I'm talking my mouth full. My <laughs> anyway, I love this town. You know I do. So I'm dedicating my last jokes to specific people here tonight. The first one's for Maureen. A guy walks into a bar and dozens <laughs> of slabs of meat are hanging from the ceiling. So he asks the bartender, what's up with the hanging meat up there, man? So the bartender says, ah, oh, you're new here. Well, we like to play a game here. If you can jump up and slap a steak, the house will pay nice for your man. drinks all night. However, if you miss, you have to pay everyone else's bar tab. So, wanna give it a go? Nah, says the man. <laughs> Those stakes are too high. <laughs> this one's for our own newcomer, Meredith Weiss. 
sudden. A woman's driving down the freeway, but all of a sudden, she hears a local news bulletin warning drivers on the very freeway she's on. They're saying, please be advised of this very dangerous situation of a car going the wrong way. So the woman says to herself, It's actually time for a little break right now. So come on up to the bar for some of our finest concessions. We'll continue shortly. Mildred, how are you? Chad, whose jokes were better? <laughs> Thanks I for setting that off. You're welcome, Tobias. <laughs> Thank you for asking. So, do you like the hair? <laughs> oh my god. Um, I'm gonna tell her I like the hair this time because I feel bad about being a jerk to Granny last time, guys. So I'll say it looks fine, guys. Love it. That hairdresser <laughs> One, did a no. great job. Thank you, dear. Pity it's quite the waste of time. Your jokes are better. Well, thank you, money, Maddie. Seeing as how I can't <laughs> sleep for long. No, my jokes are way worse. Dude is strange. Uh, dude on stage has better jokes. Really, Denver. Oh, my goodness. I think Granny's a cat lady. She is definitely a cat lady, yeah. She has like a thousand cats. We babysitted her cats, remember? Uh, really? What's the really? rush? What's the rush? You see, my son decided to drop by. Unannounced. Your own moderator. And he I know my own moderator weekend. said that. Oh, that's wonderful news. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, anyway, take care, dear. Now, where did he park the car? Yes, it's me, Matt Carey. All right. Internet Here we go. No We're getting huh? close. Chicken tells better jokes than all of you. That's true. I must admit it. It's at least Better a not guff funny. it up this time. What, what happened? What if I screw it up well, this time, to Jordan? I the final boss, the afterlife. <laughs> I don't think so, the computer crashed. I kicked my foot out in anger and fell from my chair. And now I'm here looking like a loser. Oh, Joe, thank you for the $2 super chat, buddy. I'm so sorry. Yeah, there was talking going on. I, I did miss that. Thank you, Joe, for the $2 super chat, buddy. I appreciate that. It says for the chair. I All right. Now I got to tape $2 to the chair. I gotta tape a hundred dollars to the chicken, and now I gotta tape two dollars to the chair. <laughs> oh my god! Thank you, Joe. Appreciate you, buddy. I'm sure you'll beat the game one day. Don't give up on the dream. Charge my phone three times for the stream, like Jordan. This, but I'm going to work out a strategy in the meantime. Guess who? Jack Burton. <laughs> there she is. Ah, oh, now I'm going to be a disappointment. It's just me. Um, even better, I never thought I would guess. Even better, though I never would guess. But girls here, chat. So, what have I missed? She's embarrassed. Okay, so if you guys know, we we, we did we screwed this up last time, which is why I had to do this uh, again. Don't misclick this time. All right. Um, all right, so great so far. Oh, it's great so Three, far. Three, yeah. Thank you, Marco. But the final act is supposed to be the real showstopper. At least that's what Maureen tells me. Don't screw it up this time. All right, we'll see. Well, then I guess I arrived just in time. Focus, oh, right? All right, let's focus. Um, thanks for the note. It was very sweet. Yes. Thanks for the note. It was very sweet. I meant every word, babe. So, have you... Hey, Meredith. Hey, Angie. Sorry to pop in like this. Lori, get I out. Just wanted to inform get out of here, Lori. Everything She's on screwing the it all up. Is this She's a Hallmark a game? It is now, Mac Morrison. Yes, wiring, it is, buddy. Adjusted windshield wiper speed. The Hermit Shell is ready to go. <laughs> That's great, she said, Lori. said, babe, yeah. Thanks. No saving? No, there's I'm no sure saving. You can't even like pause you. it right now. Well, I wouldn't say that, but you'll see. Gotta go later. An RV? You never told me you had an RV. Well, Son of it's a stink, Lori. A development. She babe you. you know she did babe me. The hippie couple? Sure do. They told me it was mine if I wanted it. And I did. Then Lori gave it a checkup. And now I am the proud owner of the Hermit Shell. Wow. Good for you. I'd love a free RV. All right. All right. We're going to give her the RV. This is where I screwed it up last time, Ringo. <laughs> oh, man. I... I'd love an RV. I mean, that'd be perfect. But uh, I, I don't know if I can accept it. I mean, June and Mickey <laughs> must have entrusted you with it for a reason. <laughs> Stop it, Are Joe. you sure you don't want to keep it? All right. So now I say, yeah, it's my... Wait, which one do I do? Uh-oh. Wait. This is the one I misclicked. 
Keep it, right? Take it back. <laughs> All right, yeah, keep it. <laughs> Dude, dang it. This is why we had to sit through 20 minutes of the same thing. Number two. All right. <laughs> Nah, All right. I'm good. I did it right this it's time. All yours. I did it right this time. Wow. I don't know what to say. <laughs> say and that's you'll... a first for me. A thank you would be a nice start, or I just like seeing you happy. Oh, I just like seeing you happy, or a thank you would be a nice start. Oh, 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 oh. snippy or non snippy chat, too. Yeah, we got to go, too. Yeah, we got to go, too, for sure. Two. Don't mention it. I just like seeing you happy. Do, 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 do. And vice versa, babe. Really. Oh, another babe. Come with me. I mean it. Leave this sad old town behind and go wherever we want to go. Free spirits the way Mickey and June intended. Here are our choices. Hmm, I have grown quite fond of you, you know. Well, you are a good kisser, or you know I'd rather be by myself for a while. <laughs> Let's go with number two. One or two. I think we should go with number two, chat. Number two. Number one's kind of like number two. Oh, yeah. All right. All in. Well, you are a good kisser. Hmm. There's plenty more where that came from. Oh! But at some point, you've got to give me a definite answer. You get that, right? Look alive, folks. It's time for the Morning, final act. shut up. It's a doozy. <laughs> <Woo>. <laughs> Saved by the bell, babe. I got stuff to do anyway. Uh, Angie, wait. Okay, I'll let you know. Fine, leave. <laughs> Should I give her the fine? Oh, my God. A fine is like a K. Oh, my goodness, chat. I think I should do Angie, wait. I think, I think we're, I think we're, yeah, I think we should go uh, with one. Yeah, let's go with one here, chat. Yeah, we got to go with one, guys. Oh, my goodness. Angie, wait. Dear people, none other than our own Kay Evans oh, will dang. perform next. Now she has been this writing lady. songs since <laughs> she was a little girl. And I cannot say how thrilled I am to host her, now. her I know. first performance. No, it's just no DJP. To come. I am so we got rid of that. I think in January. Honey. Please put your hands or together for December. Kay, everyone. Uh oh. Oh yeah, I got music turned off. That's right. So it's just weird. Probably for the best, to be honest. <laughs> this is so awkward. <laughs> this is so weird. Definitely for the best. Yeah. <laughs> Look at them all swaying back and forth. Oh my god. Yes, keep her muted. It's probably like super good though. Play Starry Eyed. Alright, we'll play Starry Eyed instead. Turn it on, play your own music. Alright. They're playing Starry Eyed chat and they love it. Why well, didn't we get to sing it that much? Sing along. This does not happen a lot. But you have left me speechless. That was K, people. Another round of applause. Let's get a round of applause for K, guys. They didn't seem to be feeling it. I know. Well, it's a good thing I didn't leave when Reynolds started his nonsense. This kid can sing. I guess it was oh, good. Hi, Mr. Mackey. Uh, yeah, she's awesome. Yeah, she's <laughs> awesome. Yeah, it's good to see someone flourish. But I'd rather be home right now. Isn't it fun to step out every once in a while? Round of a clap. Smoking a pipe and reading a proper book is the only acceptable way to spend a Sunday evening in September. Bert, thank you so much for coming. I know you'd rather be somewhere else right now. That's okay, kid. I don't regret it one bit. You did great. But ladies, if you'll excuse me, I'm out of here. Good night, Bert. Thanks again. And now for granny. an announcement. He's a crazy I'm serious. That man is lame. Don't he is. Now. I don't now, like him. 
You all know that Kay has been working here at the diner for quite a while now. In fact, she was my pants. anchor after Stan left us. And I think what the time has come to pants? formally announce right Try here older. That's that not me. I will put older. your name above the door of this place, honey, where <laughs> God, it too, belongs. Honey. Kay's place. Mo Kay's. We'll we haven't Brian. settled on a name yet, but there you go. Another round of applause. And have some drinks with us. She got them hammer pants. Oh, those are hammer pants. That was amazing. Um, Kay's place, huh? Congra I don't even know what that means. So we'll just ask her how it How'd felt it to feel be up there. To be those up are there. parachute pants. Yeah, they it are. It was so great to be performing again. It felt amazing. I'm all over the place right now. It was such a rush. I will definitely be doing that again. If they let me, of course. That was amazing. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Em. It felt amazing. I had some hammer pants back so in the 80s. Really, Em? You know, like you better post some pictures that. there, buddy. So glad it went well. <laughs> um, okay, so I have to go. Yeah, I don't really want to talk I to her. I have to so. hand it to you. You <laughs> to kill were Starry great. Eye. She did kill I have to Starry go Eye. Bit, but go get your girl. That's what I'm doing, is, Captain. Yeah? yeah? You're not leaving already, are you? The fun's just starting. Yeah, I'm leaving. Oh, wait. Of course. Big day tomorrow, right? Oh. You know what you're going to do? Honestly? Well, wait. I'm not good at this stuff, so I just want to say it was good to have you back these past weeks, and really good. You just do what you feel you have to Is there to a scene do. we missed? No, I'm I don't think so, Matt. Connected. The, the song. We didn't hear a song, but, touch, I mean, who cares, right? the outcome, yeah? I'll do my best. And remember, time marches, marches on. on. <laughs> See you, Kate. Thanks. All right. So for everything. keep in mind that we still have a decision to make on Monday, guys. I care. I, I do care, too. My but lovely people. We missed it. The time has come copyright. for the open mic part of the evening to end. Ashley was going to do a ventriloquist bit next. Oh, we could have seen ventriloquist. <laughs> heard his hand back in his yet. cabin. Let me thank you again for joining us. And there's plenty of food and drink to go around. It's the party that never ends. Aw, oh, thank you, Jordan. Oh, we gotta talk to her. Why do we gotta talk to her? She's a man. I sure do hope they're keeping things proper in there while I'm taking a breather. So, you had fun? Should I say it was okay? <laughs> I feel like I should say three. Yeah, it was okay. Uh, I loved it, Jack was great. It was great, Kay is amazing. Maybe we'll say K is amazing. Let's go, let's go with K was amazing, guys. <laughs> nah. three and skip. It was okay. You sound a bit pensive, darling. Um, I think I'm gonna go hit the hay. <laughs> I had a great evening. Thanks, Maureen. I think I'm gonna go hit the hay. Early start. Something on your mind, hon? No, I'm fine, honestly. I just wanna get out of this conversation. Big day though. tomorrow is all. How did things end up with Kay? She keeps, she keeps you hitting. You tell me to mind my own, of course. It's just, but that girl is like a daughter to me. We talked, yeah. Uh, I think we're different people now. What do I say, chat? We really connected. Um, I feel like we did really connect, though. Remember, remember the whole thing up on the thing. You guys remember rose petals, yeah? We really reconnected, <laughs> and I'm happy we did. We, we, we reconnected. <laughs> Listen, you're two grown women. And One, yes, I agree. The choice you two ended up on, I can only respect that. Speaking of choices, you've got a big day in the morning, don't you? Know what you're gonna do yet? Stick around, move back. Um, I think I have a feeling. Absolutely not a speck of doubts. Um, yeah, I don't know what to do, Chad. What do we do, guys? What do we do? Uh, circle. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, what do we do here? Why does she care? I don't know why she cares. Uh, absolutely not. Let's see. Uh, one. Yeah, we'll just say Honestly, one. Honestly, no. No clue at stay. all. Stay. I don't want to stay. Remember, like we got. feeling a lot of pressure. We're going to go away with. We're going to go away with that girl. No. I just wish things were a bit more clear. Nosy. She <sighs> won't shut up. You know what I've found? Screw clarity. You don't need clarity to make choices. This is true. 
doesn't sound very logical to me. I swear. People these days seem to think that because they can calculate and approximate, they can clear up the secret to existence. I know, like, Deborah. It's a game you can it's a win risk or I'm lose. Willing, willing to take, Pretending though. you know exactly where future you wants to end up and plotting that out for the rest of your life? <sighs> I'd almost say that's arrogant. Not to mention boring. The beauty is in not knowing, if you ask me. Did you have a did you have a bit too much wine? You have a bit too much vino, Mo. Sue me. Wanna know my advice? <laughs> you take that one Sue me. step and see where it leads you. She's the you worst can never character. Truly predict the one that comes after. And whatever path you take will come What's with What's up, Yolanda? Down. Yes, there we will are. Always be You're joy. still alive somehow. And there will always be you suplexer. <laughs> I would love but to suplex that's her. That's something to be thankful for. That's what makes Chad, life what are the things you would yours, like to do with Maureen? It? More than talk to her. What are things you would like to do to Maureen? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep asking. You keep talking in I'm circles. I'm still not sure I know what to do, but I'll try. You'll be all right. Slap. Huh? You just keep checking what feels <laughs> right, and if not, she'd be a just bartender. Take that she should. Yeah. Step, you hear? Throw in the lake. We should throw in the lake. Yeah. Maureen. We did. We did things to that baby yesterday for less than this. Thanks for Thanks. everything. I will not miss for her. For everything. I will not miss her. I best get back inside. You take care now, Meredith Wise. Take care, Maureen. I, I don't know why they tried to set up this whole thing with her. Like, it was obvious that she was a very hateable character, right, chat? Like, she was not a good character. She was supposed to be kind of annoying, but then they set up good this whole morning, thing. Good morning, Meredith. All right, you here we go. You believe the weekend the good, I had. Here's the good character. Saturday, I placed a bet on the Angels, just like you said, and won. But they played again yesterday, <laughs> and I let it ride, the and then card. they lost. They're playing again tonight. Gear card! No, I don't know oh what to do anymore. Well, Frank, the pattern is obvious. Uh, you're a gambling addict beyond salvation. So the Angels will win this time. Betting against the pattern pays off White Sox. What do we tell them? One, two, or three here, chat. <laughs> One, two, or three. Take the Rangers. I think we should take the Rangers. You're right, too. <laughs> Let's keep them going. So the Angels will win this time. Okay, Meredith. Thanks. I'll go <laughs> he with just that. Keeps betting. Speaking of gambling, I bet you're taking the job. And that's not just because you're wearing your coat. I love the coat, Frank. But no, I'm taking it off and we'll leave town. Here we go, chat. Here we go. This is it. This is it. Do we quit now? Or do we stay in this town? I'm saying one. I'm saying one. Keep lying to him. This is Betty. We will. Here we go. Here we go. Jordan says two. Ringo says two. Tyler says one. I'm thinking one here, chat. Now down to the nitty gritty. It is down to the nitty gritty now, chat. Poll. I don't want to poll it, Logan. No. Quit already. <laughs> Quit already. All right. I'm leaving this job. Why are you guys are saying two, though? I do want to stay. See, I am torn. I am torn. But... The big money job is out of the town, and the girl wants to leave too. Those are my two reasons, guys. But no. I'm so I think we're off. gonna stick with it. I'm leaving Providence Oaks again. Oh, that's not what I was hoping to hear, Meredith. Hit the wrong I, one. I understand. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Uh, first I'm gonna thank Justin Vanderford for the five gifted subs. Let's get some Justins in the chat. Justin Vanderford dropped five gifted memberships. And that was five minutes ago. I am so sorry I didn't see that right away, Mr. Justin. Thank you, Justin Vanderford. Let's get some Justin to the chat. Justin, thank you for the five gifted memberships there, buddy. Appreciate that so much. We got Eddie Spaghetti with the 11 months as well. Thank you, buddy. Those gifts went out to Rifted Ives, uh, Anthony, James Miller, John M., and Matt Pallet. Thank you so much for those gifts, Justin. Appreciate that, buddy. And Eddie with the 11 months says, where do crows go for entertainment? To the movies. Oh, the cows. I screwed up your joke. <laughs> I screwed up Eddie's 11-month joke. Eddie says, where do cows go for entertainment? I said that, that was crows. <laughs> Thank you very much, Eddie. Appreciate the 11 months, man. You're awesome there, buddy. Thank you, sir. Uh, Michael Rodriguez is dropping over there. So, sorry. All right, let's finish this game, chat. Back to my home, back to my job, big, back to my life in the big city. I'm going on a road trip to... Well, actually, I'm, uh... Jesus! Ben, so you're staying in the delivery business? No, wait, that's an RV. Yep, 
I'm getting on it, and I'm not sure where I'll stop. Smooth reading. Going so, on a road trip! I guess this is goodbye. I'm gonna miss you, Frank. Thanks for everything. Goodbye, Frank. Thanks for the opportunity. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm, I'm gonna miss, miss you, Frank. Frank. Rip speaker, sorry, chat. Try to stay out of trouble, sorry. okay? It was so Don't loud. worry, Meredith. I'll be fine. Thanks for everything. Take care and drive safe. And the V-Belt is not in great shape, but it should last you another month What's or two. What's a V-Belt? Road the trip Hermit arrives. shell in all of her glory. Do you like her? Meredith and I named her. She's pretty amazing, Lori. Cute name, too. <laughs> Thanks for doing this for me. You're very welcome. Have fun on the road, Miss W. Thank you, Lori. Will you be back? Dude, this is the perfect ending. Van Man Raya. This is the perfect Van Man Raya ending, guys. Uh, probably I made for friends here. Unlikely. Should we come back, chat? Do we want to come back? I think we should definitely come back, right, guys? <laughs> two, two. You guys are saying two? Unlikely? I mean, come on now. It wasn't that bad. Uh, part three, the bodies are found, says William. Oh, my God, William. Thank you again, Eddie. Thank you, Justin Vanderford. Appreciate the love, guys. Uh, one, one, one. I think we should. I think we should probably come back. Yeah, I would say one. Probably. Yeah. I made some friends. Yeah, we here. have friends here, guys. I want to see them again. Okay. Well, if you ever find yourself here again, come and say hi. Sure thing. I'd like that. See you around, Lori. Magnificent, isn't she? Yeah. What she if we break up now? She knows a lot though? about cars. For just got an ad, says Drew. No, you didn't. <laughs> you better not I be getting ads. RV. But sure, Lori's great too. So, you all packed? Sure am. The big stuff's in storage. But I've got the bare necessities. Clothes, toiletries, and a whole bunch of videotapes. She got that so toilet paper chat. where chat. are we going first? <laughs> yeah, about that. Hmm? One condition, I get to pick the first movie. I've grown quite fond of you, which is a weird thing to say. Or are you absolutely sure? Oh, man. Um, cast a couch. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God, chat. Videotapes. Doesn't she have shag carpeting? It does have shag carpeting. It does. Uh, you only come for the back of the pot. Exactly, Maddie. That's right. Watch the open door. Um, swear to God, I got an uh, old roof. An ad for old roofs. <laughs> what? All right. You guys are all over the map with this one. I think we should go with one. I think we should go with one. One is the safe answer. I think we should go with one, chat. I have one condition. I get to pick which movie we watch first. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> I'm in the driver's seat, by the way. I've heard about your driving. What? What have you heard? From who? People talk. She's heard about my driving? When advertising exec David Howard, parentheses Albert Brooks, is passed over for a promotion and subsequently fired, he decides to True change and his real. whole life. What? He convinces his wife, Linda, parentheses what do you mean Monica about Johnson, my driving? to sell wrong. their house and roam the country fighting. easy rider style in a Winnebago. Okay, forget this one. That's just not going to be relatable at all. <laughs> nope. We've got nothing in common with those guys. I have another flick where a bunch of academics set up a ghost hunting business in an old fire station. That should be way more accessible. Angie Eastman, hey, that's Ghostbusters. have you seen every single tape in Joe, here? Ghostbusters. calm down. Not calm all down, of Joe. them, but most. Come on. But I don't mind watching them again. In fact, I'd love to see them with someone who... Knows nothing about movies? I was going to put it a little nicer than that. Someone who has unspoilt virgin eyes. Virgin eyes? What are you, a poet now? <laughs> now I'm starting to All think right, we took well, the wrong decision. Lost in America will unspool before these virgin eyes soon enough. Wait a minute, did I give up the job too? It's about four kids from Oregon, right? Wait a minute. I think I might have given up the job Sorry too. Sorry for putting in, folks, but I've got a special treat for y'all. I just updated my playlist. This new song is from our very own Kay Evans. And it won't play. And that's the stream. <laughs> no money, right? Wait a minute. I was going to keep the job. Wait. Reload the same. <laughs> Reload the same. 
I guess we gotta play Starry Eye. No, we ain't gonna play Starry Eye chat. We'll play the ending music of the of the Raya stream. <laughs> my goodness. Oh my goodness. Now I'm broke. I have no job at all. And I'm stuck in an RV with this lady. <laughs> How did I get here? <laughs> Joke wrong. I, I thought we were gonna have to keep the job. Oh, dang it, chat. Now I live a life on the road in an RV, in a dirty, stinky RV. Six hours and 30 minutes wasted. <laughs> exactly. Wow, we did the six hour and 30 minute stream. That was a fun stream though. I, you know what, I'm still not mad about it. Cause this is how my life's gonna be. I'm gonna end up in a van someday. So at least I get to see a nice little preview of it, Chad. Um, but you got a hot gal. Yeah, we got the gal. We got the gal, that's true. We wouldn't have got the girl if we, um, if we would have not taken this ending. So at least we got the girl, guys. At least we got the girl. There's that, chat. What a stream, chat. You're a great decision maker. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, not too bad. I would have I would have tried to keep the job if I would have known, but you know, it is what it is, guys. What a game though. Oh my god. What a chat. Can we get a round of a hand for this game? This was an excellent, excellent game. I really, really enjoyed it, chat. Super, super fun. So and thank you guys for hanging out and watching, chat. I really, really appreciate all of you. I really do, chat. Good reason. My hat's off to you. Thank you. And thank you, moderators, for doing so much work today. Moderators who are like off the chain today. We had impersonators. We had a lot of inappropriate comments. Thank you, moderators, for everything. Uh, make a perfume. Make a GoFundMe. I've done it. Hey, hey, sounds good. See you, uh, Ryan and Chad. Thank you there, Chad. Enjoy the rest of your day, buddy. Agos as well. Robert Z, thank you so much. Denver dropping the hashtag fun. Uh, John Molina, Justin Vanderford, thank you so much for all the support today. We had 76 freaking new memberships today. That is unbelievable, Chad. That is truly truly remarkable so thank you for all the support the chicken made more money than me as well uh seeing coop's chat is coop live oh coop's not live yet guys oh I was, oh you know what i think coop goes live in like a minute so if you guys want to check out coop yeah we could like raid him i don't know if he'll be live by the time i go off but if he is raid coop chat <laughs> uh hashtag fun thank you so much jared enjoy the rest of your day time for bed i'm going to sleep <laughs> i need a nap after this one chat Thank you so much for watching today, though, guys. You guys are out of control. This was an absolutely hilarious stream. You guys are so funny today. So thank you for all being absolutely amazing. Replay will be up soon. Dennis Gersh, thank you for the $2 super chat. Says, remember to pay the chicken. I will. I'm going to tape that chicken. I'm going to tape his money. Love the saving way. <laughs> Love the saving. No, I'm good. I, I, I feel satisfied in this game. I do. I do feel satisfied in this game, Jack. I'm happy with the way it turned out. Hey, Vanola, thank you for the 50 Swedish kroner as well. Because I went up in a van as soon as I retired. That was so fun. Thanks, Ryan and Chad. Well, thank you there, Harry B. Appreciate you, my friend. Thank you for hanging out today. And uh, that sounds like a good future there, buddy. Yes, it does. Sorry the music was so loud. I didn't realize it. Um, thank you so much, Harry Vanola. You're awesome there, buddy. Jesus, 7 o'clock. It is 7 o'clock. It is time for bed, everybody. Go do the evening things that you normally do. I usually am sitting in this chair around this time still. So, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Uh, did we hit 600 likes today, uh, Ham? I don't believe we hit almost 600 likes today. Oh, my God. We hit 572 likes on the stream today. Absolutely unbelievable, chat. Thank you for the huge amount of likes today, guys. Really, really special stream today. Tomorrow will be Derailed Alley. Make sure you tune in, everybody. Tune into tomorrow's stream, and I will see you guys then. I physically can't even talk anymore, so I am just going to hop on off of here, chat. Peace out, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for the super fun time today, guys. Appreciate you hanging out. See ya. Oh, crap. Wait, I gotta redo the credits. I gotta redo the credits, chat. There we go.